that ain't gonna work because something ain't working. <laughs> Anyways, hi. <laughs> oh. So I messed something up. I don't know what it is. So we'll just jump in the game. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna have to check on that, like why that intro is not working at all. It's it's fine. We'll move on. Just play a game. How's everyone doing? Hope you're all as excited as I am. We're gonna play High on Life. It's me, Beer. It's you. Oh, I, I forgot to change the stuff, didn't I? Ah, why am I so bad? I forgot to change everything. Oh, I thought I already did that. Let me do that so you don't miss it. Alright, anyways, hi, I'm Beard. Welcome to the stream. Let's conquer this shit together. Let's see if my gaming button's working. Nope, nothing's working. Alright, fuck. Oh. Nothing's working. God damn it. All right, cool. <laughs> I don't know why everything has to break. Man. All right, let's try this. I think I got it. God, it feels like I'm back in like 2015 trying to make this thing capture anything. <laughs> I don't know. Everything broke. Oh, there we go. All right. Any glitches, bugs you may encounter are intentional, satirical, something else. Super pump. Don't know what this is, but that shirt really ups my mood. <laughs> Obviously, it's Buck Thunder too.
Hopefully I won't have to ban anybody today like last week. Check, check, hello, can you read me? Buck Thunder, Buck, Buck, oh, it's me, Bill, your divorce attorney. Welcome to Buck Thunder 2, see no slaughter. Another Buck Thunder game. Your ex-wife is back and more evil than ever. She's sending a bunch of her new blood-sucking boyfriends out. So go shoot them, just kill them all, Buck, that's, that's the... It's me, Phil, your divorce lawyer again. You remember how to move and jump and everything, right? There's shit on the screen that tells you how to do all that stuff. I mean, come on, Buck. This is the second game. You know how to do all this shit. <laughs> all right, Buck, you're gonna have to use the brand new double jump to get over there. Oh, shit, I'm sorry, Buck. I forgot there's no double jump. Just crouch. We gotta try crouching, Buck. Fucking scheduling and scoping bullshit. A fucking crouch prioritized over a double jump. Who is this? Who do, who, who are these people above us? <laughs> Alright, let me change that crouch one. It's gonna get real annoying real fast. I am loaded to game. Alright, that's a good crouch, Buck. That's a good crouch. Good boy. Good boy. Alright. Fucking scoping and scheduling. Bullshit. Fucking double jump. Not more important than a crouch. Who the fuck? Alright, I guess. Stay sharp, Buck. A bunch of your ex-wife's new alien boyfriends. There they are. Coming right at you. Just shoot them, Buck. You remember how to shoot, don't you? Shoot, Buck. That's what I'm talking about, Buck. Kill those fuckers. You're the man. I love you, Buck. You're so fucking cool. Oh, I'm so excited and lit up to be your divorce attorney. You have no idea you're my favorite client. <laughs> All right, Buck, just open that door. It's so fucking easy. Just press the right button. This is just the tutorial part. It's easy. It's the easiest part, Buck. It's the beginning. Oh my god, Buck, you did it. You opened the door. You're a fucking genius. You are my favorite client. It's me, by the way, your divorce attorney. Don't forget, I'm still your divorce attorney. Let's go. Let's get moving. Let's defeat your ex-wife. Landed in your ex-wife's backyard, she fell in love with a leader, and it turns out they're all a hive mind, so she's fucking all of them. What are the odds? I know that's probably what you're thinking, but just get out there and kill the bucket. It's all you can do. Over and out. Oh, the graphics are bad. No, no knocking. I'm busy playing video games. Hey, open up! You gonna hide in there all day? Mom and Dad just left. No, thank you. I'm playing video games. Are you gonna answer me or what? I'm coming in! Why didn't you say goodbye to High mom and school. dad before they left for their trip? You know they were pissed, right? Whatever, we got the place to ourselves now. Too loud compared to your mic. Okay, I'll turn it down in a second. Oh my god, don't give me that look, narc. What are you mad that I'm throwing this party tonight? Fucking strip coke. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. Mom and dad are gone for a whole fucking week. We can do whatever we want. Just straight does coke. Here, come on, not weed, try some. Not drinking or something, just straight up coke. <laughs> you know it's good for your depression, right? Okay, we're totally gonna rage tonight. I cannot wait. I gotta text Jen and make sure she brings the good shit. Uh, did you know she almost got a DUI? Don't tell anyone. That is a secret, but everyone already knows. <laughs> it's really fucked up. Her parents took away her car, which sucks because we could fit two kegs in her trunk. I mean, whatever. I think Oliver's boyfriend has it covered, which... By whoa, 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 it's kicking in. Oh, uh, what is wrong with your face? Um, as I was saying... By the way, they are really not right for each other. Skylar saw them f Oh, what happened?
fighting in the Circle K last week, which I wish I was there because I love watching people fight, but they don't know that. I mean, they do know, but we're acting like they don't know. But honestly, it's really obvious just from watching them. They don't even like each other. I feel like there's no point in picking a face because we're never going to see it. What am I supposed to press? I don't know what to do. Uh, are you listening? Yeah. Ugh, finally, there you are. I felt like I was losing my mind. So, do you want any, or...? Yeah, can I lower the volume now? Alright, so you said... Let's bump this down a little bit. Bump that to eight. Bump that to six. Let's keep it around 65 and then bump this down to seven. Confirm. Can I finally do input settings? It's gonna real fuck with me if that's my crouch button. Ah. Control. I'm sweezy. Yes. Oh, okay. That's gonna be our friend. Nah. Fine. More for me then. All right. I'm gonna go get ready for the party. <laughs> you know, it's the, this it's stuff's so gonna last well me all week. Fentanyl. It is. <laughs> Powerful. No, it's not. It's going to last you about six hours. Unless it's just really that bad. Well, now I'm feeling the frames. Ooh. Are these things on or off? Let me see. <laughs> uh, motion blur is off. These things. Let me put that on real quick. So it's not stuttering or whatever that is. Windows full screen. Yeah, no, no. That was a little cleaner. Kinda of looks like Beavis and Butthead slash AI art. Does look like a bunch of like AI art. <laughs> the darkening. <laughs> we plunge down the gopher hole. And there's me <laughs> there in the middle. Mom told me I was in charge. She did it in secret so it wouldn't hurt your feelings, and Dad said that he flat out doesn't love you. It was actually pretty messed up. <laughs> By the way, Mom left you a note on the fridge. Go read it. Then come meet me outside. I need your help grabbing party shit from the store. Okay. Oh, sweetheart, it would have been nice if you'd come downstairs to say goodbye to your father and I before we left. We hope you know we love you very much, but we can't keep supporting you if you're just going to sit around playing video games all day. You should follow Lizzie's you example. She what? already got accepted into three great schools. I really hope you can get your act together. Why don't you figure out a plan before we get back? Uh, been there. That was after I was part of the military, too. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, what do I do now? Come on. <laughs> I, I don't no want to carry skills. it all myself. <laughs> so, I guess... Holy shit! Oh, what the fuck? Get down and stay quiet. were real. Shang Hawala Ha She Tao hit Gang Wang Hala Wa Can you understand what they're saying? Oh shit, look, it's Mr. Pilfrey. He's got that um what's it called? Uh dementia. What's going on out here? Martha, is that you? Ow! 
Oh my god! Oh my god! What did they just do to Mr. Pilfrey? Oh. I don't wanna know. Hola! Miyamoto! What the fuck is going on? Cho! Yeah, sorry about the spit. I, I, I needed to get you infected with the translator microbes. That, that, that's sort of how it works. I guess you guys don't have those here yet. Listen, my name's Kenny. I'm a Gatlian. Uh, we, we gotta kind of, we gotta oh, move. what is it? Is it talking to you? Maybe we should go back to the Ignore house. Her. It's very important that you listen to everything I say. Okay, it is your lucky day right now. We can survive this together if you just listen to me. Those G3 guys are gonna turn your whole species into drugs. Can you handle a gun? Because, you know, I'm kind of a gun, and if you don't use me, fuck yeah, there we go. Uh, you go on ahead. Uh, I'm gonna stay hidden. The then bank. maybe try to stay back to the house. All right, first kill. I am so glad you picked me up. Let's keep going. Not bad, alien. Not bad at all. Let's head to that base. All right. <laughs> well, here you go. It's a G3 war base. Okay, let's just clean house and warp out of here. No. Nice! You, you, you know, you had to kill them, right? It was either them or you, and me as well, and, and I, I, I would prefer to live. <laughs> you know, and I have a voice here. I have a choice in this. Where did you go? Oh shit, it's the birds! They're tougher! I'm the poster! should be at the top. That's where it always is in shit like this. Just keep going. Keep going up to the top. This must be the place. Shit, this wasn't. Ah, yeah. Don't kill me. Now grab the warp drive. Will you just to warp the hell off this doomed planet? Sorry, no offense. I don't mean to upset you, but yes, your planet is doomed right now. It's like okay, a listen, video don't game worry about the beeping. Life. The beeping's fine. It's just, it's gonna blow up soon. We just need to plug this thing into power. Do you have something back in your house? You live in one of my chums around here? Take this there. We gotta move. We gotta move. Listen, bring me a clue. Your face, you can aim better. All by yourself. I can't. This is all how it's supposed to be. Oh, 
Welcome to Blim City! Did you just warp our entire house to another planet? Yeah, keep up! We'll be safe here! Now take me outside! Whoa, whoa, you're just gonna leave me here in, in what, space? Are we, are we in space? Yeah, sorry, I know you're a bit shaken up, but you'll be fine. It's better than getting enslaved by the G3. Trust me. I guess that's true. How the hell are we gonna get back to Earth? Uh, we can't. That was a one-way trip. We don't have the coordinates to your planet. Then what about our parents and everyone else? Look, we left because we're trying to save them. That, that, that's why we need Gene. So, so can we please go find him? Okay. You're going out there into space? Yeah! Welcome to fucking space! So this is Blim City. Not not bad, huh? I don't know how we're gonna find Gene though. Let's just ask around. There's all kinds of aliens out here. Let's just let's just ask. All right, one sec. Let me uh, mess with the graphics. All right. Bump that to high, high. Close processing. Get to the alien scene. Could be good. He, he is famous. Hey, we're looking for Gene Zaruthi and the bounty hunter. Any idea where he might be? Who? N no. Do you know how many freaking people live here? And you expect me to know this this guy? No. Oh no, of course not. Okay, not everyone's gonna be helpful. <laughs> You can't shoot these open! You, you gotta have something to cut them open, no? Oh. <laughs> Thought it was a person. Uh, almost do. Hello? Get away! They'll take my shit! Oh my god. I it can't be. What do you want? Y you're not the famous bounty hunter Gene Zaruthian, are you? Who's asking? You're, you're really Gene. Yeah, I'm really Gene. That's me, like on the ads. Disappointed? Guess how I feel. Uh, okay, well, whoopsies. Huh. We were gonna ask for your help fighting the G3 cartel, but... Kid, do I look like I can help anyone? I just got evicted. I don't even have a goddamn home. Can, can you point us in the direction of, you know, a, a, a bounty hunter friend that's still working, you know, still has their legs? Ho, 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 ho. Look at that nice house. God damn. Where'd that come from? That's a great fucking house. You see that house? Huh? Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah, th that's this hairy alien's house, the one holding me. Ah, damn. Can't stop looking at that beautiful house. Uh, yeah, okay. The gears are turning. Maybe I can help you. You can? Uh, but you just said... Maybe the... Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, I said I'd help you fight the... Who, who'd you say? The, the G3 cartel? Oh, yeah. Oh, come on, that's crazy, but... Okay, well, whatever, whatever. Yeah, 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 sure. We'll, we'll kill them all. Easy. <laughs> I've got a fully operational bounty suit in my cart over there. Really? Well, that's that's convenient. Yeah, I can turn that hairy kid of yours into a true blue bounty hunter. But if they die, I want the house. That's the trade. <laughs> Are you sure? I don't think they've even fired a gun before today. And and wait, wait you, you want the house in return? Yeah, this is a great deal for you. I mean, you get all my old bounty hunter shit and I might get a house. I, I don't know. Enough you talk. Just, just be a gun for a second. You. Harry kid, put on the suit. See how you feel. Then make a decision, yeah? I can always just pawn this shit off. Okay, g go ahead, try it on. What choice do we have? It doesn't look clean. Wow, you look great, kid. A natural. <laughs> Definitely not gonna die on your first bounty. <laughs> All right, I guess we'll give it a shot, but I, I don't know about this. 
Ah, uh, yeah, shit. It's still in trial mode. I pawned off the activation license. The ticket should be in one of your pockets. Some loose change, too. Should be enough. Take that down to Mr. Keep's pawn shop and he'll get you all set up. The suit will help you get there. Hey there, Gene Zaruthian. It's me, Sudo, your helpful bounty hunting assistant. Before I enable mobility, I just need to make sure your info scanner is online. Can you go ahead and give the area a quick scan for me? Okay, perfect. Great job. I've identified your current objective. Head on down to Mr. Keep's pawn shop. Can you see the waypoint? Perfecto mundo, everything is in working order. Mobility unlocked. You are free to move, Gene. All right. I'll get things set up at your house while you're gone. Ooh, oops, sorry about all those pop-ups. I forgot to warn you about that. Um, you can close them with the interact button, but they are going to keep coming back nonstop. Uh, that's just going to keep happening until you activate the license. Sorry, you better hurry up. Uh, okay, let's just head to Mr. Keeps, I guess. Horse penis. <laughs> you, you able to see okay? Sorry, I, I didn't expect Gene to be l like that. I forgot where I was going. Okay. Oh, God. I, I think Mr. Keep is just ahead. You, you, you got this. What's up, freak? Jorb, greet the customer properly. Welcome to Mr. Keep's dipshit. We're your friendly neighborhood pie shop. Buy something or don't, nobody even cares. Jorb! I'm so sorry. Jorb is insane. Come on up to the counter. Let me help you out. I can't. I can't. It's not letting me. Oh, you me. like that, huh? Oh, you like that, huh? Well, it's mine. You can't have it. I need to. Okay, yeah. Can't see shit. <laughs> oh, so old Zaruthia doesn't feel like pawning his license key anymore. What? Did he win the sweepstakes? Ha! Okay, so you want this license key. But, but it's really nice. I kind of want it for myself. You've got enough useless shit, Dad! Fine, take it! It's yours! Okay, fuck yeah! Activation license accepted. Bounty hunting suit is in perfect working order. Time for an important question. Would you like to keep me on as your permanent in-suit advisor? That was the best choice you could have made. All right, bye-bye now. I'll be back. A uh, bunch. I saw the vulper, yes, actually. <laughs> Whoa, not bad. It's got your vital readings, armor levels, even my biometrics. Gene really came through, didn't he? I told you he'd be great. Perfect. Just what this galaxy needs. Another good-for-nothing bounty hunter. Out of my star! But you got bounty hunter suit stuff. You having fun up there, dipwide, hopping around on our shelves? Have a look around. Jor, be a doll and tell the customer to stop climbing on our shelves. No, I think it's cool they're doing that. I think it kicks Siri's ass. Have a look around. Oh, so you can we actually, got some like, good stuff for things. sale. But not everything. Some of it is mine! <laughs> Loot box. This one costs real actual money. Let's see that PayPal info. Point your credit card at the screen. <laughs> Have a look around. Asset. We got some good shoes stuff for sale. sale. Alien but not everything. Not some of it is mine! sad or noteworthy story, just relaying the facts. Industrial pump looks like a leftover game asset. Someone on the R team just threw it in here, and it is. Good eye. Have a look around. We got some good stuff for sale. Really but not everything. Bounty some scene. of it is mine. Instead of buying this, how about you pick up a copy of Naomi's new logo and free yourself from commodity fetishism? Baby shoes. Never worn. The baby didn't die or anything, by the way. Have a look around. We got some good Why stuff for sale, but not everything. Fit. Some of it is mine. Air tank. Disclaimer. Dad, can I clock out early? No, why? Why are you the cops? I don't owe you an explanation. Yes, you do. I'm your father. And have a look around. Under it, we got so some good stuff for sale, like but not everything. <laughs> some of it is mine. 
looks like a leftover game asset. Uh, someone on the RT just threw it down here. Right. Have a look around. We got some good stuff for sale, but not everything. Some of it is mine. Have a look around. Stupid. We got some good stuff for sale, but not everything. Some everything of it is mine. Was missing. <laughs> oh wait, there's the katanas. <laughs> Perfect for hanging on the wall as a statement piece. The statement is, I think I, <laughs> I think getting laid sucks. <laughs> Have a look around. We got some good Crystal stuff for sale, but not everything. Some of it is it's mine. <laughs> Yeah, sure. Just keep standing there like an indecisive idiot. I'm reading. Bounty suit, extra large. If you get really into protein powder and tank have a look top, around. maybe you can We got some good stuff for food. sale, but not everything. Some of it is mine. That's the same thing. All right, let's get it. All right, bounty hunter. I guess let's head back to the house and check in with Gene. You'll find it. You'll figure it out. Hey, well, don't shoot the hook bug. That's probably somebody's pet. Hey, you can run, you know. I don't know if you do that. Try hitting the button on your screen. I, I can't say the name of the button because I have no fucking clue what kind of controller or keyboard you're using. Coming up this Sunday or whatever day I said on the Alien Channel. Channel 50 whatever I said or 52 I think I said. Hey, it's me. I'm Jimmy Goofster. Welcome to another prank call show with me, the Goofster. Let's let's get our first prank caller on the line. Ring, 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 ring. Hello? Hi. Who is this? It's me, Jim Goofster. I'm the prank caller. Oh, uh, so you're prank calling me? Bingo, buddy, bingo. <laughs> what, 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 is your refrigerator going nuts over there? Is it what? <laughs> is your refrigerator going nuts? What do you mean? What are you asking me? Is my refrigerator going nuts? What does that mean? Oh, it's just like, is it sparking? Is it, is it falling apart? Is the door off the hinges? No, it's, <laughs> my fridge is fine, man. Okay, whoops. Hang it up now. <laughs> Whoa, all right, click. That was not a good one. Let's try one more silly prank phone call. Here we go. Ring, 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 ring. Hey, who's this? It's me, Jimmy Prankster, the... Sorry, Jimmy Goofster's my name. I got confused because I do so many prank phone calls, I called myself Jimmy Prankster by accident. All right. Um, <laughs> why are you calling me? To do a prank! Okay, that, yeah, that tracks, that tracks. What's... <laughs> you know, you kind of ruined it by telling me you're going to do a prank. Whoopsies! My bad, hanging up. Click. Okay, I'm not so good at this. I'm not having a good time. This is a bad episode. This oh, one's really, really fucking dumb. going down the drain. All right, let's try another freaking silly ass prank call. Prank phone call. Ring, 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 ring. Hey, uh, how you doing? Who is this? It's me. I'm the prank phone call guy from TV. Jimmy, Jimmy Goofster. Oh, <laughs> okay. Let, give it to me. I, I can take it. I'm ready for like a good prank. Oh. Perfect, good, I got a good one for you. Um, <laughs> uh-oh, it's me, your doctor. You have cancer. Anyways, what the <laughs> fuck are you doing, man? <laughs> My thoughts exactly. What the fuck are you doing, man? <laughs> I guess we're just dragging dead bodies out now. <laughs> hey, nice house you got here. Real ritzy. Way better than my bench. Oh, wow, you really made yourself at home, huh? Oh, there you are. Who's this weirdo, and why is he setting up a fucking huge alien computer in our living room? Okay, first of all, that alien computer is a very expensive and surprisingly operational Bounty 5000. So, uh, you're welcome. A what 5000? Your kid here thinks they're going to be a big bad bounty hunter. I set them up with some fancy equipment, so they're letting me have the house when they die. Kid, 
They're not my kid. I'm their sister. How old do you think I am? Listen, hairball, I don't know what kind of alien you are or how fast you age. I'm just making my best guesses here. You were only gone five minutes, and you already told some random alien he could move in with us. That's uh, what you did. Look, I, I know it's a lot all at once, but we need him to save your species. <laughs> so do you think you could put up with him for a bit? Well, yeah, if it's going to help, sure. I'm sorry. Everything I've ever known just got flipped upside down. So I don't know what's weird or not anymore. I, I don't like getting up to take shit. So I'm just going to shit right here in the couch later. I don't have to shit right now, but just a heads up. Like that. Was that weird or was that normal? It was weird, right? It was weird. Your mom's <laughs> nice. Anyway. Come talk to me when you're ready to get down to business. Right. So this is your bedroom, huh? It's fine. I mean, I don't, I, don't, I don't really know what I was expecting, to be honest. Is there nothing I can do in here anymore? It's just porn. Feels like porn. So what, we just jump into the deep end and start hunting down G3 officers, or, or what? I'm not sure you're ready just yet. I mean, they don't let you fuck the glumpers at glumpies without a level four fuck pass, do they? Uh, what? <laughs> I don't, I, know, I don't that that know. Well, they don't. Maybe I should send you out on a little test run first, eh? Uh, okay, sure. I've got just the thing. A small-time local gangster by the name of Nine Torg. She took my favorite knife. She's got an operation out in the slums. Maybe you kill her and get my knife back. <laughs> then All we'll right. talk. Maybe take you out to Glumpy's to celebrate. All right, so we, we just head out to the slums? No, moron. You gotta use the Bounty 5000 to initiate a bounty. That's what I went through all the trouble of setting it up for. Okay, Jesus. Torque family matriarch. Commands a small time crime family who claims the Blim City slums as their turf. Uh, constantly stuck in a power struggle with her own clones. Don't underestimate her. Great, so we're gonna accidentally kill a clone. <laughs> or something. Shit. Normally that door would open up a gateway that lets you walk right through it. So what do we do? Calm down. The bounty's right here in Blim. You mind just heading out on foot? The slums gateway ain't too far from here. I'll get the Bounty 5000 all fixed up while you're gone. Yeah, sure. All right, l let's go, Bounty Hunter. Don't forget to get my knife! We're looking for the gateway to the slums, I guess. Look, it shouldn't be too far. L listen, just follow the waypoint. That's why you're wearing that fancy suit, isn't it? I mean, it's, it it's got the augmented reality thing on it, right? I don't worry, he's buried. Rates are on the rise. The city's water supply has clearly <laughs> been poisoned again by Gary the Poisoner. And the mandatory sexual repression chips that we put in our elderly citizens have once again backfired, this time making them far, far hornier than ever. <laughs> However, there's something plaguing our city far worse than any of those issues. Cold, hard drugs. These figures don't lie. However, things don't have to be this way. As chancellor, under my five-year plan, yeah. all sure drugs will be uh, eradicated. And <laughs> that's the Club Nugman promise. Thanks to our new Keep Blim City Clean initiative, we managed to keep drugs like furgles and space meth out of the hands of space our extremely meth. horny geriatrics. No criminal organizations like the G3 cartel have been able to sow their evil seeds in our fair city for now. Remember, we're all in this together. No matter how many surveillance drones we purchase, we simply cannot be everywhere at once, which is why we need you to tell us if you see anything suspicious. Remember our catchy slogan. If you see something, please quickly report it to one of many service representatives stationed all across town. Every report you file against your family and neighbors earns you plug bucks, which can be exchanged for fabulous prizes. So keep an eye out. Only you Sounds can like help so us hits. build a better, safer blim. 
Hello, citizens. I'm Blim City Magistrate Clug Nugman, and I have heard your concerns. Okay. Murder rates are on the rise. The city's water supply has clearly been poisoned again by Gary the Poisoner. And the mandatory sexual repression chips that we put in our elderly citizens have once again backfired, this time making them far, far hornier than ever. However, there's something plaguing our city far worse than any of those issues. Cold, hard drugs. These figures don't lie. However, things don't have to be this way. As chancellor, under my five-year plan, all drugs will be eradicated. And that's the Clug Nugman promise. Thanks to our new Keep Blim City Clean initiative, we've managed to keep drugs like Fergals and space meth out of the hands of our extremely horny geriatrics. No criminal organizations like the G3 cartel have been able to now remember oh, we're all showing in this together things. no matter how many the surveillance people. drones we oh, i think it's the people all right let's go why we call you to tell us if you see anything suspicious remember our catchy slogan if you see something please quickly report it to one of many service representatives stationed all across town every report you file against your family this thing is for hey, don't even think about going down to the slum. Yeah, this is a maintenance-only shaft, so scram! Okay, that's got to be the way into the slums. Here, let me sweet-talk these two um, weirdos. Hey, uh, kid, uh, excuse me, can we get our... Uh, uh, we need to make our way into the slums, please? No. Hold on. So you really want to get into the slums, huh? Then settle a bit for oh, us. Come on, come on. Don't, don't, don't make him answer this no, man. I want to know. It's fine. We'll, we'll help. Okay, great. If you saw us at the bar, which of us would you ask out? Let's say the red one. I, I guess the red guy. Whoa, seriously? Okay, come on. You, you don't got to say that just to make him feel better. He's a big boy. He can take it if you think he's way uglier than No, no, me. no. They said me. They picked me, dude. They picked me, not you. They picked me. They said I was hotter, not you. <laughs> well, it's true. Look at you. I'm not a liar, man. I never lied in my life. I look at you and I see Bill. No, well, well, that's not what they said. They said I. They picked me. I. They said I was hotter. I. Did you say that? That's right. Listen, we're not switching around here. We picked the red guy. That's the direction we're moving in. Thank you. Thank God. Thank you so much for that changing. I really thought you were gonna flake on me. Nah. Thank you. Nah, fuck you. Change your mind right now. Pick me instead. This is insane. I am so much hotter. You, you need to chill out. All right, they picked me, and that's final. That's a final pick. If you want to throw a fit, do it on your own time. Just let me have this one time, man. Hey, <laughs> thanks for being honest. Look, don't tell anyone, but you can go through my door anytime you want from now on. Very catchy, Our little yeah. secret. Free passage in and out of the slums. Wow, cool. thank you. you. You have no idea how helpful that is. Well, my door's locked forever. You made an enemy today. You're never, ever going to get to use my door. Well, you know what? That's fine, because we have this other door that works just as well. No, I'm not shooting this one. Seriously, thanks again for saying I'm hotter. You have no idea what that's going to do for my self-esteem. I'm already feeling it. They were kidding. They were fucking with you. I'm obviously I think we handled so that as best we could, hotter. you know? Hotter. <laughs> He's from fucking Boston. Can I slide? Oh, I want to slide. Sliding has ruined me in gaming. Wow, my friend is taking I've never been topside. Oh, Lord. Oh, it's a topsider. Not interested. Hey, oh my god, I broke my fucking leg coming down that pipe. Be careful. Sorry to hear that. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> you really broke it. Your knee's gone. <laughs> well, well, <laughs> look what we got here. Fresh meat. Hey there, fresh meat. Welcome to the slums, fresh meat. <laughs> oh boy, here we go. Fucking kid. What's wrong, fresh meat? You scared of a little kid? Ah, yeah, I'm a little kid. Look at me. Look at me. Ah, you're scared of me? Oh, I'm scary. Not. <laughs> well, maybe I am. <laughs> Look at me. I'm scary. No, we just want to get past. Come on. 
on, let's see what you got, fresh meat. If you can't handle me, how are you gonna deal with nine Torg's goons? Attention Don't let them get to you. Citizen, you are wearing an unregistered bounty Shit, shirt. we gotta Prepare take down to these die. drones. Oh, shit, fresh whoa, 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 what are you doing? Come on, he's just a kid. Don't shoot him. Oh, you don't want to shoot me. Just I am not shooting a kid. Go ahead, do it. What happened? Durashield pickup. Your bounty suit will automatically generate your vitals after being damaged. Durashield pickups can be dropped by enemies and will give your suit some bonus protection on top of your normal health. Neat. Wait, what happened to the kid? I didn't shoot him. <laughs> Look at fresh meat getting flustered by a little kid. Just ignore him. I that guess suit looks so. dumb. You look like a fucking d d uh, dumb idiot. <laughs> Does that make you mad? I didn't shoot him. The fucking cops did, so not my fault. I don't know, it just looks shiny. You must have met my son. He calls everyone fresh meat. Thanks for not shooting him. Things have been really hard since his annoying dad got shot and killed. It's been hard because even though my annoying husband is gone, my son is still so annoying too. So go ahead and kill him if you really want to. I'm not gonna stop you. Right, I'd love to not there. have any annoying family members left. Up, hey, bro? you can't pass through here. It's Nine Torg's turn. Jesus, enough with everyone getting in our way. We just want to kill Nine Torg. Yeah, right. You kill Nine Torg. Get lost, shit heel. Oh shit, here we go. We're gonna have to kill some of these Torg foot soldiers to prove ourselves around here. These people think we're weak. Not on my watch. What are you, some kind of bounty hunter? The slums are full, asshole. Yeah, this is Nine Torg's turf. The coolest turf. Shit, they're shooting at us. Come on, shoot back. Come on, shoot back. It's gonna be so easy to kill you. Nine Torg trained us real good. We're the toughest enemies in the game. Just make it sound so I know where you are. Toughest enemies in the game, I think. I feel like we're gonna have to move the show. He just got squashed! Wow. I'm losing blood or whatever I stand to have inside. I'm not losing You've been squished! Like, really? <laughs> Suspicious. This is so, this is so yes. I always hated Alien Farm. It still sounds like it's being a little loud. Here, let me turn it down a little bit. Like, it sounds fine in my ears, but I can see it, like, maxing out the audio over there. Let's go, like, 65... Actually, no, we'll keep that at 75 because that sounded good. Or uh, 80, I mean. I'll just bump down this a little bit. 55. Go save. <laughs> so, anyways, it just started blasting. I mean, honestly. <laughs> Time to go to the He said I couldn't do the thing. This fucking hurt. They're so generic. <laughs> There's such generic Just enemies. That hurt. Oh no. <laughs> Who was that? I saw you. Come back! Suck, little buddy. Exterminated! Wow, alright, we got them all. You, usually these Torgs aren't so hostile. Something must be going on. L let's look around for somebody who can help us. I'm so lonely over here. I got all this great information I could share. I'm just sitting here, fishing away, waiting for someone to come over and ask me stuff. <laughs> I'm just gonna whistle to myself for a bit now, till someone talks to me. <laughs> Hello there. All right, I think I'm gonna lower the voice volume a little bit because it's actually kind of blowing up my ears when he's whistling. 
like 75. Done flamed. Friend, can I help you? So, uh, what, what exactly are you doing out here? What? I'm fishing. You can tell I'm fishing, right? Oh, right. Duh, of course. Of course. Sorry. That, it's, it's very obvious. Yes. So, ha have you caught anything? No. Never have, never will. No fish can live down here in this sludge. If there aren't any fish in there, why are you fishing? What's, what is that? What's going on? Because I'm still working up the courage to drown myself. Yikes. <laughs> wow. Okay. TMI, maybe, a little bit. Like so, uh, how do you like living down here in the slums? It's sort of colorful down here, at least. What? Are you serious? This is one of the worst places anyone can live. You can't see that just by looking at it? It's just more sludge nice, than bro. anything else, and the sludge is toxic. Oof, sorry. Yeah, that sludge does look pretty awful. No, the sludge is the best part. It's the quickest way out. Just hop in there, and you got a one-way ticket out of here. Imagine if we didn't have the sludge. Then we'd really be trapped. Anyway, yeah, living here is bad. <laughs> I like it. Uh, you're a wise old fisherman. Can you tell us a little bit about Nine Tor? Quiet. She's got ears everywhere. Or antennae. Whatever ants here with. Is she really that dangerous? Come on. I mean, she's just one gang lord. Just one? <laughs> what about the other eight Torgs? Wait, so the Nine and Nine Torg is... It's a counter? There's Nine Torgs? Nine clones, yep. And that's just what's left. There used to be even more of them, but they always kill each other. Fighting for dominance over what? This hellhole? <laughs> this month, Nine Torgs in charge. Last month, it was 14 Torg before they killed her. Now, Nine Torgs fighting with five Torg. It never ends. Which one do you prefer? Uh, eight Torg is the hottest. <laughs> Man who understands. <laughs> Do you know how we can get to Nine Torg? Buddy, all I know is fish, and I barely know fish. But let's just pretend there's a laundromat you can sneak through to get to Sludge Works over there. Are we pretending, or is there really a laundromat? Come on, kid, take the hint. Either we're pretending, or Nine Torg's goons kill me for squealing. Okay, I got it. We're pretending. Oh, Christ, just follow that path along the sludge. Hey, thanks for the info, uh, wise fisherman. We'll see you later. Have a good day now. I hope you catch something. <laughs> so you're not so bored. Oh, hey, you want to see a cool party trick I used to do? Aim me at those platforms. Come on, come on, give it a shot. It'll be fun. You? Did you see how fun that was? I call it my glob shot. It comes out of my trick hole. All Gatlians trick. have a different kind of trick hole. My, mine does this. Boy, you are running a lot today, aren't you? Yes! Yes! Oh, oh my god, I could do this all day. Do doesn't this fucking rule? God, I love spewing big <laughs> Fuck me, I got some on me. Shit. Oh. <laughs> now I see what I did wrong. Three locations in this gums. slums. My brain. <laughs> Alright, so. Do I jump up there or go in the door? Hmm. I do this. Whoa, perfect shot! You fucking nailed it! How sick was that? Whew, okay. I gotta recharge. It doesn't take too long, but it's a little longer when there's enemies nearby, you know? My, my, my body gets too tense. It's, it's like trying to piss when someone's watching, you know? <laughs> I have no problem with that, so I don't... I don't really get it, just saying. Oh, okay, there's a little bar there. That's where it is. I know what I'm doing.
just for fun, but it is, it's fun, it is. Oh, sorry. Yeah, no, my glob shot takes a little longer to recharge when we're in combat. My, my body's all tense during a fight, you know? So my muscles aren't loose. It takes, long. it takes longer to recharge. Hurry up. And now, juggle them. Keep shooting while they're in the air. You can juggle them, and it does more damage, and it looks cool, too. <laughs> Achievement unlocked. We're all very impressed. Trust me. Let's just juggle in me five times. And... Steps on your ass. I'm just getting warmed up. I can't melee. <laughs> I guess this t looks like he was die clean only. All right, this has to be the way to Nine Torg. So Let's stupid. keep moving. That wasn't very good. Sir. Hey, careful with the merchandise. Whoa, 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 hold up a bit. Let's listen. Line up and everything. They're gonna be here any minute. Oh, just, just be patient. Oi, fuck you! I'm sick of this. I want to tear through someone's guts. Oh, I think they're talking about Jean's knife. Ah, fuck you! Got it, freak. We've had enough of your bullshit. Yeah. Huh? Who's there? Who are you? Uh, hey, hello there, friends. Oh, I, I think it's the buyer. Hey, are you the buyer? Yes. Uh, yeah, we're here to, uh, buy, buy a knife? You guys are selling a knife, yeah? Oh, perfect. You're really late. We were starting to get worried. Just go with it. No shooting. All right, here's the product. A genuine talking knife. I gotta be honest with you. He's a real piece of shit. He's extremely violent. He basically only talks about wanting to kill people in very disturbing ways. Fuck you. I'm gonna carve out your anal cavity. Gonna make it three times as big. Your shit's just gonna <laughs> drop right out of there. <laughs> See what I'm talking about? Oh, uh, perfect. That's exactly what we're looking for. Yeah, yeah, great. Go ahead. Feel free to inspect it. Try him out. See how he feels in your hand. Yeah, yeah, fucking free me. Let's go. Let's go psycho on these fuckers. Oh, fuck that. yes, thank you. Pleased to meet you. I'm Knifey. Now use me, use me. Let me fucking stop these cocksucking you. Before we do that, gotta set the proper input. All right, set F. Mouse button four. Oh, just to fuck! Fuck yes! More, more! I need more stabbing! Hey, you, listen! Point me at your raw, fleshy little tummy and jab me right into there! Let's get all those guts torn up! Let's see that fucking red goop spill out! I can't stop now! Oh, uh, that's a pass for us! Is this really the knife Gene was talking about? Gene? Did you just say Gene? Okay, change of plans. Bring me to Gene! So I can fucking decapitate him! Wait, what? Why? He sent us to rescue you! Oh, that's rich. There's no way I'm forgiving him, though, for leaving me with that fucking Nine Torg. He's dead to me! Huh? You know Nine Torg? We're trying to kill her! Oh, perfect! Finally, we're on the same page! Let's kill Nine Torg, then Gene! Okay, definitely Nine Torg, but l l let's put a pin in the, the whole Gene thing. H how do we get out of here? With my tether ability! I'm more than just a knife, you racist! I can tether Did too! Look up and latch on! <laughs> that was never yeah, there we go. Fucking cool, right? You gotta use me to swing across this sludge. What the fuck are you doing? Didn't you hear me? I'll help you swing off that bug. Oh fuck yeah! Not as good as stabbing, but still pretty good. All right. Where where to next? The sludge works processing plant. Nice. Was talking about two traders she had to deal with. Probably another one of her clones. Five Torg or six Torg or whatever. I don't know. There's too many now. There's too many Torgs. How many clones are there? Who the fuck cares? Stop thinking so hard and just look for the big sludge work sign. I want to stab somebody. Oh, a lug locks. Excuse me. I can open those fuckers up real good. And there's loot inside for you too. Win win. Yes. <laughs> Hundred pesos. So you uh, mentioned that Gene gave you to Nine Torg? Gave? Try gamble me away in a game of space poker. That sack of shit. I'd like to stab all three of his fucking eyes. Even the wonky one. Especially the wonky one. Hate that one. There's my double 
jump. <laughs> what happened to Gene? Didn't he used to be a hero? Yeah, he used to be. Hard to tell these days, right? Towards the end, the only thing I was cutting for him was sandwich. Oh, they look stabbable. Use me. Oh, they look stabbable. Oh, yes. Oh, do this every time. Never fire your Gatlian again. Please, just use me for killing now. Making a knife for you only any percent run. Oh, hey, Thank there's you. some Gatterall. That, 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 that'll fill me back up. Whoa, thank Jesus. Okay, feed me that Gatterall, baby. Come on, put it in my little mouth. Are you trying to edge me or something? I just... Mama, mommy, uh, this stuff. Trying to edge me. <laughs> this shit's really funny. Works. Nine Torch should be here. The legendary ant killer approaches, and they've obtained the fearsome Night of Death. Oh, brother! Fight, my ant brethren! Fight for your lives and avenge our fallen. Reinforcements are here. I think I sprained something. I'll be honest. I really want you to use my glob shot. <laughs> hey, where'd you go? Really powerful. Do you feel powerful? We're unstoppable. Is this bloodlust? Am I feeling bloodlust right now? Oh man, I guess I am. Nightor must be close. Let's ride this wave and kill her too. I want to fuck her up real good. You're making me do this. Somebody, if you don't die, be my pet, Lord be. How dare you make the enemies feel like they have other responsibilities? Looks like they brought back up. came over me there. I think I got caught up in the moment or something, but hey, good work, Man, team. Let's, let's go get Nine Torque. Any last words, Five Torg? Is that Nine Torg talking? Fuck off! I've always said you were the worst Torg. You know, Seven Torg said the same thing right before I killed her. Damn you! And you're next. You got this! Hey, I'm still here. 
can not still doing use this me thing. You want. I can reflect attacks, did you know that? I'm not just all about stabbing. Well, I'm mostly all about stabbing and tethering, but I can also deflect attacks. I'll slice in the fucking deck. I'll cut their fucking heads off. I'll cut their limbs off. I'm gonna fucking cut them right into them. I'll cut their fucking asshole off and eat them. Yeah, bitch! Look, here I am. Did you miss me? Are you even okay. a real bounty hunter? Yeah. Back. Reels again. Bounty Hunter, I, I feel pretty good. I, I, I really didn't know if we'd be able to pull it off. All right, it's time. Time for what? Time to carve out a piece of her. I'm thinking we go with a full slab of thigh meat, but since it's your first, I'll let you pick. Jesus, are you are you kidding? What kind of Bounty Hunters don't know that you've got to bring back proof of the kill to get paid? Oh, God. Oh, don't be such a goddamn baby. I'll do all the messy work. Just go up to a corpse and let me go wild. Oh, God, I can't look. I can't, I can't. Have fun. Oh, fucking hell, she's a gusher. Couldn't we have just taken, like, a fingernail, some spit, a, maybe a blood sample? Yeah, sure, could have, I guess. Hey, I'm Five Torg. Thank you for killing my evil clone. I don't mind if you mutilate her corpse, really. It's fine. You did such a good job. That was, like, off the hook. You're not going to take over and end up being just as evil as Nine Torg, right? Oh, don't worry. Things are going to be a lot different around here. So no more crime then? Oh, not that different then. Technically, all of us Torgs are evil clones, so I'm still going to do a bunch of crime. But we're cool. Huh. Far as I'm concerned, you're a friend of the Torg family and welcome here anytime. An honorary Torg. You can be ten Torg. Now, if you'll excuse me, my day just became very full. Are you gonna be okay if we just kind of leave you hanging up there? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, I can get down just fine. Hanging from ropes feels nice for my species. Hey, it's good for our backs. I'm, I'm actually the one who put myself here. Okay. How do I get over there? Oh, yeah, well, hey, hey, what are you nice. doing? Thanks for the rescue. Uh, don't mind me. I'm just gonna hang here for a bit. Yeah, next time you come back, I'll be off being so really busy running everything. You know, doing stuff. Because 
Yeah. All right, let's go home and turn in our first bounty. Oh shit, why would you go in here? What's wrong with you? Hey, you know, that was some pretty solid bounty hunting back there. I mean, I mean don't, don't get too cocky about it or anything, but it was pretty cool. Yeah, not bad. That was some good killing. And I'm somewhat of a killing expert, actually. I can't wait to see Gene's face when he sees we pulled this off. Let's head back up through the slums tunnel. I don't know why that guy even bothered attacking us. I almost feel bad. All right, so we left behind some of those chests around. Um, let's see if we can find some. They have money. I don't think the money is actually worth anything. Gene hooked up with this messenger thing. He says you're dead, but he's full of shit. You still fucking around there? Can you try and find some food? Humans can eat? Oh, we didn't have food in the house? Hey, uh, you know, feel free to keep exploring, but whenever you're ready, we just gotta go through the tunnel that we came here in. You know, that tunnel? Take me to Gene and let's stab him in the gut. Wah! <laughs> I think there was one or two of us across here. It was like right around there. Christopher Walken? Hey, I'm walking here. This is New York City. Yeah, pretty good, right? Ah, oh, the translator, Mike Chris. We're thinking about two different people, but same kind of thing, same kind of idea. kind of sweet. I guess not. All right. Oh, great. Yeah, let's go into the toxic shit. How dare it be constantly too far away? Oh, okay, and this is where I climbed out. I see one more chest around here. No, I don't know. Screw it. Hey, you don't have to run everywhere. You know, you might want to slow down and enjoy the scenery once in a while. Look at this place.
Oh wait, there it is. That justifies all the backtracking. <laughs> oh, hey, look. It's a dude. I don't have anything that can let me go that far yet, so don't worry about it. Alright, let's get out of here. He won't be needing this. If you want to be lame about it. Well, look at that stamina. You, you must have been on track team or something. <laughs> I like a game that's self-aware like that. <laughs> it's just like, damn, you've been running a really long time. Now what? I ain't letting me go that way. I got a backtrack then, like in the literal sense. Unless I can jump up there. I can jump up the thing. Haha! <laughs> God, I cannot imagine a universe without the G3. You know, they, they, they've just always been there, operating in the shadows, skirting the law. Everybody's too scared to take them down, so so they just keep doing all their evil shit, enslaving planets, kidnapping useful species. Huh, are we sure we're gonna be able to do this? I feel like someone more powerful than us should be doing this, honestly. <laughs> Oh, you're back. Hey, yeah, my leg's still very broken. I don't know why this tunnel makes it lag so hard. Hey, fuck you! I'm still pissed at you! Hey, I hope you had a good time in the slums. Come visit any time. Just don't talk to me. I'm making them far, far hornier than ever. However, there's something plaguing our city far worse than any of those issues. Cold, hard drugs. These figures don't... What's over here? Nothing. Hello? Hi, is this 
Filippo's pizza? I want a pizza now! I want it right now! Do you get me? Not in 30 minutes or less or whatever. I need it instantaneous! And I know we have the tech for that. Why are you still delivering pizzas by foot? Just zap them to me! There's like 10 different ways you can do it by now. Portal door, warp base, anything. I don't care. Just get it to me right now! Wait. Never mind. I'm not hungry. Bye. What the fuck? <laughs> I thought it was a space wiener. I mean, it's kind of a space wiener. Let's save the homicidal urges for the bad guys, okay? True, true. That you're having a real fucking good time messing around with your new toy suit. Seriously, you better not be dead. Welcome, valued customer. Yeah, that's right. Don't buy anything. Buy all the hostility, sir. Where I saw one around here, unless we didn't go this way yet. Oh, here it is. Ah. Yeah, because I think I saw it down over that way. Over yonder. It's been so long since I felt the touch of another! Do you want a hug? Hey, watch where you're going! Well, alright. <laughs> I was gonna say, I'll take one for the team. Hey, sorry, yeah, no, he can't talk. He just sort of makes that noise. Huh, that's, uh, that's unfortunate for him. Hey, listen, uh, if you find a drum anywhere, my buddy Globo here, you know, he'd really love one. He's great, he's a good drummer. And I think it would help him, you know, he's a good musician. I think it would, he, trust me, it'd be worth your time. Yeah, you know, uh, we'll, we'll keep an eye out for you. Back these away. Let's see how much it is. Maybe if I do something nice for you, you'll do something nice for me in the future. But if not, that's cool too. Hey, did you forget something? All right, you're all set. Have a one. Oh, neat. Storm's mandible. Just a drum. Can we hear it? Wonderful day. Wait, what am I supposed to have? Oh, the cards and stuff? Ah, oh, neat. Rules before posting. I okay, so there's a whole forum thing we can look at later. <laughs> God, you found the kid a drum, right? Is this for him? Can he have it? Yeah, yeah here, it's yours. Enjoy. Oh, thank you so much. He is so excited and grateful. He's not going to let you down. This was a good use of your time. Thank you so much. Well, what do you know? Fuck it. That fucker's pretty good. He's a farty boy. All right. I'm Blim City Magistrate Clug Nugman, and I have heard your concerns. Murder rates are on the rise. The city's water supply has clearly been poisoned again by Gary. And our elderly citizens have once again backfired, this time making them far. All right, let's see that loot! I feel like this is illegal. <laughs> they, they look like living things somewhat. However, things don't have to be this way. As I'm Chancellor, under my five-year plan, all drugs will be eradicated. 
And that's the Klugnugman promise. Thanks to our new Keep Blim City Clean initiative, we've managed to keep drugs like Virgil. Hey, I'm Pimple Pete. Hey, I'm Pimple Pete. I'm. Hey. Hey. Huh, why is the door closed? Pallet of pallets. I want to stop everything. Who is it? You know, you got my munch dash delivery? For you. What? No, it's us. Oh, shit. Really? Good job. Oh, hold on. Is that Gene? Okay, get ready. I want you to stab me right into his fat little belly. Let me, let me show you an example of what I have accomplished with one of my clients. Listen, this guy changed my life. What the hell, Gene? He installed new locks because he assumed you'd get killed. He keeps saying it's his house now. What? No. I just took the liberty of upgrading your security. Did you really kill Nine Talk, though? Yeah, we actually did. Well, well, well. Didn't think you had it in you. I'm really blown away. I'll be honest with you. I expected you to die. Oh, thank you. So, what did it feel like? Killing nine tog. Look, I gotta be honest, it felt good. It felt great. I mean. Hey, Gene, lift up that shirt and expose your soft little belly for me. I'm coming in hot. Yes. <laughs> Forgot how psycho he was. Why don't you just, uh, hold on to him for now? Oh, sure. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll keep him far away from you. Yeah, thanks. Now, uh, go turn in your bounty at the Bounty 5000. I got it all set up for you. No, seriously, let me stab him. I'm trying. It won't let me. Ah! What the fuck? Don't you have to do everything the, the fucking PG. UI tells you to do? Yeah, fuck yeah. Fuck you, Gene, you piece of shit. Oh, but, shit, sorry. <laughs> it's fine. I've lived through worse. Okay, he's tough. Let's try again later then. <laughs> Let's try again later. <laughs> Don't worry, Gene, later we're getting round two so, up in that ass. So, <laughs> what, you're some sort of bounty hunter now? What are you going to say for humanity? You only kill the bad guys, not the good ones. Yeah, pretty cool, right? Are you proud of your sibling here? <laughs> I mean, not really, but you you enjoy. You enjoy. Yeah. I should have killed the other Torg just for funsies. Turn in the bounty. Well, there you go. You're a real bounty hunter now. Yeah, huh, rich. would you look at that? I, I guess we're really doing it. Like yeah, I didn't expect you to get your foot in so quick. I don't even have any leads on any G3 bounties. You ever uh, serious about going after them, huh? You bet. Well, we'll take them all down, including Garmantuous. Well, you're welcome to try, and if you do, you might want to go to the pawn shop and buy back the Dodge unit I pawned off. Forgot to tell you about it. Go scrounge up some pesos and buy that, or whatever else tickles your fancy. I'll have some G3 bounties ready for you by the time you get back. Sure, sounds good. Thanks, Gene. Just maybe next time don't assume we're just going to die. Right. Got it. So, uh, what kind of stuff did you do in here? Like, anything gross? You're really going to need that Dodge unit from the pawn shop. The suit's not really complete without it. I wanted to hear what knife you had to say about my own. Look, I know Mr. Keeps annoying, but you gotta put up with him and buy back that Dodge unit. <laughs> okay, fine. You don't wanna go to the pawn shop? Well, I'm not doing any more research on the G3 until you do. Denise Richards. <laughs> well, that makes it very confusing, because commercials are usually designed to be heard from outside of the room, you know, so mm -hmm. it's just gonna be confusing to know who's talking if you're doing my voice. Well, that's too bad. People should be smarter. Arby's. <laughs> ah, it's open, Bo Gouch! <laughs> hey! Eat that hungry frog! Hands off! my restaurant! I'm Hungry Frog. We got red pop here, and that's it. We just have red pop. No food! Stop asking! For food, we don't have it. Hi, uh, I, I'm just wondering if I can order a burger. No, hungry <laughs> flats. Hello, I'm the last member of this species coming here to tell you that I want to fuck another species. You see, 20 years ago, my whole species died off in a nuclear war. And I haven't been fucked since then, because I have this weird genital thing. 
But if you have something that is compatible with my little thing, if you want to look at it real quick, I'll show it to you from all angles. Here, you see it this way. Now I'm going to turn, and you see it this way. Now I'm going to turn. This is the front. This is the angle you saw initially. <laughs> this is uh, the thing. This is how I would typically get fucked. And I just want somebody to fuck me. Thank you. Hey, listen, sorry to interrupt, but I'm not compatible with your genitals, but I, I quite like them. You like what you see? 100%. Oh, uh, thank you. Are you film? What is this? Are you filming a, what, what, what's with all the cameras? I'm sorry to interrupt. I put on this little sick little fuck show to get me fucked. Oh, I see. <laughs> <laughs> It's like a really, really bad <laughs> Get me fuck this little sick boy. Hello, I'm Darren Mindbanger. Everyone, <laughs> My gather dream. around. I'm about to do a really crazy trick. What? We can't hear you. I'm about to bang your mind. Um, Show me what's in your pocket. What, what are you doing? I will guess what's in it's your Chris pocket. Get the Mine. fuck away from me. What, okay. what you... I have a deck of cards. Get the fuck. And one of the yeah. cards is marked with a signature. You're trying, you're like grabbing at me. My arms just kind of do whatever they want to do. Please go away. I'm, I'm daring my banger. Hey, I'm Pimple Pete. I'm going to put me on Pimple's palette and put in the... Put everything in the in the in the in my palette of palettes. I want to stop everything, you know, that's happening uh, for you. I don't care about me. It's for you. I'm Bubble Beat. I'm people putting it. Put. I'm gonna put the pal 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 in the thing. Let me sh let me show you an example of what I have accomplished with one of my clients. Listen, this guy changed my life. I started out as like a weak, scared, fragile. And now, I, now I'm going around super confident, you know, I don't have any pimples, not that that's really sort of the thing. But anyway, yeah, it's great. That's right, I'm gonna be a bleed, and I'm gonna tell you what happens I like with this. Texas, I, dude. I, get the fuck out of here. I'm gonna be able to tap it though. So stop it and take a look at me uh, and I'll see you at my customer line. Shook alone or no pallets. <laughs> Hi everyone, this is uh, this is the bad TV show. It's a TV show that's not good. Um, the whole idea here is that it's just nothing good happens on it. All right, well I'm the main character. My name's Pubus. It's P O O B U S. It's not a good name. But nothing Pubis. about this show is good. So uh, don't know why you would have expected it to be good. I'm just gonna stand here for a little bit, and like uh, you know, it's not, a, it's not good. Right it's not entertaining <laughs> to watch, but it's uh, it's right there on the the tin. It's the bad TV show, not a good one. Okay, um, maybe next I'll just sort of not talk for a little bit. I'll just stand here. It won't be good when I do that, but uh, you know, I'm just gonna do it anyway. And you know, we gotta wrap this up pretty quick, because if it goes on too long, it starts getting into that like anti-comedy thing and actually becomes good. So, you know, we're probably gonna end the show pretty soon. So don't uh, don't start raving to your friends about how how, how avant-garde this is or anything. It's not. It's just uh, I'm standing here being boring. <laughs> <sighs> yep, my name's Pubis. And uh, you yeah. know. I'm not, I don't even want to move. I'm just going to stand silently. Here comes my friend, uh, Greenbow. Greenbow, how you doing? Hey! I'm doing great. I'm uh, actually having a very good day. I found a 20 peso bill on the ground. Oh, that's, that's really cool. Um, anything else happened to you? No, no, just this 20 peso bill thing. That's it. Anything, like, exciting coming up in your life? Anything, uh, you know, sad maybe happened to you? Any, anything just uh, that's not baseline boring? Well, no, I thought the 20 peso thing was kind of exciting. You know, maybe more exciting than this show usually gets, so I, I just figured I'd share that. But nothing else, really. Nothing sad, nothing happy. Just normal. Okay, yeah, well, um, see you later, Greenbow. Have a good day. All right, well, I will. I'll try my best. Might be a might be a bad day, 
Most likely just going to be a neutral one, though. Not good, not bad. Well, you know, um, this is the bad show, so if it's neutral, that's still actually pretty good for what we're aiming for. Well, it's too bad uh, I'm not really a big part of the show. I'm just this one segment. So see ya. All right, well, uh, thanks everyone for watching the bad show, the bad TV show. It's not good. All right. I love you. Goodbye. I'm home. Oh, oh, wonderful. You're home. I've been, w I, look at, the dinner's cold I prepared for us. <laughs> Where were you? I was just, just doing smuffle guffins. You know, smuffle guffins, like just regular old plain smuffle guffins. You knew this. I don't think I could stay married to somebody who just blatantly does smuffle guffins. Well, I don't know what to tell you. I am a smuffle guffin from life to death. I will be a smuffle guffin person all the time. And that's why, are we getting a divorce? Cause that's where the draw, that's where I draw the line. All right, listen, we are getting a divorce and that's why you gotta watch Alien Channel 5102. The newest reality show about us getting a divorce because she's into smuffle guffins and I'm trying to cook a delicious dinner for the two of us and she's not here and it gets cold because she's out fucking smuffle guffin' Lynn. Check it out. It's very entertaining. We'll see you there. Welcome to Pepperoni P Palace. I'm Pete, the pepperoni salesman, and we are, we, today we have a great special. Get over here, come on. I, I, I'd rather not, I'd rather not, I'm gonna go ahead. No, get over here, sit down, <laughs> eat the pepperonis, come on. Eat I'm chopping, I'm chopping, I'm My going. pepperonis, I'm Popo the pepperoni no, boy. I, listen, I really, I know I, they don't I, look like pepperonis, they're very bizarre and strange looking, but just eat it no, and, I, I, uh, stop. Uh, you, no, you just have to eat it. Leave me be. Okay, I hold on, hold on, no, before you go. leave. Let me just finish my commercial. I'm Papo. This is my pepperoni place. Eat the pepperoni. Oh, and here we are. And then Oh, okay. Ah! Oh, they keep, oh, they keep shocking me because that's what we sell here, our shock rods. And, and they made me run a full mile before we, we could start to shoot. Ah! The, uh, okay, so we have the best shock rods, the most powerful, awful shock rods. Ah, that fucking shock you really bad. <laughs> if you need to shock somebody or shock anyone else or shock yourself, if that's the thing, you, you, you gotta just come to us and like, oh, god damn, oh, fuck, oh, oh I'm gonna fuck, okay. All right, so uh, uh, just go to us and we'll, we'll go fill your shock rod needs. Oh, okay, j j just read. Check us out at www.shockcollaralienprotectionoffensive, making sure that people won't hurt you.com. Oh, <laughs> if you if you want to have prisoners, oh, no, I mean if you want to have guests who are voluntarily there, that's what you, you go to that website. Okay, see ya. Hey, eat that hungry frog. That's my restaurant. I'm Hungry Frog. We got red pop here, and that's it. We just have red pop. No food. Stop asking. Where was I going? I forgot the whole what I was supposed to be doing. Why do I have to stand specifically here so you update? Oh yeah, so let's buy the dodge unit thing. Hey, uh, Gene said you might have the old dodge unit that goes with this bounty suit. Oh yeah, we got that. Why? You want it? I want it too, so it'll cost ya. Uh, yeah, yeah, no, we, we know how buying stuff works. Can you even read? Oh, what's that smell? Did one of you beef it? Sitting here or something. Dodge unit, dodge unit, dodge unit. Hey, whoa, easy there, Toncho. We gotta buy the dodge unit first. Dodge unit. Hey, uh, I really don't give a shit if you make a mess in here, but I'm supposed to tell you to cut it out. Cut it out. <laughs> uh, 
I were a dodge, you know what I'd look like. Let's buy the dodge unit. Alright, so where's the freaking dodge unit? Oh, there it is. You could try and dodge without this thing, but it's not going to be nearly as effective or cool. This is how professionals dodge, with a dodge unit that sort of warps space around you in such a manner that you're able to dodge really fast. <laughs> All right, there you go. One dodge unit. Have a nice life! All right, we got it. Let's try this bad boy out and then head back to Gene. Finally, don't get the hell out! Well, that's kind of annoying. I'd rather be like space bar than that. Making sure that people won't hurt you. Dot com. If you if you want to have prisoners. Ow! No, I mean if you want to have guests who are voluntarily there. That's what you really go to that website. Okay, see ya. Mr. Keepster. Hello, I'm the last member of this species. Coming here to tell you that I want to fuck another. Okay, great. You got the dodge unit. So how about it? Think you're ready for the big leagues, kid? What, what do you mean? The big league. The G3 cartel. That's the next step. Taking down their head officers. Okay, um, are you, are you're positive that we're ready for that? Yeah, whatever. Might, might as well try. But they won't be pushovers like Nine Torque, so, uh... Well, to be honest, I don't care if you live or die. You know that. You know my whole deal. But, uh, hey, it's your funeral. So go check out the Bounty 5000 whenever you're ready. Got two G3 leads for you right now. Krubus and Douglas. You can pick which one you want to let kill you first. kidding me we had to get here when there's a goddamn sandstorm going on bunch of fucking sand in my eyes no you're you got a helmet on no i don't i don't sure you can navigate through this? I, I I can't even tell which direction we're going anymore. Of course I can. Okay, mamma mia! Free money. What's over there? Looks like ding stuff. It is so fucking dangerous out here with this fucking weather. You never know what kind of shit's gonna fly into your. F Wait, what's that sign? Sandworms. Oh shit, that's right. Okay, yeah, we we, we gotta be really careful. Well, you know what that means. Oh shit, Greebles. Look, look at them go. They eat up broken ship parts. Does it taste good? I no idea. I'm not. I'm not about to give it a taste test. 
Holy shit, that's a big worm. Oh, it is. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah, no, you, you can kill these guys. Nobody cares. They're just like, you know, guys to shoot. Watch it. Distance. You know, that was the first settlement out here, pre G3. We gotta pass through there to get to Douglas. I heard scavengers used to suck in freighters with a big magnet and loot them. Trash Babies number five. Oliver loves spending all his time on websites and getting his brain all fucked up on from them. The only thoughts his brain can still generate at this point are either vaguely racist or about sexy cartoons. Online Oliver. <laughs> this Pepe sticker. Their cargo. You know, I mean, this place is fucked. You know, Port Turin. Here we are. Yeah, a wreck like this is pretty normal on Port Turin. You know, this asteroid's always been a lawless land, but now that the G3 set up shop, it's even worse. Join now for extra savings. Whoa, 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 careful! Hey, hold on. You know, maybe we can use that to our advantage. Satan's call this number, call me dead. Call me dead? Yeah, this is probably a lot of fun for you, but uh, I've, been on a, I've been on a lot of adventures, and uh, I can tell you firsthand that this is uh, pretty lame. So let, let, let's let's get to the good stuff, all right? Crying. My trick hole's ready for you. Let's glob them. I am so proud of you, son. You look, you look so good, son. <laughs> Hey, we all gotta go sometime. All right, seriously, I I'm getting sick of the desert. Can we just move on to the next bit, you know, please? Nice shot, bounty hunter. Nike hasn't said anything about these guys. Look, I'm just saying, my glove shot might be helpful, you know? Yeah, I know it would be. I can see Old Town. It's just across this bridge. Beams. And, uh, you know, I'll tell you what. Hey, hey don't, don't fucking shove us!
my glob shot, you know? Whoa, 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 hey, tough whoa, guy. Whoa, hey, whoa. hey, look, walk wherever you want. This is a fucking Mac and Cheese Brothers construction site. We ain't done here. Hey, but you gotta be careful. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Hey, calm down. What the hell? How do you want to handle this? Maybe we just, you know, move past Are you kidding me? You think you could just walk up into a Mac and Cheese Brothers construction site like you're some sort of fucking Jesus Christ and just fucking walk around like you own the place? There's a goddamn bottomless pit over here, asshole. You think you could survive that? Falling through a fucking bottomless pit down to the bottom? I don't think so. We got work to do. Whoa, whoa, okay, whoa. dipshit. Get the fuck out of here, hey, asshole. You know? Hey. Holy shit. Well, that's one way of dealing with them. Jesus Christ. Who the fuck are you? I mean, those could have been good guys. You know, it could have been on, it could have been on our side. They could have had quest lines, storylines, gifts. <laughs> what are they called uh, in a video game? Um, items, you know? And you killed them all. Jesus. Well, way to close a door. But let's just keep moving. We got it. We got it. We got some platforming up ahead. I will say, Knifey's being really quiet right now. It's kind of weird. Oh, so there was a word. Okay, yeah, I, 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 I'm the, I'm the, I'm the, I can help with this. Oh my god, you messed that up. Come on, you just gotta bounce it off the wall. Come on, are you serious? You got this. Oh, Come on. Okay, yeah, yeah, you're one of those. You're having trouble. Okay, just try taking your time and aiming aiming the shot. Hey, nice work. You know, it wasn't a hard thing, but n nice work. I just wasn't paying attention. <laughs> All right, Old Town. We just move through this place and we'll, we'll get to Douglas. Where's all my frames going? Hey, you whippersnappers looking to get into Old Town? Hey, we should talk- Howdy there, partner. Welcome to Old Town. They call me Old Wet Grundy. How can I help you? Do you know where Douglas is? Why do they call you Old Wet Grundy? So, uh, why do they call you Old Wet Grundy? It's cause I'm old and I piss myself every day. I'm doing it right now. You're, you're <laughs> pissing yourself while you're talking to us? Oh, <laughs> yeah. Big time. It's still going. Ooh, this is the good one. Yeah, there's a lot of them. <laughs> I was gonna say it's wet everywhere. <laughs> So, uh, well, you know, tell us, what, what, what is this place? Well, I just told you it's called Old Town. Back when settlers first landed on this asteroid, we formed a little trading post free from galactic law, where anyone could come and do as they please. Nowadays, Dragstown steals all the thunder, but for a few years there, Old Town was nothing to sneeze at. All right, so Old Town is the Old Town, and Dragstown is the, the, the new one? Old Town has heart. Used to serve a real purpose for the people. Dragtown is just a pit of debauchery and drugs. The concern G3 cartel. And how do we get to Dragtown? It's 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 been a little bit for me. Oh, that's easy. You just go through this gate, pop into Old Town, and shoot straight down the main strip. You can't miss the big Dreg Town entrance. It's a real goddamn eyesore. Wish they'd get rid of it. I'll open the gate for you. Oh, well, thanks, Grundy. That's old Wet Grundy. And of course, opening the 
against my whole job. It's why I'm here. I'm happy to do it for some charming young women's numbers like you. Hey, do you happen to know where we can find a, a, a guy named Douglas? Douglas? The, 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 the G3 fella? <laughs> oh, wee. He's a rough one. Never seen somebody drink as much as him. Why, just last night, uh, nobody, I shouldn't speak out of turn. The G3 don't like that none, and I don't like them. Just head down to Dread Town. I'm sure you'll find them. So one crash. Seems to be gone. <sighs> okay. Let's go check that out over there real quick and see if it breaks again. Shootout! Who would have fucking thought, you fucking bitch? 
You fucking stupid bitch. I'm sorry. I, you know, listen. I. This is an old west shootout. It's cool. Yes, yes, of course, I'll marry you. Yes, I love you more than anything in the world. But since I'm gonna suffer here, I'll, I'll prepare to be. All right, let's. Can we just wrap this up and find Douglas? Okay, the red town's past here. I just stand around and tell people that. Hey, sorry, excuse me. Is I, I just curious? Is is uh there a fella named Douglas down there? What, like G three Douglas? Uh, yeah, it's his job to be down there. I heard he was partying pretty hard last night, though. <laughs> Got butt cheeks. That way we already have whatever that green mist upgrade thing is. Hey, I can't let anyone in right now. There's too many recruits causing trouble in town. I get in trouble when that happens, so I'm gonna keep the gate locked until they stop. Or get killed. Wink wink. Are you telling us to kill them? Whoa, I didn't say that. I just said wink wink and okay, yeah, that's what I meant. So go kill him and, and I'll let you through. Oh, you want to talk to me? You got some questions for me? Yeah. What's it like living? How, how do you like, you know, li living in Dregtown? Oh, of course. There's always a ton of cool shit to do. Uh, gambling, shows, dodging straight bullets. This month they got Zubles doing a big show on the main stage. I'm gonna go see him and ask him to marry my daughter. You only get one shot, you know. What's Dregtown? Can, can you tell us a little bit about Dregtown? Oh, it's your classic den of sin and villainy stationed on the underside of an asteroid. You know the drill. The, the G3 kind of runs things unofficially. They're just everywhere down there. They, they got a whole training facility and everything. So, you know, classic shit, like I said. Okay. What's your job? I mean, do, do you or like do you sitting like... here guarding this gate? Seems kind of boring. Oh, I hate it. Worst job I've ever had. All the new G3 recruits come busting in and out all day and all hours running around shooting the place up and causing trouble i'm always really freaked out i'm gonna get shot and die but <laughs> hey it's a living <laughs> so uh you know i'm just just making small talk here i guess but wh what do you wh wh what do you do for fun oh plenty i usually go down in a drag town and get fucked up i love doing fergals but i've been hearing great shit about those new humans uh, yeah i've been saving up to try some out oh oh, oh and i've been binging space version fraser space version all right, who didn't I kill yet? Apparently some people need more killing. Yeah, shoot it! Shoot the can! Fucking blammo! Oof, more drunk what? recruits. Have you learned anything from Douglas? I'll get it this time. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah! Woo! Woo! Yeah! <laughs> oh, woo! <laughs> the G3 payroll must be fucking a million miles long. I mean, Jesus. These little guys barely even count. mysterious feeling that there's probably some more G3 causing trouble, you know, somewhere around town. We, we should we should maybe d deal with it. Hey there, fella. You're not from around here, are you? <laughs> I guess that sounds like kind of a cliche thing to say, doesn't it? But no, I'm genuinely asking. My name's Kate Mittens. Well, not really. Everyone calls me Kate Mittens because one time I got real drunk and stuck my hands into a big cake. They thought it was so funny. They started calling me Cake Mittens so much that I forgot my real name. <laughs> Even my parents can't remember. What do you want? You new to old town? You think it's okay to just walk up to a stranger and talk to them? Because, yeah, it's, it's fine to do that. There's no laws here. Go ahead. <laughs> Hey, fat 
Butterfinger Flutie's my name, and Trungle Funk's my game. Oh, yeah, no, I, we, we, we don't know what the fuck Trungle Funk is. Oh, you look confused, but I can tell you want to hear my sweet flute tunes. Am I right or am I right? You're right. Park your rears and clean your ears. It's Trungle Funk p- Flute Time. Okay, you know what? I, I'll admit it. This is good. This is good. It's so jiggly. Most species is really alcohol resistant, so I just buy so much more alcohol just to get even the slightest buzz. Sometimes I just pay for three kegs right off the bat, and if I'm lucky, I can drink them fast enough to feel feel something. Someone actually had to record that. Taking my trigger, unless you want to give me a tip. Hey, welcome to the Old Town Saloon. It's just a regular Old West style saloon. You get the idea. Sorry, nothing here but my company. Now, what can I do for you? Okay. Y'all have fun. Strange, I haven't heard of you. Almost at all. Uh, my name's Kento. You probably have heard of me. I go to all the town hall meetings and complain about all the G3 recruits coming up to Old Town and causing a ruckus every day. I'm pretty famous. the same button as the interact button. Oh shit, more G3 causing trouble. Come on, we just want a little kiss. Come on down and bang us. Uh, what are you, serious? I'm a 90-year-old Lorgorian. <laughs> That's fine with us. Yeah, we don't mind. You think you're hot. Hey, butt out. Yeah, we're allowed to harass people.
killing these weak fucks doesn't do anything for me. All right, looks like things have quieted down a little bit, you know? Th thanks to us, you know? Quite a team we are. Anyways, uh, l l l l let's, uh, let's poke our way into Dregtown now. Let's go to Dregtown. Thank you so much for saving me. Oh, my God, thank you. Uh, but you know what? I kind of... I'm kind of thinking I would have fucked him. So now I... I don't know. I'm gonna go think about that. See you later. <laughs> kind of wanted to get a better image of what a 90-year-old in their species looks like. Hello, kid. Thought I'd give you some tips for the massive bounty. Yeah, good thing you like running so much, huh? Tip one. Remember to shoot enemies and kill them. You did it! The town's all cleaned up! I keep tap I don't know how many attacks. times I've told the recruits hurt. not to cause trouble out there or if someone's gonna kill them. You told us to kill tomatoes, them! Tomatoes, potatoes. Okay, I'm just a dumb gate guard. Whatever, head on through. Ooh, you heading down to Drag Town? It's way cooler than Old Town. I, old Town's a boring dust bucket, I'll tell you that much. I hate Old Town. I just stand around here telling people how much Old Town sucks. That's what I do. That's my, that's my cool, that's what I, that gets my rocks off. Oh, that's a little fluffy dude. Are you going to join the G3? You look tough. I bet they'd love to have someone like you. What happens if I do this? <laughs> he likes the disrespect. The G3 really spruced up Dregtown. You can get anything you want down there. Drugs? Sure. Sex? Yep. Those are the only two things I can think of. Oh wait, laptops. You can get laptops, I bet. Drugs, sex, and laptops. That's drag town, baby. Damn, that, there, there's Douglas right there. Uh, that's how you know we're in the right spot. Let's go to one location. Okay, Douglas again. This ad is about the torture. Uh, the last one was about joining the G3, but this one is about how I love torturing. It's not an ad for anything. It's just like a reminder that part of my job is also torturing people. Enemies of the G3, random strangers who looked at me funny, anybody. I'll torture whoever. Doesn't matter to me. I just love doing it. Okay, that's it for this one. That's a wrap. <laughs> okay. I like their soda machines. They look kind of cool. This zone is against the violence treaty, so no violence allowed here. Take care. So, how did Mothers Against Violence come about? Well, all us moms here in Dragtown got together at the last Mama Palooza and decided it would be fun to have a few small sectors where we don't all kill each other all the time. We don't have anything against anyone who loves violence, but it's just not our bag, you know? Also, all our children are in their 30s at least, so this isn't about them. We don't really care if they die, we just happen to be moms who hate violence. Have fun out there, kids. I'm Senator Thomas Michael Phillips, and I support Mothers Against Violence. Stop on by for items! What kind of items? If you waste my time, I'll break your licks. 
and your arms and whatever else you got I like that he's got like no legs he's all arms you know everyone who walks away without buying something I put them on a list and then I send assassins to kill them oh fuck you hey come on by uh, anyone want to buy something Look, I'm a violent person, all right? Why'd you even waste my fucking time? Wow, so this is what a G3 run city me. looks like. Anyway, yeah, I'm excited to join the G3, but I'm gonna miss my wife and six kids. Oh, yeah. Come on, I, I got you. If I left, so I wouldn't feel bad. Something. Wow, that's so smart. <laughs> I'll do that too. I'm gonna kill my wife and kids so I don't miss them. Look, I'm a violent <laughs> person, all right? That's just who I am. I can't help it. Now let's just keep doing business, yeah? Join the G3. Look, I'm a murderer. Just I'm very open man. about that. Just keep that in mind while you're shopping here. I'll be honest with you. If a customer doesn't buy something, I'll find them later and kill them in their sleep. Look, I'm not above threatening customers that don't buy something. So, like I was saying, my brother told me Douglas is really into torture. Like, sexually? Does it matter? Yes, to me, it needs to be sexual. Why are you telling me this? I barely know you. Oh, my bad. Yeah, just sort of spilled out. Well, now you know. Do with it what you will. I'm not doing anything with it. I hate the G3 like everyone else, oh. sure, but hey, if the G3 wasn't here, who the hell would be buying my sounding rods? Sounding rods? Uh, yeah, it's a little metal rod you stick up your urethra, if you got one. Yep. It's the family business. We sell little metal sticks you shove up dick holes. You think you're better than me? Well, you are. You 100% are better than me. I'm dirt. And the G3 wants to buy all my sounding rods, so fuck off. Uh, okay, uh, all right then. No, thank you. If you touch me again, I'll eat your head. Give me What's some it? space, space walker. Huh? huh? Six feet, please. Okay, because you're nice about it. Trash bag babies number seven. Dead Alec. Sorry, this one was supposed to be something funny, like annoying Alec, and he's talking about his least favorite anime dubs or something dull like that, but he died before we, we drew him, so he's just dead Alec. Oh, I hope we don't have to meet Douglas. Yeah, jeez, that guy scares the shit out of me. He was trying to play Gary alive at the party last night. He should have. Honestly, Gary's a racist. Oh yeah, Gary needs to be flayed alive for sure. Just, you know, there's a time and a place. Maybe we shouldn't be talking about this stuff out loud. <laughs> this just looks dead ass at me. <laughs> so. Were you guys at the party last night? I can't believe Nipulon showed up. Oh, I saw. Nipulon is so cool. He was looking real good. Easily the hottest G3 officer. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Nipulon's not as hot as Dr. Giblets. What? Nipulon's way hotter, trust me. And he's got charisma. That goes a long way. <laughs> it just keeps looking at me after. It's like, what you, what you looking at? All us moms here in Dragtown if you got touch together me again, the last I'll flip out! And decided Ooh, to be thanks for touching me! Don't all kill each other all the time. Eek, watch my nipples, they're sensitive! Loves violence, but it's Oof, so watch bad, out, that's my know. elbow! Although all our children are in their 30s. <laughs> it's so ridiculous! Careful, bud, I got diarrhea! Happen to be moms <laughs> who hate violence. 
Have fun out there, kids. Careful, bud! I got diarrhea! And I support Mothers Against You were all at the party last night, right? Douglas was this fucked up. Oh, yeah. Violence. That guy was pounding a back no like a full-grown scrubulon. Which care. are like the Irish of space, in case you didn't know. <laughs> but you so, do know. We all know space stuff. Yeah, goddamn. I don't want to stereotype, but I bet 50 pesos Douglas has some scrubulish blood. You know what? I'm going to go look into that. And decided it would be fun to have a few small sectors where we don't all... Damn, can you believe they built all this on the bottom of an asteroid? I mean, I, I, I'm not going to lie. It's, it's a good place to hide out. I mean, also, but yeah. The children are in their 30s at least. So I mean, wouldn't you want, want to try, Panda? Isn't that like... <laughs> isn't that like your thing? <laughs> I like that they have the anti-suicide. <laughs> like suicide. Invisible, non invisible walls. Feels like there's another batch of new recruits every damn day. Like they must run through these guys like I run through a sleeve of Oreos. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I've killed a few myself, to be honest. I can't say I blame you. Bunch of no good Gorzos coming here, you know, taking our jobs. Eating our Oreos. Hey, why do you, you know keep I mean? mentioning Oreos? Are, are, are they paying you or something? I have no idea what you're talking about, man. I am in no way affiliated with Nabisco or their parent company, Mondelez International. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I am hungry. Her mentioning Oreos made me extra hungry. Let me see if the uh, screen's working right now so I can do my beer right back thing. Fuck oh, no. I wonder why the fuck it's not working. It's not even giving an option for the properties. All right, give me a sec. Wait, hold on, let's just have you guys stare at the TV in the game. There, there's a TV around here somewhere. So, how did Mothers Against Violence come Great. about? Well, all us moms here in Dragtown got Make together the last this Mama and decided it would be fun to have a few small sectors where we don't all kill each other all the time. We don't have anything against anyone who loves violence, but it's just not our bag, you know? Also, all our children are in their 30s at least, so this isn't about them. We don't really care if they die, we just happen to be moms who hate violence. Have fun out there, kids! I'm Senator Thomas Michael Phillips, and I support Mothers Against Violence. This zone is part of the Mothers Against Violence Treaty, so no violence allowed here. Take care. So, how did Mothers Against Violence come about? Well, all us moms here in Dragtown got together at the last Mama Palooza and decided it would be fun to have a few small sectors where we don't all kill each other all the time. We don't have anything against anyone who loves violence, but it's just not our bag, you know? Also, all our children are in their 30s at least, so this isn't about them. We don't really care if they die, we just happen to be moms who hate violence. Have fun out there, kids! I'm Senator Thomas Michael Phillips, and I support... You know, I can crawl without your help, by the way, you know, just in case you were wondering. You know, it's obviously a lot easier if somebody's going to carry me around, but I could crawl, and I'd be just fine with that, you know? Back on Gatlas, we used to have Gatlian hand horses carry us around everywhere. Yeah, it was fine. And then we made robot ones, and wonderful. But guess what? We didn't need it. We could cr crawl anywhere we wanted. So, but it is nice that you're carrying me around. That, that, that's much more convenient. Thank you very much. We don't have anything against anyone who loves violence, but it's just not our bag, you know? Also, all our children are in their 30s at least, so this isn't about them. We don't really care if they die, we just happen to be moms who hate violence. Have fun out there, kids! I'm Senator Thomas Michael Phillips, and I support Mothers Against Violence. This zone is part of the Mothers Against Violence Treaty, so no violence allowed here. Take care! So, how did Mothers Against Violence come about? Well, all us moms here in Dragtown got together at the last Mama Palooza and decided it would be fun to have a few small sectors where we don't all kill each other all the time. We don't have anything against anyone who loves violence, but it's just not our bag, you know? Also, all our children are in their 30s at least, so this isn't about them. We don't really care if they die, we just happen to be moms who hate violence. Have fun out there, kids! I'm Senator Thomas Michael Phillips, and I support Mothers Against Violence. 
This zone is part of the Mothers Against Violence Treaty, so no violence allowed here. Take care. So, how did Mothers Against Violence come about? Well, all us moms here in Dragtown got together at the last Mama Palooza and decided it would be fun to have a few small sectors where we don't all kill each other all the time. We don't have anything against anyone who loves violence, but it's just not our bag, you know? Also, all our children are in their 30s at least, so this isn't about them. We don't really care if they die, we just happen to be moms who hate violence. Have fun out there, kids! I'm Senator Thomas Michael Phillips, and I support Mothers Against Violence. This zone is part of the Mothers Against Violence Treaty, so no violence allowed here. Take care. So, how did Mothers Against Violence come about? Well, all us moms here in Dragtown got together at the last Mama Palooza and decided it would be fun to have a few small sectors where we don't all kill each other all the time. We don't have anything against anyone who loves violence, but it's just not our bag, you know? Also, all our children are in their 30s at least, so this isn't about them. We don't really care if they die, we just happen to be moms who hate violence. Have fun out there, kids! I'm Senator Thomas Michael Phillips, and I support Mothers Against Violence. This zone is part of the Mothers Against Violence Treaty, so no violence allowed here. Take care! So, how did Mothers Against Violence come about? Well, all us moms here in Dragtown got together <laughs> the with the last mom Yeah, I realized when I was in the kitchen, I'm like, oh, it's really not showing anything else. It's just the one. We don't kill each other all the time. And it does kind of mold into, or not mold, but loop into itself really well. <laughs> But I'm back. Alright, what were we doing? Had my munchies. Where did I start? Oh, can I jump into the fan? <laughs> hey, it's the first time I've actually died. Yeah, I'm excited to join the G3, but I'm going to miss my wife and six kids. Oh, yeah. I had mine killed before I left, so I wouldn't feel bad. Wow, that's so smart. I'll do that, too. I'm going to kill my wife and kids so I don't miss them. Oh, there it is. That's where I came in. Hey, watch where you're going! So, like I was saying, my brother told me Douglas is really into torture. Like, sexually? Does it matter? Yes, to me it needs to be sexual. Why are you telling me this? I barely know you. Oh. Spilled out. Well, now you know. Do with it what you will. I'm not doing anything with it. joining the G3. All my friends joined and they all died. So, hot stuff, why, why are you joining up? I don't know. This is just what we do. Our whole race. We just join the G3. It's just what we do. Yeah, it's what we all do. You seriously can't do anything else other than, than this. Yeah, man. Our whole race joins the G3. Well, 80% of us do, but the other 20%, we just sort of make fun of them until they join anyway. There's just no escaping it, but we're gonna kick some ass. Don't worry about me. I'm already resigned to dying in the battlefield. I've made peace with it. <laughs> I'm Senator Thomas Michael Phillips, and I support Mothers Against Violence. Okay, so I think I've done... Oh, they convinced me. Let's join the G3. I'm doing my part. <laughs> We yeah, guys kinda. at the party last night? I can't believe Nipulon showed up. Oh, I saw. Nipulon is so cool. He was looking real good. Easily the hottest G3 officer. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Nipulon's not as hot as Dr. Giblets. What? Nipulon's way hotter. Trust me. And he's got charisma. That goes a long way. I wish people complimented me like that. Have fun out there, Did kids. you see Beard yesterday? Senator Thomas Michael Phillips. Real slow. You were all at the party last night, right? Douglas was fucked up. 
Oh, yeah. yeah. That guy was pounding the back like a full-grown scribulon, no which are like allowed. the Irish of space, in case you didn't know. But you do know. We all know space stuff. So, yeah, goddamn. I don't want to stereotype, but I'd be 50 pesos. Well, all us moms here in Dragtown you know got together at the last Mama Palooza. Still like. oh, Get a load of you, my child. I'm from a sweet little organization called Mothers for Violence. And you're about to enter a sector under our jurisdiction. That's right. There's Mothers Against Violence, and then there's us. Mothers for Violence. <laughs> We're a little different. We love violence, and we want more of it everywhere. It's so hard to hear us and mothers may disagree. I do. Let me, uh... Jump over there real quick. I'm going to ask them. <sighs> hey, real quick. Do I sound normal? Or am I quiet? You sound normal. Okay. Thank you. Sound a little quiet. <laughs> right as it ended. Um. Yeah, it does look like it's normalizing lower than it usually is. I mean, if I sound normal now, I could just turn the game down, but that's a problem because you can only turn a game so or a volume so far up. Where is? I think it's a filter. Okay. Oh, I turned the gain off at some point. Here, how's that sound? <laughs> that should have fixed it. From time to time. But there's one thing we all have in common. We're all mothers. Stay safe out there. Actually, don't. Go shoot people. We love violence. I'm Senator Thomas Michael Phillips, and I support mothers for violence. I support all the mothers. I don't stand for anything. I lack conviction. I let these mommies just boss me around, and I do whatever they ask. <laughs> Go get wrecked or something. Whoa, look at that! Look at that! They got they they're they're fucking dealing with some greebles over there, dumb fucks. Ah! Okay, shit, I, I guess let's just kill them all. I just wanted one kill all the planet. Shit, they just keep coming! What does that even mean? Come out, come out, wherever you are. Bombs away! Fuck! Time out! Time out! Consider that an early retirement. I'm getting tired! Killing you fuckers! I don't know what you have to do. I die. That was self defense. Everyone saw self defense. <laughs>
I am so proud of you, son. You look, you look so good, son. You're ugly. Hey! <laughs> wow, those mothers weren't kidding around. That that was violent. <laughs> what can I say? It's what I'm good at. Seriously, why isn't Stabby talking? This whole section feels like very much him. You know? You just found a wolf crystal. You can find these valuable gems inside the luck Luglo Luxes, Lug Foxes, and Warp bases that have been cleared of enemies. They can be traded to Florto and Blim City in exchange for warp discs. Who knows what part of the galaxy these warp discs or these discs might warp in? It's literally infinite, never ending galaxy. Nice. One over there. Good stuff for Cool. I don't know who you are. How'd you get my number? Sorry for spying on you, by the wow, way. Wow, a real G3 training time. facility. Maybe Douglas does the training fun. in person. Maybe. I feel like there's something I'm getting soon where I can run up that stuff. Psst! Hey! Hey you! Check this out! I got some goop here! You're gonna love it! You can use it to sneak in! Come over here! How old are you? Old enough. Hey! Hey there! Thanks for coming over here. I'm the goop guy around these parts. You wanna sneak in the G3 facilities? You gotta get covered in goop. That's just how it goes. My stuff's quality! So you want some goop, right? No. <laughs> uh, you know what? Me? How about no? Fair enough. But you won't be able to go any further till you get my goop. So you'll be back. They all come back. He weirdly <laughs> looks like one of the dudes from uh, uh, Odd World. Kind of looks like Abe. All right, fine. Let's get the goop. Just thought there would be more going on over here. I knew it. I knew you'd be back for my goop. And hey, no judgments. None of my business what you're up to with this goop. You can go nuts. Judgment free. Planet Fitness. I'm putting you down for some goop. Planet that okay? <laughs> uh, yeah. I, mean, I guess we don't really have a choice. Perfect. Head down the alley there. Just, uh, let the magic happen. I guess. Uh, d don't, don't worry. Right. First goop's on me. Just tell all your buddies about it. I'm the goop guy. I do goop stuff. <laughs> Here, how's that for my boys? Should be helping. All right, let's get. Oh, oh, this fucking! So, oh my god, the smell! Oh my god, I'm gonna fucking throw up. Okay, okay, I'm all right. Okay. Oh my god, Th this better. Hey, look at you! You're all gooped up. I gotta be honest. It won't last long. It's not the real stuff. So you better be quick. Get in, get out. Don't stay in there too long. Don't lollygag, cause this stuff's gonna fall off. That's the goop guy. Promise. That's the guarantee. You're 18, right? By the way. Okay, thank you. Let's just go. Let's just go. Don't let me do anything. Yeah, where am I supposed to be going? No, no. Hey, mind if I ask? What do you need to hear about my services? I just need to know so I can target my ads better. I'm trying to expand. My brother does a really good job in this business over in Blim, and I want to get on his level. I mean, Dragtown is not eh, enough about me. Go out there, go have a fun time, party, find a pretty lady, fall in love, get married. That's what I did. Biggest mistake of my life. Oh, that's what happened. Why can't I, uh... 
But I gave birth some impreg fetish shit happened to me in IRL. Wasn't paying attention to the first bit of the stuff you were saying. It was really crazy, that's drag drag town for you. No idea what happened to the kid I had. Again, this ad is about the torture. Uh, the last one was about joining the G3, space, but space this one walker. is about how I love torturing. It's not an oh, ad. Oh, looky here. We got another gooped up G3 recruit. Be advised that the G3 cartel is not responsible for any life threatening injuries you may incur on these premises. But even if we were, we wouldn't give a shit. Who cares? I hope you get shot. Good luck. Uh, thanks. Are you fucking kidding me? They have some whole thing prepared? Shut the fuck up, it's starting! Welcome, welcome, welcome! I'm sure you already know who I am, but for anyone living under a rock, I'm Douglas, G3 Chief of Training and Torture. And wouldn't you know it, I like to blur those lines a little. Training? Torture? What's the difference, I say? I look to your left, difference. now look to your right. Both of those people are gonna die today. You are about to jump right into an accurate warp-based simulation of what it'll look like to be on the real battlefield. And let me tell you, you're probably gonna die. But hey, if you don't, you get to join the G3. Big whoop. All right, that's it. Lock and load, fuckers. Oh my god, is that... All right, shut you it saw off. that, right? I got that torture was a to Gatlian. do. Douglas has a Gatlian. We, we, we gotta rescue her. Jesus, these fucking Merkeloids. Oh, fuck, here we go. I, I, we shit, go. I hope it's not too difficult. Fucking little freaks! Hey, what if it wasn't Oprah Winfrey? I used to love her program. Whoa, bounty hunter, can you hear me? And welcome being killed. Are you fucking kidding me? More? Another wave? Crest to raise more. That's, that's the last of them, right? Oh, okay, you beat all the weak guys. Easy, really easy. Now go do the obstacle course. Oh, okay. A grenade! Fucking fuck! That's for sure. It is really weird that how Next quiet time, don't join the G. Okay, you know what? It looks like some simple platforming. You know, like what you'd see in like Lucky's Tale on, uh, you know, or um, you know that one uh, that one game. Really? You got hurt? You know that that looked like it should have been easy. I'm slipping! I'm slipping! I'm slipping! I'm slipping! I'm slipping! Ah! Stop messing uh, up! You know, uh, listen, uh, you're not gonna impress me. Well, I guess it's apparently harder than it looks. Oh god, uh, <laughs> I have a pacemaker. One zap would kill me. Okay. Hey, you go on ahead. Okay, l let's just get this over with, please. Whew, fuck it. Get that fucking jump. God damn. That was a little. That, that, we, we made it. That was a little tough, though. Congratulations, shitheads! So you made it past the first training exercise! Big deal! That one was easy! We lied and said it was hard to scare you! Oh, it's fun to freak you out, to fuck with your heads! Now get ready for exercise two! It starts in one hour! That's right, you have to wait a full hour! We're testing your resolve, so just stand there patiently and wait! Then this door will open and you can continue! Uh, okay, there's no way we're waiting a full hour. Okay, thank God. Okay, let, let's ditch this whole recruiting bullshit thing. They ain't just crouch. Yeah, where's this way? Yeah. 
Oh shit, okay, well, there goes that bootleg goop. Uh, I guess that didn't last for very long. Oh my god, hello! Thank god you're here! My name's Dr. Jupy. Douglas kidnapped my whole family, and I'm trying to sneak in and save them. But That's I just fun, can't Bob. get through these pipes in the next room. Oh my god, I'm freaking out! Hey, whoa, whoa, l l listen, little guy. We're trying to find Douglas, too. You know, maybe we can help each other. God, I'm so worried I'm gonna, gonna throw up. You really helped me? Oh, gee, I'm, I'm so grateful. Follow me! It's like a squidipus. You gotta connect these pipes for me so I can get through and save my family. Hey, don't worry. This is a classic textbook puzzle situation. I think me and my bounty hunter partner can figure this one out. Don't even worry. Oh, how wondrous. I'm forever in your debt. I don't know how I can ever repay you. God, my poor family, my wife Plimmy, my kids Swoopy and Froopy. I'm gonna get to see them soon. Oh, you're really gonna do it. Wow, you did it! You got the door open! Listen, I'll never forget this. You're my personal hero. Oh, come on, you're too, you're too kind. It, it was easy. Oh, did you say you're heading to find Douglas too? Hey, come on, His office we're, we're is that big building up on top of Drake Town. He's a cute little guy. Don't let's scare just him. Past here that'll take you right to him. Huh? Well, all right then. I, I didn't I, even I, try to I shoot him. So hope the guy gets his family it. back. Done, we finished this shit. We are fully out. Fuck. <sighs> okay, w w what is this? Congratulations to all of these worms who made it this far in your training. It is now time for the final test a bloody free for all. Last one standing gets to join the G3. No rules, just killing. Good luck, shit heels. God damn it, another fucking. Yeah, good job. Congratulations, recruit. Now, uh. I don't know. Fight some more guys. Do all humans smell this fucking bad? You should. Can somebody fill me in? Go ahead. No, be good. Dead. Whoa! What happened? I think I died. <laughs> All right, well, I finally died then. Like, for real, instead of killing myself to a fan. <gasps> okay, w w what is this? Congratulations to all of you worms who made it this far in your training. It is now time for the final test, a bloody free-for-all. Last one standing gets to join the G3. No rules, just killing. Good luck, shit heels. God damn it, another fucking thing with this. Holy shit, just kill them all. Oh, come on, lost him. Hey, uh, don't forget to use my Glock yeah, shot, you know? Job. Congratulations, recruit. Now, uh, I don't know, fight some more guys. Uh, sorry I'm late. Had a thing. I'm gonna ram you with bullets. Like, what can I do in the morning? Doesn't do anything for me. Shoot me. I like it. Good thing this isn't a simulation. Another wave, no problem. Just up here. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. oh shit, this one's rushing us. Oh, you're fucking. Hey, Their protective goop is no match. Standalone situation. Oh, I bet 
you wish there was a rep to intervene. Fuck a duck. <laughs> Where'd you go? Bombs away! Ow! We gotta be nearing the end, right? I feel like... This is just... Hey, well, don't shoot the hook bug. That's probably somebody's pet. I took Garbantuous in the G3. Quick. Holy fucking shit. I really shit, wish shit, Naifu shit, would talk him. more. He, he's just like completely silent. He's not even excited to be murdered. Got one! Like it's been all um, this one. We've been reprogrammed by Dr. Jimmy. You know, just in case you were wondering about the Lord. Oh, wait, yeah. MG3. You'll die braver than most. Too easy. He's running at me in melee. <laughs> Woo! We did it. We're, we're the number one G3 recruit. We 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 could be in the G3 if we wanted to be. Woo! We could be if we wanted to. Congratulations, graduates on joining <laughs> the G3 or whatever. I really can't stress enough how little I give a shit. Now report to your commanding officer and we'll send you off to die fighting for us on whatever dumbass planet we decide. See ya. <laughs> Thanks, Ice King. Slash SpongeBob. <laughs> okay. I want to see what that big guy could do and I want to see what his big gun could do, but at the same time, it's just like... But what would happen if I just... Merc him. <laughs> okay, so I didn't find anything about mom and dad. But I did meet a really nice alien. His name's Twig, and we're gonna grab some coffee. Don't judge me, okay? I'm allowed to get coffee with an alien if you're allowed to carry one around with you everywhere. That was fun when we were in this place. <laughs> you looking for a good deal? Over here! 
Multi glove mod. I didn't want to give you the old bait and switch, you know, but it's in my blood. I can't help it. Once a salesman, always a salesman. This augmentation applies the amount. No pressure, no pressure. Don't buy anything. Please don't buy anything. Please don't feel like you have to buy anything. Sorry, one second. I used to work in advertising. Pitch Master Pete was what they okay. called me. Oh, I could sell uh, milk to a 12 tittied space cow. And I did once. But then the firm the folded and, well, you know how things go. It's going to be safe from all the globby bouncing. Muscle implant. This implant. I don't uh, enjoy disappointing people. It's just my job. Shots. Powering them up to damage. Sure. Don't feel bad. That was an okay price. It goes without saying you could have gotten that cheaper elsewhere. Something with this, or is it already just on? Hmm. Okay. Whoa, he looks different. glad to see you. I'm so happy we keep running into each other. Oh, look who it's our old buddy. It's our old friend, Dr. Jupy. What are you talking about? How, wh how's it going? Uh, there's another locked door. I'm running out of time. God, I'm so worried about my kids. And a little bit about my wife, but mostly my kids. Okay, well, we'll, we'll see what we can do. Oh, my poor kids. I hope Douglas doesn't kill them. I can feel my wife Plenty calling for me. You're gonna solve this one too. Thank you. Okay, all right, so that feeds into there. Oh, Plimmy and the kids are probably so scared without me. I hope Douglas isn't torturing them right now. I don't want to rush you, but I'm getting nervous. Here. Swoopy and Froopy would... <laughs> amazing, amazing! You did it again! Douglas's office isn't too far from here. I'm going on ahead. I'll see you there. Jesus Christ, Douglas is gonna kill Dr. Jupy. Look at look how weak and, and cute Dr. Jupy is. Forget oh, about yeah, it. Dr. Jupy's a fucking badass. He just has trouble getting into places. <laughs> urgent announcement. This sector has temporarily been designated as a mother's for and against violent zone. That means there's probably just going to be a lot of violence. An intruder has infiltrated the G3 recruitment program, and there will be lots of violence here until we find Yay. and kill them. And remember... Huh, I guess they're talking about us. Remember, I'm still here, and I support any and all mothers out there. I'll believe whatever cause they ask me to believe in. Hot mothers, not hot mothers. I love mothers. <laughs> what are you saying? You know what? That looks like Douglas's office, but we can't get in that way. Maybe we can go around back. The boy likes milfs.
find something to get later. Hey! Oh shit, here we go! feel a lot stronger. Oh damn. <laughs> oh that was cool. They are little markers for it. Ah, cool. other markers or stuff like that. Then you got one like this. So what do you think the G3 even stands for? You, you'd think we'd know that, right? You'd think the main bad guys, we should know what their fucking name stands for, huh? You know? Maybe we'll find out later, you know? Some deep lore shit. Maybe it's on a fucking forum post or something. I bet it's not that interesting. I bet it's like, um, ooh, my, my tummy grumbled three times. I know, let's call it the G3 or, you know what I mean? Shit. I'm alive. <laughs> what is inside? Well, at least I figured out how the radar works now. say it's like a great
them! That's a stinger! If only they were all this weak, you know? Guess the party isn't over yet! You know, I, I, I guess I don't. I don't know. It's I, I, I'm I, I'm I'm conflicted on it. It's rough. So you get over to that one. Rep, rep. Oh, that was close. Oh, 
Oh, <laughs> that's not fair. It's not a real object. This is it. Douglas is right beyond this door. Can you help me out one last time? Yeah, let's do this. Oh, oh huzzah! Plimmy, Froopy, Sloopy, here I come. I'm gonna say he's gonna kick the crap out of him. That's just my guess. Oh, okay. All right, where's the end goal? So we start here. Power source. Here we go. Oh, you're so good at these. I wish I was as good at these as you. You're really good. Did you go to puzzle school? Where's that connected? Oh boy, this is a hard one. Please hurry up. My family could be dying. Trying not to think about my wife's body being ripped in half by one of Douglas's torture devices. And <laughs> Yahoo! You're halfway there. Keep going. You can do it. You're a good team. Easy. Well, shit! D does that mean he's... Huh? I, I feel pretty stupid right about now. Yeah, well. I figured he was gonna rip that guy apart. But, uh, I'll say that. Oh, fuck off! <laughs> I was never Dr. Jupy. There is no Dr. Jupy. That's are what this sounds like. Are you shocked, you idiot? You complete fucking moron! Oh, of course you are. <laughs> <laughs> and to think you never want to spend Look at me, Ha! There never was any Let's see how you deal with my trained recruits who are also my torture victims. Get ready for another wave, bounty hunter! Thanks again for all the help. I got wasted at the party and woke up in a ditch without my exosuit. I lost it. Oh, what? Oh! Hey, fuck off, man! Don't you get who you're messing with. You should have stayed Dr. Jupy. We loved him. You should you have quit being Douglas and live the rest of your life as that guy. <laughs> I will say that. Yep. I am jumping! So <laughs> Torture the gun! Attack the bounty hunter! Shit, they just keep coming! You're lucky I'm still a little hungover, else you'd be dead by now! I'm 
just getting warmed up. I can't believe you honked Rupert us, you sick fuck. We trusted Dr. Jupy. So I'm still excited to kill you! That's definitely the stuff. Oh, oh the now stuff. that felt good. He had some very nice, choppable flesh, actually. It was actually very nice. Oh, ah. All right, dipshit, let's go. What? No hello? Nice to meet you, or Ooh, thank you for saving me? Why? Like you not dying there with some sort of favor to me? Hi, I'm Sweetie. Thanks so much for rescuing me. How is that, dipshit? Now come on, use my time bubble to escape through the big fan in the corner. Pretty cool, right? You're gonna find out real fast that I'm the best Gatlian. Smartest, most useful, best looking. No, no, come on, come on, I'm pretty good. Douglas, it's Garmentuous. Where the fuck are you? I heard you made a complete fool of yourself at that party last night. Not good, Douglas. Not good. I'm gonna need you on top of your game now that we've got a hold of these humans. We're spread thin over on Earth, and I need more troops immediately. Not to mention things are gonna start heating up all over the galaxy as demand goes up. Big things are happening, Douglas. Get excited I'm just and get your fucking get you shit tired. together. <laughs> okay, yeah, fuck that. Oh shit! I think that's a photo of the famous dude who invented translator microbes. Why the fuck does he know Douglas? You want to fuck these guys up? But on the other hand, who can... <laughs> Bounty Hunter! Blast these idiots! Hey, you want to know my real hat trick? My crystals stick into baddies and they'll explode if you hit them real hard. Like with your knife. You get it. Go nuts! We make a pretty good team! You didn't forget about my time bubble. Oh, done already? I was just getting into it. You just was really good at killing There you are. Too easy. Oh, great. You can use that to detonate my smaller crystals. So just blast some normal shots, then finish them off with my super crystal. You got that, dipshit? Wants to hide, huh? 
Well, it's not gonna work! Check this out. Aim me at that candy ass and shoot him through his cover. Fuck yeah! He had no idea what hit him. Fuck. Oh, now we gotta get across, huh? Hey, you wanna see what else this time bubble can do? Tell me what else the time bubble can do. Oh, okay. I see. I see what you're putting oh, down. Oh, jeez. Do I gotta spell it out for you? Try slowing down one of the ships, then we can use it to hop across. <laughs> Great. Perfect. Now hurry and cross before it wears off. Incredible, right? What a thrill. You know, you can use that time bubble on the G3, too. And try loading the bubble up with my crystals. Then you'll see why I'm the best Gatlian. <sighs> We're gonna make a good team. I can feel it. Just listen to everything I say and never use the other Gatlians. You and me, we got this. So what's next? You turn in the bounty somewhere? Go do that. We can wrap this up. What's wrong? Were we too bad for you? Trash bag babies, number nine, farting fri fridly. Uh, just a guy who farts, nothing too special, not even that funny. But yeah, he absolutely does just fart all the time, constantly. He does it on purpose, too. He pushes them out even when he doesn't gotta. Uh, he's, he's sick in the head. You think I'm supposed to be impressed that you killed a G3 officer? Y well, okay, yeah, fine. I am. I think it's pretty insane you didn't die. That's all you're getting out of me. Now, turn that bounty in. Hey, you gonna turn in that bounty or just loiter in my living room? You oh, hey. Hey, another girl on the team. Good. Actually, I mean it. I'm not being snarky. That's so nice to see. Yeah, yeah, don't get too excited. We're not even the same species. There we go. Look at you. You're getting the hang of this bounty hunter thing already. How'd the mission go? They killed a G3. Looks like I taught them well. Wow. Really? Whoa. Okay. Well, I'm impressed. <laughs> Yeah, I was, I was always hoping you'd find your calling. I just I didn't think it would be bounty hunting. But then again, I don't know what I thought it would be. Maybe hairstyling and not good at it. And what's wrong with bounty hunting? Ugh, can you please tell this dried up sack of shit to go home? I don't want to share a couch with him. Tough titties, Leslie. You're kidding me, had a deal. It's Lizzie! And that's not my kid. Jesus, we're siblings. Sorry, I don't know how your species works yet. Sibling, fine, got it. Doesn't change a thing. I live here now. Come on, can't he find his own place to stay? Hey, that's not right. I'm barely taking up any space. You know we had a deal fair and square. Eh, oh, come on! 
man. We barely know this guy. You're really gonna side with him over your own sister? Uh, you should be proud. You raised your child to have proper respect for a good, fair business deal. Oh, now I know you're doing this on purpose. I'm the sister, not the mom. But you knew that, didn't you? Sorry. My bad. You come waltzing back in here stinking like dirty Flimborg. Of course I'm gonna get distracted. You shouldn't be hanging out with that Flimborg boy, you know? Can't trust that species. Twig's harmless and nice. You're being spacist. And he's not my boyfriend. Yet. Trust me. Flimborgs are bad news. Come on, have my back here. I don't know, look it up. Whoa, really? Uh, you don't have to side with this guy just because he gave you some cool toys. Hey, he Plus, knows more about I the feel universe like he's do. just using you. I think I appreciate the loyalty, kid, but I am actually a bit of a spacist. I'm trying to work on it. God, I just don't think I can take much more of this guy. What, you think this is easy for me? If I'm pissing you off, at least you can leave. But my legs don't work. I'm stuck listening to your boy trouble every time I'm trying to watch my stories. I can't even get my peace stories. and quiet in my own home because there's an alien cripple jerking off on my couch 24-7. Hey, come on. That's a high estimate. Ew, That's a high estimate. I was kidding. Yeah, me too. I was kidding. We all know I was kidding. Aren't you going to say anything? Whose side are you on anyway? Hey, uh, all right. I, I, I can see I'm being a little bit of a bother. I mean, look, I'll, I'll try to keep it down when I'm uh, watching my stories. Just don't uh, put me back on the streets. I really do want to help you. Fine, he can stay. But only until he finds somewhere else to go. I'm grateful. I mean it. But I've already missed half my program, so can everyone just shut the hell up? Ugh. All right, that's enough excitement for one day. You got more bounties to get to, kid. And you might want to check out the pawn shop to see what you can spend your new payout on. Eh? Mm. Oof, that was tense. It's times like these I'm, I'm almost relieved I don't have any family left alive. But, but not really. I, I miss them a lot. Hey, uh, just so you know, you can use the Bounty 5000 to revisit any planet you've been before. There's portal doors all over. You can just uh, use them whenever and grind for money, look for loot you missed, whatever. Up to you. Just thought I'd tell you. Guffins. You know, Smuffle Guy, like just regular old plain Smuffle Guffins. You knew this. I don't think I could stay married to somebody who just blatantly does Smuffle Guffins. Well, I don't know what to tell you. I am a Smuffle Guffin. I feel like I already clicked this. That's what, are we getting a divorce? Because that's where, the draw, that's that's where I draw the line. All right, listen. We are getting a divorce, and that's why you gotta watch Alien Channel 5102. jumped right into it. <laughs> How the hell do I get out of here? Oh no. I didn't think this through. Oh, okay. Not so bad, though. killing as much as you, but let's cool it for a second. Oh, he's not 
uh, slow Eyes mode. open, bozo. Almost sounded like Carl Weezer. Hello? Who's there? Are you trying to prank call me? Okay. Good work. You got me. I don't give a shit. You think I care about getting pranked? Okay, fuck you! I've got powerful friends. I know a really strong bounty hunter, and I'm gonna send him to kick your ass! How do you like that, huh? Pretty sure I know that guy. <laughs> Hello? Who is this? If this is Nancy from the city comptroller, I actually would like to speak to you. Is this Nancy? Well, I'll tell you what, if it is or isn't, maybe you could pass on the message to Nancy because I'm not sure if you're aware, but on my block on 67 Rosebud, well, the Rosebud Avenue between uh, Terrace uh, Court and uh, Jarvis Street, in that, in that area, I have a pool in the back of my yard. It's a saltwater pool, and the neighborhood boys, they come around on their fucking BMX bikes, and they, they ride all over my, my, my rose garden, but that's not the, where it ends, is they take the little rocks and the little pieces of fertilizer and soil from my garden, and they throw it into my fucking pool, and all those goddamn little rocks, they get into the filter, and I gotta change that thing out every single time they do it. And those filters are about $700. So, I don't know if that's part of your jurisdiction, but maybe could you get somebody out here to figure that fucking shit out, otherwise, I'm gonna have to take matters into my own hands. And I've killed before. Now, legally, it was under, uh, it was in war. I have been, I have served, but I know what it's like to take a life. And <laughs> I will do it to the children, or at least their fucking parents, because I'm out $1,400, and if you can't do the math, Nancy, that's two fucking filters. So, if you'd get back to me as soon as you can, or, 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 or I guess if you can pass this on to Nancy, just let me know, and I'll figure it out. And if it's one of your little shits crank calling me, I'm gonna take matters into my own hands. You just wait. <laughs> yeah, kill the kids. <laughs> kill those little monsters. <laughs> Make them wish they'll never hit adulthood. <laughs> Valued customer. Hey, uh, I really don't give a shit if you make a mess in here, but I'm supposed to tell you to cut it out. Cut it out. Want to hold more Gatorol? Send some Gatorol upgrade. What are those? Dura help tanks. I mean, as long as I don't get hit, I'm basically fine. No rush. Slide bash. Everyone's favorite thing to do is slide around and have fun. Uh, with rocket powered slide bash unit, the purpose is slowing me down. Hey, customer! I do like sliding. Here. Portaling your item to the baggage area now. <laughs> Merc foot. <laughs> Not for sexual purposes, stop asking. <laughs> Dentures ripped right out of the mouth of a tooth lean. Cyclops helmet. Always wear one when riding your Cyclops. I apologize for how messy it is in here. It was Jorb's job to clean it. This... I gave him a comb and a toothbrush. This organ transplant shortens Sweezy's internal firing tracks so she can reload faster before next shot. Is that up the fire rate or up the reload? 
chrono livers uh, generate the internal fluids that allow Sweezy's time bubbles to slow down time, shortening the cooldown period to reduce it. Ammo sack. Give Sweezy another ammo sack to hold. A few more crystals this way. The crystals never need stop piercing enemy skulls. I don't mean to rush you, but we're here to help you buy the product so you can get out. Grade. Fun new organ for Kenny that allows him to generate slime faster, so you can get back to uh, get some ammo sacks, so you can shoot more ammos. Bounce deflector mod. This augmentation coats the slime with a rubbery membrane and allows this primary shot to bounce right off any enemy. You're you know, Jor, I don't think you're very nice. Ricochet shots can hit fine. other nearby I'm okay with that. And it well, it's not Kenny's fine for me. I'd like to see sour, just for one second really a little respect come. out of you for your father. You understand? Yeah, I understand you want that, but maybe you don't understand that I don't have to give it to you. Maybe you don't understand that you're not always good to get exactly what you want. Boo hoo! You just have to accept that not everyone is gonna like you. Sometimes that's a random schlebe on the street, other times it's me. Your own offspring son who hates your guts and tells everyone at school that you won the award for Galaxy's Tiniest Penis! I literally tell everyone I know every chance I get. Most of them don't even know who you are. I just, I have no reason to tell them. I just do it because I hate you so much and because it's fun for me. Hey, hey he used to be a really super good boy. I don't know what happened. Look how dumb they look trying to figure out what to buy. See you soon, I hope. I just like that that's what's her nuts from Bob's Burgers. Like he's the same voice actress. I was born to be a cowboy. Hate this place. Too muggy. And there's G3 freaks everywhere. Let's just pop Krubus and scram. A lot of shitty things, but tearing apart this jungle ain't one of them. 
Did you jump into this toxic sludge on purpose? Come on, you can tell me. Oh, you finally brought me out again. Well, what, did I offend you or something earlier? Trash bag babies, number one, milk drinker Mikey. This little freak drinks only milk. No other drink, no water, no soda, no beer, nothing. Just milk all day long. It's so fucked up. It's freaking me out. <laughs> Oof, that water looks a little iffy, you know, might, 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 might not want to fall in there. Are you, are you fucking, did you think it was a good idea to go in here? What is wrong with you? Shut up, Morty. <laughs> Power sliding! I will say at least he's slightly more encouraging than the other one. Okay, do you know? Okay, yeah, you, you figured it out. What are we gonna find? Digging the music and stuff. Why'd you let me sit there gathering dust? Yo, I can't hear you. I'm heading into a tunnel. No, I'm just kidding. Just some uh, cell phone humor, just to lighten the mood, you know? All right. <laughs> 
Oh, Fergal Den. Oh, man, you, you, you know, you actually have a lot in common with these guys. You know, aside from all the hair, you know, you're both being sold as drugs to, for aliens to get a high off of, you know? You guys are, uh, it's, it's like you're almost related in a way, you know, if you think about it. What are you, heartless? No, we're not shooting one. I'm putting my foot down. Oh, it's so cute. Look, I'm not letting you kill them. Look how cute they are. Damn, I admire your bloodlust, but I don't want to hurt these guys. Save it for the G3. Hey, why do you want to shoot them so bad? You really want to kill these guys, huh? You sick fuck. All right, keep an eye out. If there's Fergals, there's probably G3 nearby. Let's get nasty. Three dead ahead. Lock and load, bounty hunter. It's kill time. Did you that see so that? Weird. All right, let me bump that down a little more. It's like all the sound effects overlap each other, but don't equalize. It just. No, it's just so loud. What's up? How many of these assholes do they have? Here, this is great. Oh, great, yeah, let's go into the toxic shit. <laughs> Time. That of course we need to stay back. Oh, sorry. I thought you were a G3. They enslaved our whole village. I don't know what to do. Don't worry, we'll fucking fix that for you. Really? A, Thank you. It's a it care bear. So much watching everyone you know getting enslaved. It's kind of cute. No, come on. Would you stop with the killing for a bit? So, okay. uh, are you are you gonna help or or not? I mean, it's okay. I'll just, um, I guess we'll just die. Doesn't want me to cancel it out. Huh. It literally won't let me cancel it. No, I want to jump down to there. So get the fuck out of this shit! Oh, 
Oh, I had it. Okay. So I could do it like right there by just cheesing it a little bit. I completely forgot I could power slide kind of. <laughs> it is really weird how much of a lack of knifey there's been. Like, why is he so quiet? Did, is it my game glitch? Hey, like, I got an idea. Tr try launching that merc with the fan plant. Oh, look at him go. I'm back. Well, looks like the G3 took over this village. I bet if we clean up the garbage and save this place, we can get the locals on our side. Where you at? If you kill us, who's gonna force the Mockles to work in the mine? Eat my bullets, Madam Curie. Look at these dorks. There's no way these losers beat us. Let's try to cool it on the killing random people shit, yeah? Ready for you. Let's glob them. some guys hey listen. welcome welcome we are moplets native to this planet our tribe is forever in your debt our leader would like to speak with you oh okay sure it's the pope i feel like they're cannibals or something hi there did you save us from the g3 yeah i i guess so you know do, do we get like a, a reward uh, we don't have much maybe you should hit up our leader 
<laughs> kind of badass. Oh, look! Whoa, check out that mansion over there, huh? Looks looks a bit out of place. Uh, when it starts taking over the mouse, it really throws me off. Like, I don't like that. It'd be fine if it was a controller game, but I'm not playing with a controller, so... Uh, where did I see that? I think it was a different one, but it's still in a cage. Let's not kill them, okay? Alright, cool. I think that's all of you three then. Wow, wow. You, hey, c come on, I wasn't done yet, come on. Uh, sorry, what was I saying? You t yeah, uh, let me get, let's get back into it. it was I really would love to see someone so strong. Yikes. They're furries. <laughs> furries. <laughs> oh no. That's on me. Right, let me grab that crystal so I'm thinking about it. Death loop. Right, I might be able to. their savior. My people were enslaved by the G3 and forced to desecrate the land mining for Fergals. You may have freed this small tribe, but our brethren underground are still being worked to death by Krubis. Disgusting. What are you doing, dude? Why were you guys all imprisoned? The G3 are a cruel bunch. They did tests on us to see if we could trigger psychedelic reactions like a drug. But when we proved useless in that regard, they put us to work mining Fergals instead. Man, good God, you know, you, you, you just can't win. You're either a drug or you're a slave, I guess. Yes, and those poor Fergals, so helpless. They're making us destroy their lives, their habitats. It's so gruesome. Basically, our lives are super fucked. It's, uh, <laughs> it's not good. But you freed us. Everything changes now. All right, cool. Where's Krubus. You know, we're actually looking for him to kill. What's this? You aim to take down Krubus of the G3? You are truly a, a hero really to mufflets everywhere. Buddy. Yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, where is he? We'll, we'll get rid of him for you. Hmm. That's difficult to answer. His work, though evil, keeps him very busy. He oversees many different mines across Zephyr, and it's impossible to predict where he may be on any given day. My liege, what about the man in the mansion? Ah, of course, a brilliant plan. My advisor is right. There's a man nearby who knows Krubis and has access to a warp device. We may be able to use him. He lives in a mansion across the river. If you could get your hands on his warp device, that could be very useful. Okay, sure, a guy in a mansion, that, 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 that's the plan? Yes, he would appear to be our best chance. Godspeed, savior. Okay, 
What's Krubus like? Give us a scoop on old Krubus. I've only come face to face with him a few times, but he's he's an irritable one, that Krubus. I think he resents having to manage the mines. Probably would prefer doing something a bit more glamorous. And he takes all his frustrations out on us. Sounds like a real fucking baby. Sadly, there's nothing that can be done about it. Unless you kill him. That would do the trick. Okay. So this mansion guy, tell us his whole deal. Oh, his name is Ranchy Delarmo. He warped in not too long ago. Seems to be old acquaintances with Krubus. We haven't dealt with him much, but he seems to have a penchant for Fergals. You mean he's a druggie? Nonetheless, we may be able to use that to our advantage. He does have close ties with Krubus, after all. And he seems a bit disoriented. Yeah, from all the drugs. Okay, we got it. <laughs> Manipulate the evil drug addict. Well, yes, he's evil, so it should be morally just. Yes, let's all just agree right now that it's morally just to manipulate him. <laughs> I love it when we can agree. All right, enough talking. We've got some actually fun shit to do. Very well. <laughs> Thanks again. Hey, Rip! Hey, c come on, I wasn't done yet, come on! I'm sorry. I, 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 I didn't finish the story yet, I wasn't done talking. Alright, let me uh, act like it didn't happen. Because you were Terra Strong for a second there. <laughs> Looky here, someone warped us in a little bridge. You're the you one really the love running, oh, huh? Get this thing out of the river. I fucked them up. I just typed in what you told me to type in. Yeah, and you typed it in wrong, dickhead. Now we're flooding. Oh, sure. It's always my fault. You know what? I'm asking for oh, a... Oh, hey. Sorry, we're arguing. Wait, 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 wait. What was I saying? Oh, sure. It's always my fault. You know what? I'm asking for a transfer when we get back. Oh, wouldn't that be nice? Go ahead. I can't wait. Fuck you. Fuck you. No, fuck you. No, fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. Fuck you. No, fuck you. Fuck you. No, fuck you. Oh, no, fuck you. Ah, fuck you. No, fuck you. No, fuck you. Fuck you. No, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. No, fuck you. Fuck you. Oh, we're in poison! Place. Use your last <laughs> bit of strength you. to throw me to safety! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! No, fuck you! No, fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! No, fuck you! Yeah, really, I wish Naipu would talk more. Like, he was talking so much during the beginning of the game, and now it's like... You wouldn't expect him to be so quiet, either. Somewhere else, we're busy. Oh, don't worry. I won't be too much of a bother. If you quit, we can be buddies. It's nice out today, I'd say, you know. Sometimes there's storms, it just destroys everything, and I have to rebuild my ship. Hey, look, you're on a catapult. I bet you could use that to launch stuff. Will you do it? I want to see. That would be so cool. I love cool stuff. So, okay, anyway. Bye. Did you know that I, I used to work? Whoa! Nice try, but I'm too fast for you! Huh. 
I deserve it, obviously, and uh, there's a there's a death warrant out for my arrest, and I'm fine with it. I'm fine with it because I'm happier with the choices I've made today. I've started to take care of the little Fergals around my my sight, fed them and clothe them, heal them when they make mistakes. And you know my mother. Oh, uh -huh. Oh, you'll join C3 one day. You're not a good person. Wowza, look at you go! You're really flying! You're trying to copy me! <laughs> I bet you want to be just like me because I'm so cool! Well, tough luck! I'm the only me! Don't try to be me! Hey, fuck you! I don't even want to get started on her! You have no idea what it's like to have a mother who doesn't support your dreams! All I ever wanted to be was a jungle seamstress. <laughs> I wanted to grab the purple trees and create amazing clothing for the commoners here at Zappa. But no, no one believes in me. No one gave me the chloroglots. Uh-oh, baby can't shoot. Baby keeps missing their shots. <laughs> Just messing with you. I'm giving you a hard time. I'm sure you'll get it. Oh, like I was saying, I've been aimless most of my life. Uh, I'm alone here, to be honest, and just in a valley covered with sludge and Fergals. But at least the Fergals don't judge me. Fergals, my mother! Oh! She drove her father away when I was on his sick click zone. Do you know how it to lose your father at six clicks, I got teased relentlessly in high school. But no, nice. I still go to my mother's lily pad, and I still heal her. Take care of her when she's sad. I'm a good boy regardless of what she thinks. Regardless of what choices I made in the curve. See, when I get started on my choices I've made, on my relationships I've had, oh. Tiffany, oh, I had a real one. She was so pure. She could sing like an angel. Oh, and I fucked it up. Hey, yo! Now we're talking. Oh, that is... was a classic oh, okay. ricochet. You don't see that every day. No, sorry. I'm writing about that in my diary. Yes, I have a diary. So. Shit, this guy won't stop. Oh, like I was saying, she said, Quentin, leave and never come back. Now she's dating some Clint Clark creature who's got a good job and a good family and he's in therapy and he's doing everything he needs to do to be the perfect guy for her. So now I'll never get you. Just think about her. Just wish. Pray for the one time I... You really want to shoot me, huh? I don't even know where to begin, what to end. I've been all over, just trying to find someone real. I dated a mom. Haha, <laughs> yeah, keep trying to shoot me. This is fun. So anyway, I don't want to get started into their lives. Let's just say it didn't work. You know, I'm tired of just giving and giving. That's why I quit the G3. I, I just couldn't goop another person. Do you know how much it takes out of you to goop someone? It hurts! And personally, I only want to goop someone I'm in love with. Make sure they're not using me, because I've dealt with that before. Had a, a lover who's basically a goop sexual. All he wanted me to do was just goop him up on, the, on a warm night, and he used me! And I'm, I just don't want to be used anymore. Oh, but, you know, I digress. I, it's nice just to hang out sometimes. See what you're doing. All right, you, you remember we're trying to get to that mansion, right? You're a bounty hunter, okay. obviously. Yeah, I can see that. Uh-huh. Got weapons. Very scary weapons. And and I love that they talk. Like, I'm alone. Oh, if, if I had a knife that talked, I would be a happy man. Huh. So you're, your life seems interesting, to say the least. Maybe I should research. I'm just gonna watch you do your thing. My, 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 you're sitting on fire! Oh, like I was saying. Okay, yeah, they got something to say, Chick. Oh, look at that! Look at that trick! 
Ammo sack. Give Sweezy another ammo sack. Hold a few more. Treasure! Come on, you're gonna want that. That's treasure. It's valuable. Enough already. So anyway, now I'm just gonna, just gonna stare at you now. I'm gonna stare real close. Oh no, no, don't, don't worry. I'm just, I'm just watching you. I'm just taking you in. Taking in all of you. I'm just taking in all of you. Huh. Look, what a sight. Look at you move. Look at you sway. Oh, yeah. yeah, you're. Uh, you're a bounty hunter, all right. Ho ho! Ha ha ha! Yeah, you are. Stuck. Look at you! Look at you! Whoa! Taking a little swim? Don't forget your swim trunks! Ha 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 ha! Just kidding! I know you tripped and fell in because you're clumsy. It's so funny! Oh, I can't take much more of this little fucker. So, anyway, do you have a. You, can you see through me? Can you see you through me? Wow! If, if you saw what I saw, you'd say, damn! <laughs> That's oh, yeah, me. I feel the good I like your, I like your outfit. That's, it's quality material. I like the way, you know, sometimes when like two people can just sit in silence and just be, when two beings can just sit in silence and just be, it, it just shows a closeness of like spirit. When you don't have to fill the time, you don't have to fill the void with talk, with the words. Oh, just take each other in like I'm taking you in right now. I just keep doing this. Just I'm taking doing. you in. And boy, it, it's, it's good. Oh, ha, ha, it's good. You feel that wind? Yeah, it's just like circling around me. Wow. All right, well, I'm, I'm just going to go quiet and I'm just going to watch you now. I'm just going to go quiet and watch you. I'm being quiet now. I'm just going to watch you now. Hopefully it'll shove me somewhere where I can actually move. Keep finding spots to get stuck in this game. <laughs> Nice out today, I'd say, you know. Oh, Sometimes the storms, it just destroys everything and I have to rebuild my shack and, oh, it's a nightmare. But I digress, you know, I don't. Did you know that I, I used to work? Actually, I used to work for the G3. Ha, ha. Whoa, taking a little swim? Don't forget your swim trunks. Ha, 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 just kidding. I know you tripped and fell in because you're clumsy. It's so funny. Oh, like I was saying. I deserve it, obviously, and uh, there's a there's a death warrant out for my arrest, and I'm fine with it. I'm fine with it because I'm happier oh, okay. with the choices yeah. I've made today. I've started to take care of the little Fergals around my my site, fed them and clothed them, healed them when they make mistakes, and you know my mother. Oh, oh, she, she always said, oh, you'll join me. My, 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 you're zipping on by. Bravo, look at that loot. Look at that treasure. Come on, you're going to want that. That's treasure. It's valuable. She always was saying it about me. You're not good. That's just my three hearts. Haba, haba. Quite the landing. That's not your first time on a zip line, is it? Oh, I didn't think so. Because you seem so experienced. I don't even want to get started on her. As as you have no idea okay, what it's like <laughs> to have a mother who doesn't support your dreams. All I ever wanted hey, hey, you, to be yeah, hey, was hey, a you, yeah, please, 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 please come over here. I'll, I'll do anything. I wanted to grab the purple trees and create oh a my god, someone there. Oh my god, please, come over here. Here in Zephyr. But no, no one believes in me. No one gave me the Chloroglox to hey, save you, up. You, you gotta, you so gotta buy something. I joined the G3 out of desperation. That have wanted to feel something. Anything. I, I've been aimless most of my life. Uh, I'm alone here, to be honest. I'm just in a valley covered with sludge and Fergals. But at least the Fergals don't judge me. Not like my mother! Oh! I don't even want to get into it. She drove my father away when I was on a sick click zone. Do you know how embarrassing it is to lose your father at six clicks? I got teased relentlessly in high school. But no, I still go to my mother's lily pad and I still heal her. Take care of her when she's sad because I'm a good boy regardless of what she thinks. Regardless of what choices I've made in the past. Yeah, what was I doing? I didn't want to get started on my choices I've made. I'm hey, 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 h
And then I fucked it up! I lied to her about what I did. She said, Quentin, leave and never come back! Now she's dating some Kling Clark creature who's got a good job so and a good family and he's in therapy. I think it and is he's doing thing. everything he needs to do to be the perfect guy for her. So now I'll never get Timmy back. I'll just sit here alone in my family and just think about her and just wish Pray for the one time our entrails get thrust together again. And you know, I just, I, I don't even know where to begin, what or end. I've been all over, just trying to find someone real. I dated a moblet once. <laughs> They're fucking nuts. They want to get started into their lives. Let's just say it didn't work. You know, I'm tired of just giving and giving. That's why I quit the G3. I, I just couldn't go. Another person. What it takes out of you to goop someone, it hurts! Personally, I only want to goop someone I'm in love with. Make sure they're not using me. I've dealt with that before. Had a, a lover who's basically a goop sexual. All they wanted me to do was just goop them up on a, on a warm night and he used me. And I'm, I just don't want to be used anymore. Ah, oh, but... No, I digress. It's nice just to hang out sometimes. See what you're doing. Yeah, another idea. You're a bounty hunter, obviously. Yeah, I can see that. Uh-huh. You got weapons. Very scary weapons. And and I love that they talk. Like, I'm alone. Oh, if, if I had a knife that talked, I would be a happy man. Huh. So you're, your life seems interesting, to say the least. I'm gonna watch you do your thing. I'm gonna watch you move around. Yeah. Straight back and forth. Yeah, check that guy. Okay, yeah, they got something to say too. Oh, yeah. yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna stare at you now. I'm gonna stare real close. Oh no, no, don't, don't worry. I'm just, I'm just watching you. I'm just taking you in. Taking it in all. I'm just taking it all. In you. Look, what a sight. Look at you move. Look at you sway. Yeah, you're a, you're a bounty hunter, all right. Ho ho! Ha ha ha! Yeah, you are. Just look at you. Look at you. Like, just look at your look at your. Wowie! You came all the way up here and look a lug lux of a reward for all your trouble. Now that's just good game design. I mean, give it up for the devs. You wanted to go exploring and they left a little goodie for you? Huh? That's so nice of them. When you beat the game, you better watch those credits all the way through. Yes, sir. <laughs> Shit, this guy won't stop. Oh, like I was saying. If, if you saw what I saw, you'd say, damn, <laughs> that's me. <laughs> I like your, I like your outfit. I'm guessing that's, I'm going to need quality to material. Across the road I like the way, you know, sometimes when like this. two people can just sit in silence and just be, two beings can just sit in silence and just be, it just shows a closeness of like spirit. Well, you don't have to feel the time. You have to feel the voice and the talk. The words. Just take each other in like I'm taking you in right now. I'm just taking you in. And boy, it it's it's good. Oh, ha ha, it's good. You feel that wind? Yeah, it's just like circling around me. Wow. Alright, well, I'm I'm just gonna go quiet and I'm just gonna watch you now. I'm just gonna go quiet and watch you. I'm being quiet now. I'm just gonna Hello? watch you. Now. Hello? You gotta stop by here. I got a store. I got a store. Kenny. Oh, you said I'd never get any customers, huh, Dad? Well, guess what? What does this asshole look like to you? Sorry for calling you an asshole, by the way. I, I just, I didn't mean it. I got excited. You know, if nothing else, the fresh air out here has at least really cleared up my space asthma. Hey, cool, what? fucking cool. Walk away. Super fucking later. cool. Don't you care about families trying to support them? You gotta support local business, you son of a bitch! That's all we have are the small business people who care about putting food on their I table was getting and helping there. their children I was just checking be my better ammo people kill. than they were. Whatever happened to the world dream where you can dream big, Hey, you, you, you please stop. Please, come on. Come on over here, small. please. But it's okay. No judgment here. It's no skin off my back. You don't have to buy stuff if you hate everything. 
My dad is gonna flip the fuck out when I tell him I had a real customer. Oh my god. Almost sounds like Walt Flanagan. Okay, please, please, please come back and buy more later. Yeah, yeah, promise me. It's from my dad. You must have bought something really good in there. Holy I'm shit, somebody, somebody said, I, I have a store. Come on, come on over here. You. you deserve all the good things you want. And you supported a bumpin' local business. <laughs> That's just fantastic. It helps the economy out here. In Zappa Paradise, you're helping this shop. That's set up somewhere out in the middle of nowhere. That's probably the first sale they ever made. That probably was gonna sell their little aislings off to college. You're helping support an ecosystem. Yes. Oh, thanks for deciding to bring me back out. I just realized I'm late for my big date. I'm gonna go fuck another really hot gratin. Wish me luck. It was so nice meeting you. Fucking hell, finally. I was just about ready to shoot myself. I figured out a way while he was talking. <laughs> it's just like, if I crap at this specific angle. Club shots ready. Oh, my skin's cold. Sweezy's ready for blood. Well, guess what? I think that. I should bump down the music to you. It's like when I bump down the FX, it makes everything else seem louder. It's got like 35. Voices are fun. Three. None of it sounds any different, it just varies. Any reason you're not using my time bubble? Gives a shit if you kill him. These little guys barely even count. to use my glock shot. I don't know why I 
kept stopping. Yes, mansion. Yuck. The world is very confusing when it comes to what is and isn't tacky. <laughs> our guy come on come on come on hand over the Fergals I need my fix so I can get back to working on these resort plans you know <laughs> I can feel the shakes coming Krubus filled you in right he said he'd send someone over with another batch is that you <laughs> damn dude you're like obsessed I like both your pets and the things you use to get high. Don't feed them after midnight, I guess. But it's kind of nasty. Yeah, a lot of this stuff does seem like AI art. Okay, let's, uh, let's deal with you. Huh, I don't see a warp device on you. Oh, come on, is Krubus making you hoof it around on foot? Oh, that cheapskate bastard, same old Krubus. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> Here, I got an extra. Oh, for real? You're going to be cool? Maybe it won't kill you. Don't let anyone ever tell you Ranchi's not a generous fella, okay? There's an unused warp disc in there, too. You know, warp in whatever's on there. I don't care. It's free of charge. There's a river near here you can probably cross with it. Oh, man, go nuts. <laughs> warp remote. Load this remote up with a warp disc and use it to warp in any base or chunk of space with those coordinates on it. Just find a suitable location and warp away. Get warpaholics. <laughs> Okay, sick. Yeah. That was easy. Hey, hey, come, 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 come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Lean in close. Get close to me, man. I'm sure Krubus told you I'm here on Zephyr to break ground on a new Delarmo Land Resort. Yeah, I'm that ranchy Delarmo, CEO, Delarmo Industries. This one's gonna be even better than the one on Glassport 12. Trust me, man. That guy's busy as shit, always hopping from site to site. He's got like 30 different mines all across Zephyr. You think I can keep track of that? Fuck. I see him when I see him, okay? I, I wish you'd take some time off, though. You know? Hey, I want to talk to him about Delarmo Land. I, I'm sure you've been to Delarmo Land before, probably the flagship Glashborg 12 location, but, buddy, you would not believe the regulations we had to abide by over there. Real motherfucking sticklers. So I hit up Krubus, you know, and make a deal with the G3, and now we're setting up a brand new location here on Zephyr. Where ain't nobody gonna breathe down our necks about safety protocols or background checks on all the performers, you know? And you're probably wondering why nothing's been built yet. Well, I might have got a little bit sidetracked. 
drawing up blueprints takes a lot out of me, you know? So I unwind with a little Fergal or two. Sue me. But we're making good progress. Yeah? Or will be soon. Another thing. Check out the scale model of the new Delarmo land, because <laughs> it's got a lot of detail. <laughs> it's going to be the planet's only all-inclusive pansexual drug bazaar. <laughs> on the beach, you can get your it's rocks off while getting your surf on, and I can have all the Fergals I want. That's just a perk on top of a rock-solid development plan. And once I stop enjoying the perk, I'll get right back to planning this resort any day now, as soon as I've had my fill of the Fergals. Oh, man, Krubus. <laughs> what a guy. You see that photo over there? That's a snap of me and the Krub, man. That shit was like, I don't know, 20 years ago, man? That's how long we've known each other. He used to be a real wild man before he turned into such a frickin' stodger, you know? Mm, I got clean. Mm, I got sober. <laughs> All paperwork and shift management. I mean, crew man, you work for the space mafia. You'd think you'd still have a little fun every now and then. <laughs> oh, man, I'm sweating. <laughs> I am sweating so hard right now. Sorry for all the rambling. Uh, what are you still doing here? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, all right. It's very okay. Neat. Uh, uh, okay. Okay. The high is wearing off, and I'm starting to feel a little antsy. Okay. I need some Fergals. Pronto. Whoa! What the hell are you doing? Pretending to shoot me? <laughs> you crazy fuck. <laughs> I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got me. Uh, you really had me going there first. If these walls could talk, they'd say, "Don't shine a black light." Sick. We swindled that sack of shit out of a warp device. Let's find a spot by the river to try it out. It's like literally right here. Uh, don't touch anything, not even the ground. If possible, ground can have diseases too. Oh, great! Another portal that's out of order. Fix it faster, you little freaks! Hey, dipshit, you know you can use that warp device here, right? Hey there, it's me, Sudo. I'm back. Uh, looks like you're trying to use that new warp device you just got. You want me to help you out? Yes. Highway warp disk. This warp... Uh, disc ranch you gave you contains coordinates to an alien highway. Maybe you can warp it in to use it as a bridge. Ah, oh, those poor bastards. They're gonna be so upset. They're gonna be upset because they're probably using the Great highway work! Wow, them. wasn't that fun? Okay, see you later. I'm diving right back into Gene's old porn archives. Even AI can jack off. Oh, great. You warped in a bridge. Big fucking deal. You're gonna cross it or what? Come on, fucking move! Hey, where you want me to fucking go, huh? You want I should just disappear all this fucking traffic? Hey! Holy shit, where the fuck are we? Hey, who gives a shit? I got places to be. Fuck you! Hey, both of you! Shut the fuck up! I'm gonna Eat fucking my kill ass, you! Shithead! Move your fucking car! Oh, this is bullshit! And don't make me grab my baseball bat! What kind of drivers are you? Just figure it out! And don't make me get my brass fucking knuckles! Fuck you! Fuck you! I don't got all day here! I know we're on another weird place, but we got still places to go! And hey, come over here! Come over here and say that! What kind of inconvenience is this? Go to hell, dude! Those moplets told no, us to head you. back after getting the warp device. Hey. Move it! Learn how to drive, asshole! What'd you say? Not your mother! Not you fucking suck! You suck! <laughs> oh, I love them so much. What's up, little buddy? That was weird. Why was I able to interact with you when you don't say anything? Oh, 
possible. So Quick! Use me to shoot yourself in the head so you don't die of poison! the man in the mansion. He's a real piece of shit, but credit where credit is due. He gave us this warp device for some completely dumbass fucking reason. By the gods, you've done it. You got the warp device. This might actually work. You continue to provide us with hope, Grand Savior. With this warp device, you can warp Krubis directly to you. How fortuitous. But alas, you'll need his coordinates and a blank warp disk to encode them onto. Hmm. Oh well, no way you're getting those. That stuff's in the mines. We could just go down there and get it right now. Oh, right. Take this access code and head down to the mines. Everything you need is there. All right, enough already. We get it. Go to the mines, find some shit. We'll figure it out. Thanks, buttholes. <laughs> Please do not let us down. You don't get to oh, tell us joke. what we can fucking do. We'll let you down if we want to. <laughs> I advise you to get a move on. <laughs> Just kidding. Take your time. Enjoy the village. I was only doing some classic advisor humor. I can tell you're pure of heart. I know I am. That was never in question. Don't say it like people thought I wasn't pure of heart. <laughs> All right. Let's get rolling. This fucking rules! Oh yeah, we got the code for this. Bet you feel real proud of yourself getting that door open, huh, dipshit? <laughs> Great, the G3's trying to tame the mites too, as if they weren't annoying enough already. Let's fucking go! Let's fuck shit up! Oh, that's way easier. Cool. 
Hello there, Blim City, City Citizen. This is Magistrate Claude Nugman. And I want you to know that I can... Want, I want to know if I can count on your vote in the upcoming election. Ugh. I always hate those friggin' texts. We also want you to donate a lot of money to our campaign if, you, if you're able. If you do donate, we'll send even more emails because now we know you'll donate if we're pushy. <laughs> That's fine. Very true. Very true. Fucking little freaks! G3 versus Mites. Whoever wins, we win. Yeah, you gross little freak! I'm gonna eat the bunny hunter's heart! Kenny, back in action! Music in this game is really chill. You died. Guess I'll just sit here and hope someone else comes along to pick. <laughs> I don't feel like I deserve those deaths where I just get stuck and there's no other way out than killing myself. into trouble. I may, maybe they'll sort this out themselves. I already did this one. There was a line in between the two 
is. There it is. Oh yeah, so I did get Finally! What? Did I piss you off or something? It's been like five minutes. <laughs> Yep, the G3 mines must... There you go, that's the G3 for you. Ruining every fucking thing they touch. Not that I like this place anyway. Oh yeah, Here. more cannon fodder. Rip up the shreds! Oh shit, Grimptons. Gotta be honest, uh, you know, they're, they're working for the G3, but still better than our friend from earlier. I'm top. Where'd you go? Let's try that elevator. Three crystals. They just keep bringing them to me. Let's go! 
Okay, this should take us down into the mines. Going down, huh? Sorry, I, I almost made a crest joke, but I'm, I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it. We're better than that. No crest jokes from me. That's a promise. Not from me, anyways. You might warp in some bases and lord only knows but you know from me over here as a gun character sidekick no crash jokes a hundred percent on the level with you and no bad stuff yep guess this is our stop let's see what happens oh shit <laughs> you remember the plan, right, dipshit? Oh, yeah, I'm alive. Play warp disc, find out where Krubus is, don't forget. I, I got your scent, I'm tracking you down. Bye bye. I'm gonna fracture your fossils. Yes, I'm gonna, I'm gonna melee you right to the moon, Alice, right to the moon. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Get out of my clothing section. Oh, that's right. I forgot I could melee you. I'm gonna kill you. Support the chief three. I'm good to go. So soon. Must have remembered something you needed. Volleyball, glob, kidney. Better to live on my knees than die on my feet. That's what I always say. I mean, the other way, you're dead, right? Live on my knees and die on my feet. I don't blame <laughs> you for not wanting any of this stuff. It's not great. <laughs> Attention, mining operation 12C. It's me, Krubus. Speed things up! I'm fucking underwater here trying to keep things on schedule, and I figured... You see that shit? He's got a Gatlian. Let's rescue his ass. Oh, it's really man, easy to I find more slaves. Look, let's do your job and mine more Fergals. Krubus out. There was more Mining Operation 12C. This is Krubus again. One of you weird moplet fucks just delivered me a batch of defective Fergals. You want to know how I know they're defective? Because they're fucking dead! Looks like most of them got crushed in a cave-in. And I punished the moplets responsible, but it looks like they died in the cave-in too. Don't let it happen again. Don't let it happen again. What did we get? 
What's up, fuckers? It's me, Krubus again. Someone filled out the wrong shipping destination on an entire stack of Form 40Qs. You fucked up my whole day when you did that. Just come forward and tell me whose fault it was. I wish I could promise you I won't kill you, but I'm definitely gonna kill you! Talked in like the first hour of the game and never after. I don't understand. Hell yeah! Hey, it's Krubus again. Just bored this time. I've been standing at the paperwork all fucking day and my brain's melt. I, I fucking hate paperwork. Why the fuck does Garmatuus always stick me with the paperwork? Doesn't he know I have fucking drills for hands? For one thing, that means I should be drilling. And for another, it means I, I, I keep shredding all this important fucking paperwork. Just hire Power someone sliding. Cut off the phone with corporate. The new hire's coming in today. No. <laughs> no, I don't know what they look like. Why is that your first question? I don't know, Merle. <laughs> Maybe it's because we work in an office and don't ask for fucking headshots with our applications. <laughs> no, exactly. I literally have no idea what they look like. I want to report them. Bob Kidney, fun new organ for Kenny that lets him generate slime faster. Walk in right now. I would just assume they were the new hire. Yes, I mean, that's true. I don't care. No, I. That's the difference between you and me. Is that I let life happen to me. You, you try to control it. Oh, get it in your grips. Well, guess what? You're gonna learn a lesson real quick. You can't fight the ocean. And that's why I'm... Oh, I missed. Shit. <laughs> You know, I bet Sweezy could get past those turbines with her, like, time slow ability. Yeah, yeah, nope. Trash bag babies number four, muscular Maddie. Sometimes you see a guy with muscles and you think, wow, they're strong. Other times you think, okay, you know, you know what? That's too many muscles. You need to calm down and stop getting more muscles. You look crazy. <laughs> Snorting fucking pre-workout. <laughs> it's called blow up. Oh, big deal. I can slow down spinning death blades. It's easy for me. Dad, Shit, I, I forgot the thing. No, it didn't grab. I'm gonna be in a death loop. Calling it death loop. Oh, oh wait, no. Oh. Alright, cool. Do I still have the collectibles from over there? One last thing. Mining Operation 12C! This is Cruz again. According to all the hot monitors we forcibly implanted in all you moplets, you're working at 8% less efficiency Power today. Slide. Hey, what's going on in here? I'm so sorry. I didn't see you there. I'm Helen. I just need to know, are you the new hire or the new boss? The new boss. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Fuck yeah, I'm the new boss. Do I look like a wage slave to you? Let me in. I'm ready to boss people around. Wow, impressive. I'm inspired already. Head on through those doors and don't be afraid to get tough. These new guys really need some strong leadership. Mm -hmm. Right through here. You're their new boss. They'll do whatever you say. 
All right, listen up, you maggots. Sweezy's the new boss in town, and you all gotta do what I say. I'm gonna whip your shit into shape. Any questions? No, ma'am. No, 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 ma'am. Uh, we were just filing paperwork. Oh, just, just tell us what you want us to do, ma'am. Kiss each other on the mouths! What the fuck? You want us to kiss each other? Yeah, on the fucking mouths! With tongue! I actually can't do this, because I'm, um, I'm married. That's a shame. I always thought you were really hot. Yeah, me too. Oh my god, whoa, do you, do you mean it? Of course! Look at you! Have you even seen your ass? You have a perfect ass, Dimitri. Thank you, yeah, <laughs> I, I agree, I have a very perfect ass. Now, uh, come, o come over here. <laughs> Damn. Is that what All you right, wanted, Sweezy? Enough. Really hot stuff, but enough. Now, what's next? Go back to filing paperwork. I kind of want to try this. Everyone fight. fight each other. Do we have to? Yes. Uh, fine. Oh, that really hurt. Damn. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing? You, you can't just hit them like that. Alright, that was good shit. <laughs> okay, how was that? Very good, thank you. Now let's see, what's next? Fire each other, murder each other. Oh. Murder each other. Huh? But... No buts! Come on, I'm the boss. You have to do exactly what I say or else. Come on, we're, we're not gonna kill each other. That's crazy. That's it. I'm gonna say it. No, don't. I am. Here we go. You're a bad boss. Whoa! Where'd that come from? I'll do it. I'll kill the other two. No problem. There we go. Dimitri, I love your energy. Huh? Jeez. Come on, Dimitri. <laughs> Have some pride. You don't have to do this. Sorry. Yeah, I won't do it, actually. No, fuck this. You have to. You have to kill each other because I'm the boss. Oh, yeah? Well, we quit. We're quitting right now. All of us. Right, guys? It's not just me. Oh, wait, hold on. I, I don't know about this. Dimitri. Um, yeah, okay, fine. I, I quit, too. See you never, asshole. Well, shit. I, uh, I guess I got a little carried away there. There's a lesson for everyone in what Getting just happened. Glad you we all got to experience that. Hall. Anyway, it's all done now. I'm done being the boss. Let's see if there's anything around here about Krubus. It's all just boring. Wait, wait, wait. They ate the last donut. <laughs> Fuck, Krubus' office really looks like shit. Let's find what we need in bail. I have actual hands. Krubus, where are you? This is Garmantuous. I just checked the log and you're three days behind schedule with the latest shipment. But you know what? It's not that big of a fucking deal. These Fergals aren't going to be worth shit now that we discovered humans. Might even have to shut this whole operation down just to get all hands on deck over on Earth. I can give your territory to the Screndel brothers and have them expand their facilities to find out more about these humans. Oh, have you tried one of these fuckers yet? Oh, God, the high? It's otherworldly. Can't believe a species like this really exists. Humans! <laughs> even thought. Anyway, don't fuck up again, even if it no doesn't matter, or I'll somehow. smoke you myself. Here we go, fucking bingo! This idiot left a paper trail. Borb Day the 12th, that's today. We fucking got him! Okay, so what, we just need the blank warp disk now? Easy peasy. I wonder if Helen will say anything. Oh. Okay. Let's go! Cut it out, 
We don't have to kill them. I thought it would be satisfying to try manual. Oh, you're leaving. Well, never mind then. Bye. As I was saying, turns out it's not so satisfying when you're a slave. You know, I uh, really don't like manual labor, but that's what happens when you get captured and are forced to do something you don't like. Okay, you, you gotta stop talking. I really need to focus on my work. This is really tough work for us. We're a very weak species. You might think I'm joking, but all my bones have turned to jelly. No, seriously, that's what the doctor told me. <laughs> I hope they give me a break soon. I don't think I can go another day. Oh, it'd be so cool if someone killed Krubus. Then we could all be free. Fuck! <laughs> that was fuck. <laughs> I don't even know if that was supposed to happen. Uh, we that keep way, asking them to get a canary in case we hit a vein of carbon monoxide. You know, us moplets can breathe carbon monoxide, so we'd be fine. We just think it would be fun to rescue a dying bird. You know, anything to feel emotions again. <laughs> oh, moplets are cool. Almost as tough as moplets. D don't, don't get me in trouble. Calm down. We're on your side. Fuck the G3. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Thank God. We need a blank warp Didn't disk. Really Got one? Ah, yes. Our prince has a oh. stash of them. Whoa, for real? All you need to do is clear out the warp base the G3 plopped on in our holy land. <gasps> then you'll reclaim the sacred grounds and rescue Prince Chosen One. And then we grab a blank disk from the <sighs> prince. Perfect. Yes, oh, yes. We can, we can help each other. Oh, what a fortuitous happenstance. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Just tell us the plan. We have started a resistance. Not only do the G3 enslave us, but they have, but they have desecrated our holiest of sites and absconded with our sweet prince. Prince Chosen One. That's, that's him. Prince Chosen One. Nice. I already see where this is going and I love it. You're going to torture this sad sack merc for intel. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, that's smart. No, we, we didn't think of that at all. But it's fine, we know where the prince is. They swapped him out with the rest of our sacred grounds when they warped in a new base. Well, that's easy. We can just clear out their base and warp back the throne room. Oh, heavens! Would you really do all that for us? The base is just past this <gasps> tunnel. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Who's prince Your chosen? prince is really named Prince Chosen One? Yes! He was named as such according to the prophecy. <gasps> And then after that, it was made into a prince. Wait, you choose your princes based on prophecies? No wonder he couldn't stop his people from being enslaved. Well, the prophecy doesn't guarantee he's going to be good at his job. It just tells us who to pick. Look, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. Look, now is not the time to criticize us. We're, I'm just, you know, we're distressed as it is. I'm just doing my job. We're done here. <clears throat> You know, this prince dude better be worth saving. He better be really handsome and charming, or I'm gonna feel bamboozled. <laughs> right, let's see how to get down there. Ugh! Forgot about it. I wanna say. Yeah, it's gonna be more like here. There we go. Ugh! We're in poison! Use your last bit of strength to throw me to safety! 
Sludge. We're looking for. Come on, time to get violent. A disc in here. Okay, let's head back outside and use this to reverse the warp. to see if it had a crystal that I should collect, but then I realized you also would need it to tell what it is. So. Here we go! It's print time, baby! Oh, fuck off! This pathetic schlorb is the chosen one? He's as lazy as the name they gave him. <laughs> and what the hell do you want? Hey, dipshit, you know we just saved you, right? Saved me from what? I'm fine. Oh, fuck, whatever. Can we bum a blink warp disc? Huh? Yeah, 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 sure. I've got a bunch. All right, we got everything. Take us back to Ranchy's shithole mansion and we'll hijack his encoding machine. Fritz Chosen One has returned! All has been restored! 
Prince Chosen One. I am so sorry, but we're out of Klagorsh. Can I interest you in some Plagorb? I don't want Plagorb! I want Klagorsh! You said that you wouldn't run out of Klagorsh again. You promised! I don't even know why I stick around here. If I leave, you're all dig dang bloop! Just try and find a chosen one better than me. I dare you! Oh, no, 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 please, please. It is already written in the prophecies. Set in stone for eons to come. You are the chosen one. There is no other. Do not dare us. Exactly. Yet you're out of Klagorsh again. Tell me where that makes sense. Just tell me, there's a real disconnect going up. We're so sorry, chosen, chosen one. Uh, what about my lumbar support? I thought you were gonna get something for my lumbar. It's killing me. I get warped out by G3 Maniacs, and I get back and my lumbar is in dire need of support. I look around me, and I don't see any ding-dang support. And on top of it all, there's no Klagorsh! We are so, so undeserving. Klagorsh is hard to come by. Forgive us, Prince one. I'm finding that pretty hard these days. I'm going through a lot of stuff. Maybe you think it's easy being chosen, but it ain't. I'd love to see one of you guys be chosen. Not the fucking hey, toxic sludge! Oh, <laughs> I guess not. I guess this is in case you fall or something. Oh wait, no, here we go. That's probably love. Yeah. Yeah, let's get back up there. I was thinking there was gonna be like a secret little treasure chest down here where we weren't close enough for to show up. Oh, there's a Shortcut. I know you're doing all I the walking, but it. I'm exhausted. Shit, you need a jetpack to cross this. Wait, are there jetpacks in the game or something? Alright. Look up to your new gods above! Then we'll come back once we have a jetpack. Just so you know, you can come back to the house through those corridors. You can just pop on back whenever you want and pay. It's gonna have his donger out. Ten bucks. We can watch TV together or something. I don't know, I'm bored. So 
this is what it's like to have legs. Creepy crawly bastard! What's wrong? Were we too fast for you? How'd I already got them? Finders keepers! I still didn't find a way to do anything like that. your bloodlust, but I don't want to hurt these guys. Save it for the G3. Give me another crystal. All right, I'll take it. Ah, <laughs> oh, gross! You know this shit is poison, right? Okay, now I've grabbed the crystal like ten times. <laughs> driving you get it out of a cereal box or some shit yeah you look you look like a loser you look like a fucking loser you shouldn't be on the road you shouldn't there it is now let's see if he 
this story. All right, let's make this quick. I don't want to have to deal with this guy again. Hey, uh, you're back. Ah, oh, thank God. Thank fucking God. Uh, did you bring my Fergal? Uh, I need a bed. Uh, I need my fix, kid. Oh, I need a bed. I need it real bad. Whoa, Ranchy, you're not looking so hot. Let me guess, withdrawals? Does that make you happy? Oh, you love that, don't you? You love to see him. Uh, master of industry, all flummoxed like this, all low and, uh, yeah, maybe, maybe. Uh -huh. Ranchy, my man, you gotta shape up. We need to use your encoder. What? No, the encoder is off limits until I get my goddamn Virgil fix. Virgils, get him. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Oh, yeah, great, got it. We're just gonna go ahead and use the encoder while you're having your little medical emergency. <laughs> Fuck. Not sure how this thing works, but here we go. What's the worst that could happen? Hell yeah! Krubus, you piece of shit! We're coming for you! Or you're coming to us! Whatever! I don't feel so good at all. Please! Give me Fergals! Oh, fuck! Genius alert! Let's swap out this whole dumb goddamn mansion for Krubus! I'm down for that. Is there anything I didn't do in here, like, fleet wise? You don't even work for <laughs> Krubus, do you? I'm gonna go with no. That was funny that he just standing there and just slams into the ground. <laughs> Who the fuck are you? You're mine, Krubus! That wasn't supposed to be a mining pun. I mean, I'm gonna kill you! Oh! Hey! Where you going, you rude jag off? I was talking in! Oh boy, he looks like he hovers. Let's kill this fucker. Ah, you didn't like that, did you? Ah, trick holes ready? Ah, you think that hurts? It does hurt a bit. That's fine, you gotta be sure. Ah. This is over, I'll shoot them like drills. It's fine for a minute if you're scared. Ah, yep. I thought I saw Sweezy. You're the bounty hunter who killed Douglas, right? Oh, I'm gonna love drilling a hole in your head. Now, honestly, I do appreciate the break. You know, it's all paperwork and scheduling day in and day out, but I'm more suited to fucking up some intruders like this. Oh yeah, bring it on, you pieces of shit! Damn, man, why aren't you dead? <laughs> See you later! I'm still trying to figure out what exactly I like Sweezy fighting, because for the um, G3 main dudes, almost everything is better with um, Kenny. But she's decent at fighting. Now, honestly, like, I do appreciate the break. You know, it's all paperwork. It's definitely day in and day. Now, honestly, I... Which stab is this all? Die already! Die already! I'm going to slice you right in half. Ha! Bring it on. I can take it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stop shooting at you, asshole. All right, Dr. Squeezy. Ah, 
Yep. I thought I saw Sweezy. You're the bounty hunter who killed Thumbus, right? Oh, I'm gonna love drilling a hole in your head. These little guys barely I, even count. I do appreciate the break, you know, so. <laughs> you can't beat me. I got more left in me. It's Virgil time, baby. Oh, so they don't even really have you drilling, do they? You got the perfect Mega Man ass character design for drilling, and they've just got you doing paperwork. Come on, let us put you out of your misery. Ah. I'm gonna drill you so hard and, and not like in a weird way, but like an actual drill going through your body. No, no, it Here comes like the disc! It keeps going in ways where I can't grab it. Come on. It's fine for a minute, you're getting scared. They just keep coming! What's that, fuckers? Can't hide from us, Admiral. <laughs> I'm not gonna let you fucking kill me. Fuck this. I need an edge. How do you even wipe your ass with two drills for hands? You just tearing it up down there or what? <laughs> You fucking teasing me? Let me carve him up! Let me do something! <laughs> there we go. Alright, cold blooded driller. Defeat Krubus. You're depriving me of that sweet, sweet stabbing right now, cunt. Let me in there! Oh god, this feels amazing! You have no idea! Oh god, I'm in, I'm in heaven right now! Oh, oh, you should see this! Oh, ripping through his drill tenants like they're butter! Oh! Oh, I was really getting my glumps off there, wasn't I? <laughs> Sorry about that. Satisfies dust for me. Gus. Hey, bud, the name's Gus. Feel good to meet you. Look at you, man. Pretty slick taking out Krubus like that, rescuing me from indentured servitude, etc., etc. I love that kind of stuff. You know what? I love that. That's the kind of stuff I love, man. Do you mind if I tag along with you for a bit? I, of course. I, I, that's what I was hoping you'd say. We can use your help. But I should be clear that we are trying to take down the whole G3 cartel, and we might die. Music to my ears. You think I don't want to take down the cartel? Buddy, that's all I, I want to do. That's all I dream about. Amazing, God, I'm so glad to find another Gatlian alive and well. I love your tiny little hands, by the way. I, I, I had a cousin who had those tiny hands. He died in the zombie apocalypse on Gatlas, but, you know, look, I'm sure you don't want to hear about that. We had to live through it. I mean, you know, who wants to talk about that? Here's what I do. I shoot discs, right? They stick onto certain walls, and you can climb with them. 
see, 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 that's what I'm talking about. Now climb up there. Aren't you glad you met me? Hey, oh shit, cool. time to fight. Hoo hoo, okay. Oh, you can't hide from us, asshole. Oh, so he is like a shotgun. Ah. <laughs> it's like how wobbly he is. Hey, you're not supposed to be down here. No, 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 don't shoot this guy. Let me show you what else Papa Gus can do. Fuck you, whoa, what the here fuck? It comes. Pretty chill, right? Use that whenever you want. It's cool. <laughs> and I see another wall you can climb. You see that, right? Hmm, still a little far away. I'm not sure you can jump to that one. Oh, we're definitely gonna die in this shit. Oh, hey, it's me, Quentin the Quentin again, your best friend. I actually decided to patch things up and rejoin the J3. Do you mind if I kill you real quick? <laughs> Let's see how much you talk when you're dead. Oh, I, oh, I got this. Believe me, I got this. Finally, enough of that guy. They kicked him out of the G3 because he was so damn annoying. He's lonely, he's bitter, and get a life. Some people need a life, and he needed a life, man. <laughs> Freedom, baby. I already felt free when you saved me from Krubus. But now that we're out of the pit, I really feel free. At least I got to die up here. At least I have to die. Seriously? Fuck a duck! I'm coming after you! Come on, let me up. I'm like hitting the lip on the bottom of it. Shit. Wanna head back and turn in this bounty? That was kind of glorious. I really should read through these at some point. I'm having too much fun. So I'm gonna try it. Hey, kid! Another one's down, huh? Great work! <laughs> but, uh, hey, there's something you should see. Take a look after you turn in your bounty. I don't know why it keeps playing the same thing on TV too. Alright, good. Get over here. Check this out. Hello, Blim City citizens. That's Clug Nugman, Blim City Magistrate. As you all know, I'm working hard to flush out all the crime and drugs from our streets. I'll be the first to admit, we haven't made much headway in the fight against the G3 cartel. Alright, all right. now catch this next bit. About to change. We've learned of a bold bounty hunter who's been bravely taking this G3 matter into their own hands. You hear that? He's talking about you! They've already so dealt with two of the That's cartel's like... most powerful officers. Yeah, you got lucky. I am not too proud to ask for help in our war on drugs. Bounty hunter, if you're listening, please consider joining forces with the good people of Blim City. I hope you'll choose to come forward and meet with me personally at my office in City Hall. I mean, we might as well hear him out, right? <laughs> I already told him you go. Without even asking us first? No, don't start. Trust me, he's legit. This guy's been anti-G3 since before any of you were even in diapers. Honestly, I don't know if Gatlin's even wear diapers. Just head through there. Clug's expecting you. Do it in a minute. Hey. 
Where the hell are you going? Oh, Who talked to Clug? Jesus. Well, let me at least show him my room first. Hmm. So this is where the magic Come happened. On. You know how hard it is to get a meeting with the magistrate? Oh. Don't keep him waiting. Talking all that shit. Thank you so much for coming, Bounty Hunter. That's Our pleasure. Show. Nice view you got up here. It's, look, uh, I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You're a human, human, correct? My men looked into it. Sorry. You survived the G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? Yeah, they're a human. We're Gatlians. Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the human would join forces, but perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? <laughs> a lawless bounty hunter teaming up with a squeaky clean politician. <laughs> really? That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing the species drug trade. I can only do so much, and only within the confines of the law. I mean, I've got my hands full with Gary the Poisoner. He's not just poisoning the water supply, he's moved on to poisoning weirder stuff now, like street lamps. We don't even know how that works, or if it's actually a problem. Maybe it's fine to poison street lamps. I'm a bit overwhelmed, and I wish I could focus more time on the G3. But you... You've taken out two top G3 officers in less time than it takes us to file a single report. So you see how you can help me, but there's also one way I can help you. Go on, let me take it all in. This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until the G3 are dealt with. It's a trap. It's literally so I can help collect humans. Calling it. Let me get this straight. You're giving this to us for free. Well, the human species is technically a drug. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens, and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems, assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. That's right. Then, thank you. Sincerely, you humans and Gatlians, you're both very noble species. This means a lot to me. I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. I'm just glad I have someone like you to turn to. As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we had. The rest is in your hands. We appreciate that, pal. If it's okay if I call you pal. That's all I have for you. Feel free to stay as long as you like. The view is breathtaking. This is pretty neat. Oh, uh, feel free to stay as long as you'd like. I know, it's a trap. Alright, so what I was saying is uh, some of the stuff looks really familiar. You can visit the like human Jar -Jar haven yourself, by the way. We don't know exactly what We're makes humans comfortable, earlier. but I hope you like how we've set things up. Alright, so... Uh, I know that robot, but I don't remember where from. I won't ask to see I don't your think face, it's super but jail. I am curious. I'll bet you're covered in cool battle scars, maybe even a badass eye patch. Oh, it'd be so cool if you didn't Ninja have an Turtle. eye. Um, I honestly feel like the Hunchback in Notre Dame. Then, whatever the hell he's supposed to be. Almost looks like the Super Jail one might even be a different one I remember from, I think, Venture Brothers. Famous. Um, on to the next place. Look at us! And we're back! So, it went well, huh? I got a message saying they'll hook us up with any G3 intel they find. Yeah, and he hooked us up with a way to save humans! God damn! You got it easy. Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. Hey, uh, speaking of, we should get you a jetpack before you head back out into the field. You're really gonna need it. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. Oh, and yeah, you might want to hit up Broto's chef stand, too. It's a little shady, but uh, those warp discs he's selling can be pretty helpful. It's like three out of ten. <laughs> like, the 80s was I'm a serious. really weird time. No more bounties until you get a jetpack from Mr. Keep. Yeah. I know, 
Let's see if I can get it. Mm. So this is where the magic happens, huh? Kidding? You're barely gonna be able to get around this universe without a jetpack. I don't know how you managed to get this far. Sure, hello again, value customer. We've got some new stuff. Mr. Keeps. Our algorithm indicates that you might be interested in purchasing a hey! jetpack. Asshole, come over here right now. Sorry for yelling and calling you an asshole, but I need you to come over here right now and buy my illegal shit. I think that guy's trying to get our attention. Here's what's up. My name's Stan, and I sell vials of alien cum. I know that's probably not what you wanted to hear when you walked over here. You want it cum or what? <laughs> uh, you sorry. sell alien cum? Why the fuck do you do that, man? No, it's gross, but calm down. My name is Stan, and I sell horrendous amounts of all sorts of alien cum, and we're just gonna have to live with that knowledge together now. <laughs> you listening. telling me to my face that you have enough customers to sustain a business where you sell alien cum? Come from an alien. I consider it policy not to ask my clients why they want the gallons and gallons of alien cum they buy from me. I figure the less questions I ask about what people are doing with all this alien cum, the better. So, are you buying True. or True. nay? Do we look like you know, I'm, I'm trying not to get insulted, but I think you might be barking up the wrong tweet. You're telling us that we look like we're the type of people to buy your product. Sure. Look, I have absolutely no idea. I'm shocked to my core every time somebody buys literally truckloads of alien cum from me. But they do <laughs> it all the time. There's no rhyme or reason to it. I've been completely unable to narrow it down to a set of demographics. Grannies, cops, movie stars, politicians, <laughs> everybody likes my delicious alien cum. I've had every type of weirdo coming up here saying, I like 600 gallons of your absolute highest quality alien cum. And, and, and I say, does it matter which aliens the cum come from? And they say, no, sir, it truly does not. I just want some alien cum. No further details needed. So what? what's it going to be? You want some alien cum or not? Fuck it. <laughs> Let's have some cum. I'll try anything. <laughs> Whoa, look at you. You want some alien cum. I'm so glad you're interested. Look, you caught me on a good day. I'm doing a promo one time off of free alien cum. Take some on the house, and if you like it, just come back and get some more. Just tell all your friends Gallon about me. Of alien Say cum. Stan has the absolute best alien cum I've ever seen, tasted, touched, whatever. I'm not sure if it's his or if he's getting it from some other alien, but I'm just such a huge fan of his work and what he's doing out there on the streets of Blam City selling alien cum to the community. <laughs> Say all of that. Okay. Ah, looking for more alien cum, are you? Well, I'm sorry. I'm fresh out of alien cum right now. We sell out early sometimes. I gotta go restock my supply, and that's not so easy, trust me. But give me a little bit, and I'll have plenty more. I promise. I just, I just need some recovery time. Oh, so it is his. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna need it later anyway, so. Alright, let me get the jetpack before I attempt to collect these. Oh, you just broke my rib. Wants me to break the rest of you. Look out, asshole. Yeah, it's, it's such a cute voice for that. Look out, asshole. But it's like adorable. <laughs> it's just like, aw. It's, it's cussing at me. <laughs> How cute. Alright, um, what's it doing? We're looking for a jetpack. A jetpack? Oh, certainly. I can help. Uh, I can help. Ah, jetpack, huh? Great choice. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that purchase in. Okay. 
Cool, so where's the jetpack? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it ready for you in a couple of days, I promise. No refunds, by the way. This purchase is final! Well, I was really kinda hoping we would get it right away. That's okay. Eternal firing track so he can reload fast before the next shot. I'm pretty sure that makes us so uh, he can... Oh, nice fire. choice. I hate to part with that. Disc blood. Stuff so, uh, disc blood how's that mother of yours, Joe? Guess to help him generate more discs faster and worry less about cooldown time and how painful it is for him to shoot those out of his body. Sure. Thanks she for sucks. your business. Don't buy anything else. This augmentation enhances Gus vacuum ability to let you suck a goop of armor right off of G3 enemies. That's kind of neat. Great choice! Excellent! Yeah, sure. Sure. Dad, can I clack out early? No, why? What are you, the cops? I don't owe you an explanation. Yes, you do. I'm your father and your boss. I'd like it better if you were the cops. Mm. Yeah, I'll take that. Mm -hmm. Good choice. Really good choice. Yeah, sure. Oh, okay. Just keep standing there exist. like an indecisive idiot. Oh, okay. Forget I exist. I'm sorry, what'd you say? Okay. Florida. It's Florida from a food stand near your house in Bloom City. If you're ever hungry, just swing on by some completely non-illegal burgers from my shop. I don't have the endurance for this shit. Let's say Florida's place is over this way. What we do here is, you know, it's a it's a device that pops the pills for you. It's for pill people, and it's a pill people oh, popper. Yeah. You want to know more information, go to pillpeople.com. All right, I'll see you guys at the bar. Buy me a drink or something. Come on. Go to pillpeople.com to understand all about pill distribution and pill taking information with this new revolutionary pill distribution method at pillpeople.com. Also, I just want to say, my child was kidnapped and I don't know where he is. Here's a photo of him. I know I wasn't allowed to do this, and that's it. Okay, well, we'll just end it there. I just, I'm glad I got to squeeze that in. And of course, this is more about pills and people. Okay, thank you. Hey, hey, listen here. I want you to meet my son. Hey, son, come out here. Hey, what's up? Yeah, I want you to meet. I want you to meet him. He's uh, looking for a wife. Yeah, I really need a wife. Yeah, so he's five foot two. Mm -hmm. Five hundred pounds. Mm -hmm. Wears diapers. Mm -hmm. And he's ready to marry. I'm ready to marry right now. Okay. It's been a long time since I've done anything with anyone, and I really want someone. Okay, that's it. See you guys. Bye. Oh fuck, we forgot to oh, do contact. Is there a number? Oh, oh no. Uh, no. Uh, but we didn't oh, get. Uh, no, no, we're good. Okay. Okay. Bye right, guys. Bye. Are you, you tired of your regular taking your pills situation where you have to put all your pills in like a first day through last day kind of container? Well, now there's a new solution. This company that I'm re representing here on this commercial has everything you need. We are PillPeople.com. We do have the internet here. It's PillPeople.com. I, actually, I don't know if I can say that. Maybe PillPeople.com is taken. Oh, it's for sale. For $1,000? i will buy it right now. I'll, bu I'll buy PillPeople right now. .com. Here we go. The, 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 the actor, you know, he's good, but he, he, he didn't know that we w that we actually had to buy this website. I own it. <laughs> Close to two Gs, I own it though. Okay, now that we've secured the domain and we're gonna finish up this commercial. <clears throat> Thank you so much. I just wanna say that uh, what we do here is we, you know, it's a, it's a device that pops the pills for you. It's for pill people and it's a pill people popper. 
you want to know more information, go to pillpeople.com. Hey, all right, I'll see you guys at the bar. Buy me a drink or something. Come on. Go to pillpeople.com to understand all about pill distribution and pill taking information with this new revolutionary pill distribution method. <laughs> pillpeople.com. Also, I just want to say, my child was kidnapped and I don't know where he is. Here's a photo of him. I know I wasn't allowed to do this. And that's it. Okay, we'll, we'll just end it there. I just, I'm glad I got to squeeze that in. And of course, this is more about pills and people. Okay, thank you. Hey! You that hungry black? That's my restaurant! I'm hungry black. We got red pop here, and that's it. We just have red pop. No food. Stop asking for food! We don't have it! Hi, uh, I, I'm just wondering if I can order a burger? No! Pete, I'm gonna put me on pill, 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 and put in the, put everything in the, in the, in the, in my pallet of pallets. I want to stop everything, you know, that's happening. You don't care about me. Just, Power slide. Don't touch. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put the pal, 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 pal in the thing. Let me, let me show you an example of what I have accomplished with one of my clients. Listen, this guy changed my life. I started out as Hey, like, you look hungry. Oh, wait, hungry wait. for some uh, deals? Am I right? You know, I don't have any pimples. Not that that's really sort of a thing. Hey, welcome to Blordo's. I'm Blordo. You here for the food? Or the other stuff? <laughs> what, what do you mean, other stuff? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Forget I said anything. <laughs> no, come on. We're, we're good. T tell us. Oh, fine. I sell secret shit if you know what to ask for. But don't tell the cops. Now order something or leave. <laughs> hi, hi, hey, 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 come over here. Hey, hey, yeah, you, yeah, you, yeah. Here. <laughs> over That's here. fucking awesome. Yeah. <laughs> you got it. I'm, look at me, guys. Look at me. <laughs> yep, this isn't even a show. It's just a guy talking. Isn't that fun? Isn't that fun? That's a fun idea. Let's get you fed, shall we? Wow, you're hungry. I'm still here and you're still special. This is not a TV show. Alright, so it says this. This warp disk contains the coordinates to warp in a quiet country cottage that sounds like a maze change of place. Um, this warp disk contains the coordinates to warp in an alien movie theater. I hear they're playing one of those new human movies. Cutie Town Warp Disc. This Warp Disc contains the coordinates to warp in an entire city. I wonder how that works. Good day to you, food customer! He's a bad Bloody hell, are you trying to draw attention to me or what? It's all good. I said it, I already said it, but I mean, I said it and mentioned this time. The other times I was just being a little skeezy, little fucking you know, little fucking good times. I love you. I don't like being on me. Let me show reaching out to your boy. It's been a minute, huh? Alright. Now that I guess we bought the thing, it's gonna be a minute before it works anyways. Too close to the wall. <laughs> Who'd you get? Snack money. Saying right over here, so I guess it's like right in here. I don't want to 
<laughs> just push him. Ah, <laughs> oh, didn't grab. Bloro, hungry, swing by. Ooh, look at that slide! In a way, this kind of feels a lot like Gardens of the Galaxy. <laughs> Except Quill probably had it a little bit harder than this. Alright, so we're saying it was over there somewhere. I'm gonna guess it's up on there. Oh yeah, I can see it now. So yeah, I need a way to get to that ledge. Open Adam! I think is going to be the jetpack. Yeah. All right. Well, I'll try it next time. If you touch me again, I'll sue you. We don't gotta kill everybody. Lucky. It is an offense for any person other than the owner to remove this notice. How'd it go? Did you get a jetpack? Yeah, but Mr. Keeps got it on back order, so we gotta wait. Great! Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Why don't you go to bed and sleep off some of that excitement? I'm a little drowsy. I can use a little sleep myself. You were fucking here? <laughs> First thing. Let's see if he can say something else. Good night, partner. No, wait, no, I'm just gonna it. sit right here and watch you fall asleep. I'm really glad we met. You know, I, I think I think we're doing something amazing here. How cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sorry, sorry. I, 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 I'm just, I'm excited. I'll shut up. L let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll be jetpacking across all the space. Sorry, I'm, I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to, let's get you to sleep. Partner, let's take this jetpack for a spin. Can you make it over that gap? You gotta use me more, okay? How's it going? We are really high right now. <laughs> that was something. It's so good to have your feet back on the ground. Well, it's too bad uh, I'm not really a big part of the show. I'm just this one segment. So see ya. All right, well, uh, thanks everyone for watching the bad show, the bad TV show. It's not good. All right. I love you. Goodbye. Oh, wow! Look at you! Look at you! If you're trying to scare the shit out of me, you have accomplished that!
There's no way that was your first time. No way. You've used a jetpack before. Yep, Gene was right. We're going to make good use of that jetpack. Let's head home and see if we can hop into a new bounty. In a minute. Do you know what you're doing? Can't we just stay on the ground for a bit? As I say, it's probably not that smart. It's probably really Woo-wee! It's one of the ones I saw at the beginning of the game and could never find it again. <laughs> I forgot where to look. That's a new bounty shot. Very cool. All right, easy now. Maybe I have something to do with that switch there. Let me ask you a question. How do I feel to hold? I'm just wondering if I'm like soft in your hands or too heavy or whatever. Do I fit in your hand okay? I, I just want to know that you're comfortable. Mm -hmm. so fast oh, shit. Whoa! <laughs> I fell into the only hole pretty sure it's up there Sky people now. Okay. 
I figured it out. <laughs> Keeping an eye on that fuel tank, right? Yeah. Yo, bounty hunter, wanna do some perfectly legal business? Hey, what's up? Yeah, I want you to meet. I want you to meet him. He's uh, looking for a wife. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Actually, let me check to see if that was the one that. Okay, hey, I'm me. fucking winded, buddy. You're winded from watching me. Don't slip up! Nope, it's so loud here somewhere. Shop real quick, see if they have anything. Sure, pay attention like we talked about. We got a customer. You gotta buy something. You ever been to a store before? You know how this works, right? Bring the jetpack is cool. Ah, I don't have a thousand. All right, <laughs> kinetic tank. Let you say we want to make a jetpack go a little higher. Can you do that? Yes, you can do that easily by having more connect tanks. Cool. I hope Jorb didn't bother you too much. All right, well, I want the Gadderall compartment. Want to hold more Gadderall? Come on, you know you, you know those Gatlians are hungry, and they're your responsibility. Bigger pocket to hold all the. I don't know. Oh, okay, that's for the. When you want to feed them those things. Good. So they can, I hate uh, selling stuff. Weapon. Also, I think you can just hold spacebar. You don't have to double tap it. Like don't you get tired running around so much? Oh, I didn't. Oh, shit! I literally let go of it and it didn't keep track that I was letting go. It's like right there. All right, I dig it. Well, I'll come by later just to make sure. I've been telling you to clean up. This place is a mess. I need you to clean it up before Tweed gets here. Oh, got a big date with your sad sack Flimborg boy toy? Fuck off, Gene. Like you've even never been on a date. Hey, don't even start, sister. I know a lot about dates. I fucked more aliens than your brain can comprehend. And even I don't want to touch your boyfriend. So sick of hearing about this guy. Yeah, right. My boyfriend is so fucking hot, though, right? Mm. Oh, come on. You haven't even seen him. Why'd you answer that? Trust me, you don't have to support her just because she's family. This guy's a loser. He so hot, he's like a low seven or a high six, and he's oh, really me. nice to me. Yeah, no <laughs> ulterior motives there. Just clean up after yourself, Jesus. Hey, look, I'm sorry if I'm coming off harsh. He's messing up the group dynamic. We've got a good thing going here. We do that fun sitcom banter back and forth while your nibbling here goes and blasts alien baddies in the face. It's great. Dude, you're lucky you even get to live here with us. I don't care about your damn dynamics. I'm just saying you barely know this guy. Are you sure you're even attracted to him? Most aliens only bang their own species. Oh, what about you? You just said you've slept with basically everything in the whole galaxy. Yeah, but I'm a washed up degenerate. You've got your whole life ahead of you. That's more <laughs> condescending than it is sweet. What? 
No, uh, look, we've spent all this time living together. I, I care about you now, Leslie. For fuck's sake, my name's Lizzie. Come on, tell her I care about her. I think he does. Excuse me? No, sorry, but I am not about to let this fuck-up degenerate school me on life decisions. The fact that I'm a fuck-up degenerate is exactly why you should yeah, let me school you on life decisions. I, I know better than anyone what not to do. You're both assholes. Yeah? Well, you're gonna get this tweed guy pregnant, and then I'll be here to tell you I told you so. Then who's gonna have to deal with all your mutant kids running around this house? Mutant me! Yeah, not that it matters, but I'm the one who would get pregnant. Not the way his species works. They get pregnant real easy. I'm so sick of this shit. Look, I just don't want Twig to think I'm messy, okay? It's that simple. And I don't want you dating him at all. Why don't I set you up with my nephew, Grimble Dick? He's got a steady Grimble job. Grimble Dick. And yes, before you ask, he's got both his legs. What a name. That's not like a family ailment or anything. Fuck off. Just grow up and get used to me and Twig. Come on, tell Jean I can date whoever I want. I mean, honestly, Thank you. you Not you that I needed your I feel approval. Like it's oh, fine, bad, yeah. Though. Team up against the depressed paraplegic. I didn't know you were depressed. Actually, I mean, I'm I knew you to were depressing. Har, har, har. Just clean up, Jean. Okay. Hey, is it a catfish? Sure. Can I see Drag you, you into all that. <laughs> anyway, a nice little arrangement with Clug is paying off. They sent us intel on two new bounties. So, uh, go ahead if you want to get started on those. Hey, I can finally talk to you guys. Oh, I can even sit. Gary and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail. Hey, are we cool? You were kind of coming at me pretty hard during that argument. I just remember, like, we're siblings, right? And you're all I've got left right now. And Jean's a piece of shit. <laughs> oh, cool. You got yourself another talking gun? And this one's green? Wow, who cares? No one. Oh, okay. Okay, that's fine. That's Be rude. Right. My name is Gus. Not that it matters to you. Like, she's kind of an asshole. She's like, be on my side, but also fuck you. You're lame and everything you do is stupid. <laughs> I'm okay. Sorry we roped you into another argument. I want you to meet Tweeg, by the way. I really think you'd like him. He's really nice to me and, well, he's helping me feel a little more normal. Even though his body doesn't make any fucking sense to me and he keeps trying to take me to restaurants that don't serve anything edible to humans, but... No, he's really sweet. So don't worry about me. You can focus on killing the space mafia or whatever. He's working here with me today and Colonel Pete Van Ryan selling the auction. But either one of us will roll along as rapidly as we can. Hey, you know, I appreciate you having my back, but uh, maybe your sister's right. Or not. What do I care? Team Gene, baby. Oh, damn. Blood harvest. Well, Red Letter Media is about to be watching this, so they already did. Wait, is it like the full thing? Or is it just showing me like the beginning of things? Instead of that slut school. I misheard the crap out of that. Another foreclosure? Oh God. Poor Dad. I know he has to represent the bank, Mom, but he hates doing it. He's lived with these people most of his life. Maybe I'll stop by the bank when I get in and get a ride home from him. Well, I've got to go. Give Dad my love and tell him to hang in there. Love you too, Mom. Goodbye. Why would you leave your stuff out there? Hi. Hi, 
Jill. How are you? Fine, thank you. Have you seen my dad? No, I haven't. Hmm. How about my mom? Yeah, this no, is right out of like Red Letter Media. No. Do you know where they might be at all? He may be at a meeting. I don't know. Okay. The acting is well, very thanks small. anyway. Have a good day. Sure, bye. Wait, what am I doing? Researches new products and innovations. The cloning and breeding of centipedes. So we're going right back to where we just went. I wonder how they're watching those old movies. A moblet! What's wrong? It's you, the savior! You know it, bud. Where's the rest of your crew? Oh, uh, it was awful. Everyone else got enslaved again, if you can believe it. Honestly, I think they like being enslaved. No, 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 hey, no judgment here. Everyone's got their kink. Where can we find them? They're working at Screndel Lab now, just past the Mushroom Valley here. Just be careful. That place is freaky. Hey, we appreciate it, bud. Okay, see ya. Mounting. Why touch the ground? Oh, it's not doing it. You mind telling me why the hell we're in this acid? I didn't realize I ran out of fuel by being a doof. Alright, let try that again. Time to use that scanner of yours. Oh, even the king got, or the prince got taken. <laughs> Not saying he deserved it, but uh, you know, act like a jerk, get what you deserve. Jetpack now. Alright, there is a spot on the far side of here. Where is it? It's there to there. Haha! <laughs> Show off those killer jetpack skills, bud. I like that. He's really sure. <laughs> Whoa! And, uh, now we're talking. Love that confidence. jungle breeze on my face. I can't wait to get back on the ground. <laughs> now this feels like the right way. Trust me, I can just feel it on my skin. Suck 
I like how you have infinite ammo in that way where you just have to worry about reloads. This crap would be real annoying to try to run around finding ammo. Oh, okay. I see where this was going. It's funny falling into acid? Stay alive. Here comes more of them. Feel free to switch out to one of the other guns. I can use a break. <laughs> I know it's probably weird for you that your sister is dating an alien, but you need to get over it. I don't care. I don't need to get over nothing because I just don't care. It's cool. Date them if you want. Don't date them if you want. I don't care. I'm pretty sure she's getting catfish though.
there's literally nothing. Okay. I guess that's You know what? I have an idea. Hey, we don't have to wait for this guy. Let's just open the door on our own. Check out that lug locks. Oh, what we... Item obtained. Beyond the Stars 2. Number 1. The Adventure of... The, the Adventure Begins, I mean. <laughs> Shy orphan farmhand Skloop Heptar watches a spaceship crash right before his Trompkin patch. Such bad luck. Those Trompkins were almost ready to harvest. I wonder, but I wonder if the pilots are all right. Yes. Yes. It's really important I get you checked in. And it's also really important that I finish shitting. Okay, okay, actually, I'm having a really rough time. J -j Just sit tight. Okay, okay, whew. okay, yeah, this isn't wrapping up my head soon. Uh, hey, buddy, may maybe, maybe you just want to take a nap? Uh, yeah, go ahead and just lie down on the floor and uh, rest up while I, while I continue skidding. And, and then when I'm done skidding, I'll... <laughs> Finally, what did I do to piss you off? Don't forget, you know, you, you can use those to launch yourself. Please just land, please just land, please just land. Hey, hey, quit sniping us. Not fair. Easy peasy. Loving the breeze. Jokes Just on you, I can slide breeze. cancel now, boy. Nothing better than the power slide breeze. Why are you getting up in my business? You know How many ways are there? Too many, if you ask me. Just ahead. That's what I'm talking about.
Yeah, break that shit. Beyond the Stars 2, number 2, I'll be a space captain. Skook proudly dons the dead pilot's gear and takes off for the stars. Looks like the ship also comes with a brand new sidekick, Flibby the Cloud Rat. Unfortunately, Flibby, uh, Flibby's a little too busy mourning the death of his best friend. Come on, Flibby, lighten up. It's time for an adventure. <laughs> Let's drink our way out! Start drinking! They say, let's lick our way out. <laughs> it didn't work that way. Dude, it's like right there. This shit is toxic, right? Yeah, I'm not trying to do it on purpose. Why'd you let me sit there gathering dust? Uh, do you think we can land? There we go. Hey, let's just use that zip line, bud. Science, huh? That was never really my thing. I'm not anti-science or anything like that. I'm not one of those crazies. I'm just like more into other shit, you know? Uh, I, I don't want to think about formulas or whatever, man. That's all I know about science, really. It's just that there's formulas sometimes. You know, it's like other things that I love that, that are not, not so, not, 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 not science related. I'm into shit like, like milkshakes and stuff like that and old TV shows, man. You know, I'm into that kind of stuff. You, you got a problem with that? You got, you gonna judge me? You right, buddy? You're being awfully defensive. <laughs> I'll try something. Can't get the timing. Okay, hey, there we go. Or it hit the rail.
Oh. Hello, and welcome to Scranda Labs. Only authorized personnel are allowed beyond this point. A moblet! You know her? Oh, you're the bounty hunter who stepped up and took charge in the office and killed my boss, Krubus. Very unorthodox leadership style, but you got results. Anyway, sorry, I need to let the G3 know you're here. Just my job, nothing personal. Feel free to have some candy. <laughs> you're gonna set off the alarm. Yep, I'm gonna set off the alarm. We've got an intruder. G3 Just are coming for you. Sorry. G3 coming our way, but those elevators are calling our names. Stay on the roof. Tag it, knifey. Did I forget to actually... You two. I forgot to shove your guys' stuff on. That's why. That's why nothing was working quite the way it was supposed to. I forgot to clip them. Oh, but that's no good. Now we gotta climb back up. Wanna use my disc? I shot his body off his eyeball. Ah, this yourself. Man. Welcome to the 
clearing them out. Now let's poke around and see what kind of weird experiments they're doing in here. This cannot be a good experiment. What's up, Rick? A shark-like thing and a... Would you like to do the honors? We're going to try to show up those cocky nerds in the weapons lab by fusing this human with some other aliens. Just hit the button. So you just let oh, anybody come in here and help with experiments? I'm gonna, be, I'm gonna be honest, we're not qualified. Look, I can do it myself if you don't want to. I'm just trying to be nice. Yeah. Sure. Oh, shit! Hmm, that wasn't supposed to happen. You hit the button? It's on you. That was on you. Hmm. I I'm not killing them. This must be rough to see, Bounty Hunter. I'm so sorry, bud. I don't know. Looks like a ball toy. Especially not the Scrandle Brothers. Thanks. Have a good day. This is our best human Fergal hybrid specimen. It may not be as cool as our subject in the weapons lab, but it's still rather beautiful, isn't it? We call it a fur man, or, or maybe a hurgle. I don't, we haven't decided yet. Why am I telling you all this? You know, to be honest, it's because you look cool and a little bit badass, to be frank. This is a dead human with a Fergal on top, like, like a toupee. Who's the scientist here, me or you, huh? <laughs> Oh, 
sounds almost like a zombie apocalypse going. Oh, what a fucking mess in here. Now this is exactly what I was expecting. Welcome to Scramble Labs. A proud division of G3 R&D. The lab is separated into three sectors. Hello, Jonathan. It's Dr. Gurgula. I've been asked to send you some of my findings on the human genome. It's only a small portion, and I doubt you'll even be able to comprehend what you're looking at. But I promised Garmantua as I'd provide them. And now please don't contact me again. I'm busy. Am I the only one getting bad vibes from the Dr. Gurglia guy? Is it just me? What is Gurglia? Is it what you, the, the sound that you make when you're using mouthwash? Huh? Am I the only one with fresh breath? Me, man. They're messing with Gatlians. Hey, 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 we got a breather over here. Is that the let's do it? I wonder if he's here. on me and fucked me up real bad in basically every way you can imagine. Holy shit, am I glad to see another Catlian alive in here? Uh, are there any others? Oh my god, yes, there's so many. Oh, but unless you've been alive, then no. These fucking G3 bastards. Creature, we're taking on the cartel. You want in? Oh, no, no, no. They take good care of me. Holding me against my will, cutting me open, doing experiments on me. Okay, you know what? Say it out loud. I think they might actually be bad. I'm part of your team now. Hell yeah. <laughs> Welcome aboard, uh, creature. That, 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 that's your name? I guess so. Oh, hey, we're locked in. But that's fine. Don't freak out or anything. I can give birth to a bunch of little freaks and they can disable the door lock. A it's fine. A bunch of little freaks. Oh, yeah. Ah, beautiful. Look how one of my little fuckers just saved us. <laughs> Being a dad is the best feeling in the world. Then a few seconds later, when your mutant kid dies because it has a microscopic lifespan, that's not so good of a feeling, actually. But I'm numb to it. Oh, yeah, that's one of my children. They die fast. Don't worry, it's easy to make more, and it feels good. God, I love them so much. Oh, fuck this shit. They grow up so fast, then they die. For your own being a dad, do Get not em. recommend it. I've had so many kids, and I'm gonna have so many more. You ever have kids? I recommend it. It's the greatest feeling in the world. Hurts to give birth to him, though. I don't want to be annoying, but you could use me to get into the weapons crafting center. Hope that's not annoying to say or anything. They got little butt cheeks. <laughs> They're adorable. Oh, it's like watching little toddlers with fucking alligator mouths running around. Yeah, look at their little teeth and shit. It's so fucking cool. <laughs> Why couldn't my sons be this badass? Stand a chance. Ooh, good choice, bounty hunter. All right, we're in. 
How was that? Was that helpful? Was it helpful that I gave birth to a lot of tiny guys really fast? Critters. It would make me so happy if you would just use my fucking trick hole. anyone before they fucked up my brain. Maybe I didn't kill anyone until I met you. Or maybe I killed way more people before. Never mind, it's not even interesting to me to think about this, actually. <laughs> this brain's a fun place. Just to jiggle Good job, guys. To be honest, uh, in Stranger's Wrath, this was actually a similar weapon like this. It was my favorite. Sorry. Holy shit, you killed everyone? Wow, you are strong. Good thing I'm safe behind this glass. Oh! Use one of my kids to fuck with that guy's mind. He'll go into a frenzy. Did I tell you they can do that? They can do that. Oh, you oh! Your tongue and up the sole if of your feet you keep piling my kids on top of a guy, they can do mind control shit. They can make a bad guy fight for us. Oh, shit. That mind control thing doesn't last very long. Sorry about that. I keep yelling at my kids to make it last longer, but they're shitheads. They do not listen. <laughs> put me in an airtight crate whenever they take me outside. And I really liked it. Yeah, what's breathing? Oh, I can help you with that little hook bug hide. Shoot my little guys in there. 
Look at my little guy in there rustling up the high. Isn't that cute? So proud of What's him. That? Oh, that's actually the water. Oh, okay. Hey, this is fun! Do you do this sort of stuff all the time, bounty hunter? Actually, I just realized I need to jump out there. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, let's go. Let's get the fuck out of here. That guy used to do especially bad experiments on me. I think. What the hell, man? Dude couldn't even defend himself! Sorry! Well, not really. I think I earned the right to fight back by getting tortured and experimented on. Hey, Brian, how you doing? You think I'm gonna answer your questions? <laughs> I would so shoot you right now if I wasn't strapped to this operating table. You don't look very strapped. Alright, well, let's go ahead. guys we just killed and I can promise you they were all a hundred percent evil yeah, let's see it says it's around oh there it is let's leave a note in case the owner comes back <laughs> creature entirely too nice <laughs> I dig it Last of the crates are supposed to be somewhere over here. Like Sweezy's always the right choice. See, dipshit, I always get you into the cool secret rooms. Which is normally a 
massacre that they did. I'm gonna give you the old reverse engineer rewind. Nightmare on Elm Street, more like Nightmare on U Street. Uh, whoa, what the fuck? One centime. Uh, hey. You know, it never occurred to me that you can just kill the bad guy. That's great. We should always do that. Oh, can we save these friends of yours while we're here? Help us. Please. Over here. Oh, I heard the voice. Do you have a way to rescue these humans? I'm new, so I don't know everything yet. Say help us, please, but I don't see anybody. I can't even... Unless I actually killed the humans, which I don't think I did. Yeah, there ain't nobody here. Ain't no darn humans. on trying to make sure I was slamming them. Get captured, I guess. <laughs> wait, wait, I see it. Wait, maybe. Actually, I think I was exploding up there. Watch. So you can kind of see it there, and then. Uh, 
it's hard to tell. I think it's off bottom. Oh. Yeah. Another wave? Another wave! Do you think we should kill them like we kill all the other bad guys we meet? to go back to your home base and regroup? I guess I'm the only one who thinks these guys are cute? No, I think they're cute. <laughs> Yay, kids. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I think these kids are kind of rocking. I gotta admit, it was getting boring in there. this bitch. <laughs> Do you know what you're doing? Of course. Hi there. I think it talked. Or that was one of the ones. Ah, oh, do we gotta kill these little cuties? You do not look 
good. Health-wise, I mean, look-wise, you're extremely hot. <laughs> My gun's giving me all these compliments, Panda. It makes me feel better. Oh, man. Oh, my phone. Oh, I'm having so much fun. I don't want to stop. But I'll... More guys coming our way. They're going absolutely nuts over there. Hit me up, yeah. I like bakery. Yeah. These guys rule. I know they're annoying and we gotta kill him, but they fucking rule. Look at them. Wrecking shit. Oh, so good. Oh, why did this appear as I got here? Decent gun. <laughs> Character doesn't grab and jump over things as much anymore, and it makes me mad. Instead, it uses my jetpack up. Loving the slide. I don't know if you knew this, but I can help you here. This is totally my thing. I'm good at it. Yeah, That's that. Angela Screndle. Want to kill him? Oh fuck! The bounty hunter. Oh, Angela's leaving. I guess he's busy. Bye, Angela!
That's what I mean, like, Nike's not talking. Like, it's really weird. All the other characters. I'm afraid. I am afraid. But Nike's completely, like, silent. That's for making my brain all fucked up! It's like they eat anything that moves and it's awesome. What a great reward we just got! I'm gonna rework your ribs! Kinda looks like early Kyler. Do they gotta heal? So dumb, I hate it. <laughs> Boy, if that ain't me in some games where I'm just like, you know what, I don't get heals, why the fuck do you get heals, cheater? <laughs> oh no. Okay. That's bad. Oh, yeah. well, Beyond the Stars 2, number 4. Three way from planet. Oh, from planet hell. Yikes. He looks old. <laughs> a good time was had by everybody but our little friend. Scloop. All right. Uh, Jazz and Captain Scloop bond over double teaming one of the ravenous fame beasts of planet hell. You're not half bad, kid. Maybe I'll join you. <laughs> it just looks like he had the worst time. I didn't find three, so I have no idea how I got to there. But so far, the story is kind of compelling. <laughs> I want to know what happened next. Creature, you can basically just run through this game. Hey, Brad! What do they got you watching today? Uh, I guess it's supposed to be porn, but it's like alien porn, so I, I don't know. I, I honestly have no idea what I'm watching. I mean, I was able to get off to it, like, after a while. Uh, honestly, now I love it, though. <laughs> uh, not sure why they want me to jack off this much, but, you know, I'm happy to do it. Like all the tentacles and the moving parts, it's, I don't know, there's something really endearing about it. Yeah, I, I like it a lot, actually. I mean, if, if I ever get out of here, I, I hope I can, like, bring this with me at least. I mean, I, I don't even think I could go back to normal porn after this. Nice! <laughs> Go on, have a good life.
lunch today. We can check after we kill everyone. Ah, uh, come on, lost him. Look, you got my number, but I'm still killing you. Drop the boom on him. Oh, wait, I see. Hi there. I welcome being killed. You're not even worth my time. You and me, two freaks. Shit, shit, shit. Sorry, I don't know if you consider yourself a freak, but I am a freak for sure. Your choice! What's a spindle? Ooh, you know I'm always game! Fuck you! Fuck! Oh, sorry! We can stop chasing you if you'd like! Jesus Christ, I, why is he still following me? Oh, he really doesn't want us following him. Maybe we should just go grab lunch. More guys! Should we fight him? We should fight him, I think. It's my hometown. I was thinking of Grundle, like some people call the uh, Taint the Grundle. Hi, Angela. Are you gonna keep running? I wasn't running. Oh, our misunderstanding. Whatever. Fuck you. You know, when the tongue starts going, it's a French kiss in. It's so great. Just don't hit the tongue, all right? I need to save that. The babes love my tongue. I don't want to brag, but uh, they eat that shit up like it's a sandwich. Hey, no fair. You can't re-goo. All right. Here comes another big one. Still alive! 
Did it just jump into the Oh, grinder? never mind. These scrindles seem hard to kill. Whoa, that was creative. That nice work. Oh, shit. <laughs> see how it makes it through the grinders. Perfectly fine. I don't think I could fall the same way, so I'm gonna try to find another way. Actually, maybe that door opens. Gotta admit, it was getting boring in there. Knife, are you ready? It's nice to just fly around, you know? Who cares? Yeah, I should have launched that first. <laughs> Time's up, motherfuckers. How's it going? What's going on? It's 
one's in a stink from the Bucks here. Oh, fuck! Whoa, whoa, oh, fuck! Oh, oh, you beat me, you son of a bitch! Oh, big whoop de doo huh? Who gives a shit? Fuck you! True form! <laughs> All right, let's fucking do it. Yeah, that's right. We got a secret form. Let's see you try to take on all three of us, uh, 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 you know, when we're connected. Oh, that's so cool. I didn't know you could do that. You never showed me that before. That kind of makes me feel left out, you know? I'm mad even. Try round two, electric boogaloo. Oh, I missed it. I just kill you. Come on! Let's do it! Alright! Let me shit out a bunch of my kids to help you fight! <laughs> Skull and peel apart all my brain matter? I want to grab one of those for myself later. Taking such good care of me in your lab. Fuck you! <laughs> oh, hey, oh, what the fuck? Why'd you 
with a support like that. Hey, Scrandall, what was the name of that scary medical device used to drill into my skull and peel apart all my brain matter? I want to grab one of those for myself. Wait. Say you're goofing. <laughs> Almost had him. <laughs> I keep getting really close. I think I can have my stage three. No, no. Like, look how fast I get damaged. That's why I'm like, I'm pretty sure it's like, yeah. I'm gonna go do something else now. <sighs> Almost got him. Just need to focus. Again for taking such good care of me in your labs. for myself later. Let us kill you, come on! Let us do it. Big attack! Big attack! You dumb idiot trying to fight the Scrindle Brothers. I remember when we were in the welfing box, we couldn't even beat ourselves fighting each other. And you're sitting here trying to fight us, forget you.
Oh, shit, I smell a corpse ready for carving. No, wait. Three of them? Fucking hell, what a feast! Oh, alien biology always. Uh, it's just, it's just fucked. It's just fucked, really. Good, delicious. Now let me dig into the last bro. Each one more visually better than the last. You know what? I don't see this often, but I'm fully sated right now. I actually need a rest. You there, bounty hunter? Mantuous? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I know who you are, and I want you to know how fucked you've made things for yourself. You were living in heaven before you meddled with the G3. <laughs> oh, okay, that sounds bad. Bounty Hunter, I've got the two most important people in your life, and I'm going to kill them. <laughs> oh, but not right away. First, I'll make things miserable for them. They're going to suffer as much as you've made me suffer. Uh-oh! I'm not going to ask you to like stop, not even my sister. but don't <laughs> you like listen. Some I'd just like to inform you that I'm going to make sure you die. That it's going to hurt <laughs> a lot. <laughs> Besides, you won't even be able to get to my new base on Earth without the proper coordinates. So just sit tight until I come to kill you myself. Sorry, bounty hunter. We'll stop him, I promise. Well, that was fun. Thanks for having me. Where do we go now? To your home base? You killed the Screndel brothers and freed us again. Thank you. Thank you. Stop getting captured. Everyone else is too traumatized to talk right now. Sorry. We just keep getting captured over and over again, you know? It's a lot to take in. I'm still able to talk because I've been captured the most. I'm just kind of numb to it now. Means nothing to me anymore. Don't worry about us. We'll find our way home. We just need a minute to catch our breaths and recover from all the trauma. It's a lot <laughs> of trauma. Trust me. I'm an expert in being traumatized. <laughs> okay. Seems like you want some kind of reward or something. Uh, because uh, we don't really have any rewards for you. We've been held prisoner for a bit and we don't really have anything. So uh, thank you. Is that enough? Ooh, actually, you know what? The trauma's catching up with me. I'm gonna need to dive deep inside my psyche for a bit and not talk anymore until my brain's all leveled out. I'm not gonna say anything anymore. None of us are. If that feels weird, remember, it's just because we're irreparably traumatized. <laughs> I said it before and I'll say you're it again. You're really on fire, He's aren't you? Obviously, you're not as good at bounty hunting as I used to be, but hey, I'm gloppy enough to admit you're doing pretty damn well. Turn in that bounty. Okay. Yeah. I actually wanted to run something by you. How would you feel about me maybe fixing up my old bounty hunting ads? Maybe putting you in them to drum up business? I mean, my name will still be bigger than yours in the logo, but we'd be stupid not to capitalize on your growing reputation. Yo, you guys are fresh out of Frendelos. Oh, hey, I I'm That's Tweeg. Sweet. I'm dating your sister. Uh, this fucking guy. Tweeg. You need to leave. Um, Lizzie says it's cool if I'm here. You're just gonna let this sack of shit eat all my friendelos and tongue kiss your sister? I'm the one who bought those fucking friendelos. And leave Tweeg alone. You know he has a barbed tongue and he's very sensitive about it. I can go. No, Tweeg. You're staying. 
tell him he's staying. Look, he doesn't even love you. He's just after our house. It's our house. Exactly. Hey, Tweeg, you gotta be careful around Lizzie. She's just gonna hit it and quit it. Real heartbreaker. I'd get out now while you're still in the green. And hey, you want a real lover? Talk to me. Don't you have a galaxy to fuck? Come on, tell him to leave. Thank you. I appreciate it. But honestly, it's my house too. So I don't even know why I have to fight for this. I'm just so pissed at everyone. Aww. Not you, Twig. I love you, baby. Ah! Disgusting! Look at this! They're not even the same species! Do, do you know how many holes he has? And they're all really advanced level holes. You mm -hmm. really gotta take my nephew instead. Every His holes are more goal. your speed. Shut the hell up, Jean. I am sick of your shit. All you do is sit on our couch and mope about how sad your life is. You're a leech trying to eat all of our friendalos and use the only family I have left to relive your glory days. Hey, your family's doing a great job. You know how hard it is to kill that many high-level bounties in such a short amount of time? I mean, it's not as fast as... I could have done it, but, uh... I know they're doing a great job, and I'm proud of them. But I'm stuck here dealing with you all the time, and you're fucking pathetic! Tell him how pathetic he is. Gene is pathetic. Gene is just working through some stuff. All right, come on. Don't make it sound so sad. Look, I admit I wasn't in a good place when you found me, but I feel like I'm part of your family now. I'm basically your dad now. It's you too, Lizzie. Days. I'm your dad. I'm just worried about you dating this weird freak who just wants to steal my couch away from me. You all right there, You can call champ? it your couch when you start paying rent. Until then, no complaining about who lives here. Lives here? He's going to live here? I mean, if you think we're ready, Tweeg. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. Hey, shut up, Tweeg. This isn't about you. Why? Because you're worried you'll have to share a cushion? <laughs> no! Because I... Because I'm concerned! You barely know this guy. I guess it it's wasn't dangerous a catfish. out there for humans. Oh, that's rich and condescending. I am not an idiot. I know what I'm doing. You're cool with Twig moving in, right? I don't want to seem like a dick. Good. Like I needed your approval anyway. This is a mistake. Oh, that's enough of this. Twig, let's go to the park. To <laughs> to to kiss. <laughs> yeah. Anybody got a fucking problem with that? Eesh. Sorry I said anything. Let's just get back to the bounty hunting. Can't wait to show you those new commercials. Okay. Anyways. Hello, valued cousin. Gary and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary Why found the so familiar to me? And broke his crown. And Jill came tumbling after. Gary and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary fell down. He broke his crown. And oh, it's from that same movie. After. But I feel like I've seen this yeah, on like Red Letter Media. Dispatch 146. You have a 1052 double VOA call at the Dickinson Farm on the meeting. Dispatch 146. You have a double VOA 1052 call at the Dickinson Farm. I almost wouldn't like legit just sit down and watch all this stuff on the TV. It'd be cool if you can kind of pick what's on it though. Oh, close. My little gang of blues. I guess they don't follow me. Let's go see what the pawn shop's got for me. Well 
welcome, welcome. Creature super ovaries. These powered up Gatlian ovaries will speed up creature's birthing process, effectively shortening his reload time. Childbirth is a miracle, and now it's even more of a miracle. Uh, womb chamber. With an extra womb chamber, creature can keep more kids alive at once. Each womb chamber means one more. Dad, I think this customer is gonna steal something. Job, don't say stuff like that. Alright, next so time, I'll just let them rob you blind. I'm sorry, <laughs> bounty hunter. He doesn't mean it. With this augmentation, creatures... Whatever, can... have fun getting burgled. <laughs> with this augmentation, creatures, minion, children will return to you with a gift of extra health after they get, get a kill. They do it because they love you so much. You've been a good parent. Alright, I'm, I'm actually probably going to get that. Postpartum psych boost. This adds a few wrinkles to creature's fucked up brain to boost his psychic connection with his minion children. With this, they'll be able to get back to mind controlling enemies a little quicker. Okay, so. Hey, bounty hunter! If my son says anything that offends you, uh, let me. Oh, what a buy. I loved watching you buy that. Hmm. All right, okay. a deal's a deal. No take backs. Now let's tweak the suit. This one does what higher? Goes higher. Yeah. Hey, bounty hunter! Higher. If my son says anything that offends you, uh, let me know. I don't care if I offend this piece of shit, Gublo. Jorb, how could you say such a thing? I'm so sorry, bounty hunter. They don't even know what Gublo means. That doesn't make it okay. Yeah. Just looking. Great, now I can keep... <laughs> well, that seals the deal. Another great piece of business. Yeah, same price, okay. Wonderful! Oh, oh hey, get sorry. your hands off. That's not for sale. Oh, are you still looking? Wow, how many years of college did it take for you to learn how to buy something? <laughs> oh, man. oh, nice. Just kind of kept doing its own thing, though. Seems like I guess there's a max height pass or just gonna miss. Gary and Jim went up to the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary fell in love and broke his crown. I'm gonna save it here. And Jill came tumbling after Gary and Jim. Okay, why didn't you tell me you had the sickest bedroom ever? Thank you. At least one of you has something good to say. Now, who's been eating weird pizza? Dispatch 146. You have a 1052 double VOA call for Dickinson. Is that a way to save? I'm gonna guess now. Anyways, that's gonna be it for me today. I keep forgetting that's not how I have to do that anymore. Anyways, I hope you all had fun. I know I did. Um, 
It's been beard. Later. Dad advice for today. Dad advice would have to be uh, for sure. Remember to save your games. Make multiple saves if you have to. And like really just remember that you don't want to lose five hours of game progress. Um, also this week I will be doing Fallout 4 as soon as we're done with High on Life. Which it looks like I'm, I'm going to guess we're around halfway through. Um, so we'll definitely be playing it tomorrow. And then um, yeah. Have a great night. See y'all next time.